Yo, what is up, chat? Very sorry about the late start, but we're here. We made it. Better late than never, baby, right? It's so good to see you guys tonight. Thank you so much. And yes, thank you so much for 50k. Some of you noticed that on Twitter. That happened during my last stream. Um, And we're about to uh, go nuts. No. Uh, I just want to thank a few people I'm seeing resubbing in the chat. You guys are beautiful. Thank you. Fat jokes, TC lords. Thank you so much. Uh, uh, Cole 10, the, 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 the TV is clean. Thank you. It's it's taken care of. Um, Papa, you have 50K. Papa has 50K. It's all thanks to you guys. Thank you, guys. You guys are beautiful. Star Luigi, Roswell, and Vixipede with the resubs. Thank you so much, guys. Come Lord with 16 months. Thanks, buddy. Uh, yeah, it's a huge landmark. Don't want to get emotional about it. Hello. Oh, that still looks like that. Whoops. Um, don't worry about the, the volcano back there, guys. Um, you guys freaking rule. Nep says it is 49,999 alt accounts of mine. <laughs> Yeah. Chan Man, uh, Bash, and Butsukoi, thank you for the resubs. Yeah, I mean, like, I appreciate that deeply. If you sat there and made, yeah, 50,000 alt accounts on my behalf, I, I mean, like, that's... Hey! We take those. That's a dub's a dub, all right? 50k uh, follows on Twitch is definitely a dub, so uh, we'll take it, right? Um, It's so good to see you guys. Thank you all for... Uh, for being here. Someone, they said, Mike, thank you. Uh, I, I, it, chat moved, and I don't know who said it, but they, they, they were like, thank you so much for streaming all the time. Fat, it was fat jokes? Who said that? I, well, no. It, it's thank you so much for watching it. Really. Thank you for making all this uh, possible, guys. Really, thank you for watching it. No, my, my, I owe you the gratitude, not the other way around. At all, not even close. Um, Bash Butsukoi, yeah, again, thank you. Cleesh Harrison, guys, thank you so much for the resubs. And Zafani, thank you. Uh, hey, Weevil, I'm so proud. I remember showing your Home Depot Neptunia ASMR video to my friends in high school, and they were disturbed. Thanks for um, sharing the content, getting it out, out there. That's... You know, they say that's the best thing you could do for a content creator is just share their their stuff and uh, get it out there and um, get as many eyeballs on it as possible. Better th That's better than giving a, a, a content creator, like, money, really. You're, you're helping them grow, you know? But in my case, it means so much more because I know that, it, that every time you show something that I made or did to one of your friends, there's a high likelihood that you're going to lose that friendship. So it's 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 extra um, impactful to me in my case, because I know that every time you do it, you're taking a big risk of polarizing somebody um, and and making them think that, you know, you have deep, deep psychological issues. Um, so I appreciate you guys when you take that risk. Daenerys, thank you for 16 months. Uh, Danny, my queen, thank you. Uh, I show them all the time. They know what you're about, so I don't have to worry about it. Okay, Wisp. Well, I mean... Showing this stuff to normies is, uh, is definitely a risk. But if you've been... If you've been doing it, well... Chronolog says, I've, I've shown Mike moments to two of my friends now, and they haven't contacted me since. Well, yeah. Sometimes if you want to make an omelet and all that, you got to cull the week. Uh, you know? Um... Speaking of calling the week, I think we're going to be doing a lot of that tonight with some of these mobile ads we're going to be looking at. This is, um, you know, a look looking at advertisements meta uh, on this website to an extent. Um, I will be that guy again and say that I was the first person to look at advertisements <laughs> for content. Um, and now I'm just uh, returning to something after it got more popular after I stopped doing it. Adoptive parents, thank you for 36 months, bud. Um, 
Twitch hard blocked a bunch of swear words for streamers and mods. I, I'm ho how are they how are they blocking me saying words? How are you? How is that? Did my my account just get get my channel just gets taken down like instantly? Um Just want to spend a minute again to, just, just to thank you guys for um Eric says, they blocked four aster asterisk, 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 asterisk. No, you spammed asterisk, in you? Oh, that's actually brilliant. Hey, you're, you're, you're a genius. Rogue, hey, happy birthday. Hap, 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 hap. Uh, yeah, I, I, um... When I started this Twitch channel, um, I was in a, a, um, I was in a place in, in my life that was not good, and I, I don't want to, um, I'm gonna go to a, like, a dark place here, but basically, I, uh, was not... I, I'm I I can see I know I knew that music was too loud. I is did I, is it fixed? Yeah, it's better. Can it be better? Okay, that looks good. Um, I was in just in a not so great place, and my belief was that I was uh, Pokemon thanks for forty five months. <laughs> Uh, I just felt like a person who had no, um, value at all. I think some of you, you know, and is, I'm not, I'm not trying to say this in like a joking way. I, 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 I think, I think I, I know that some of you are going to be able to relate to this because I think this is, this is for a lot of people. This is almost, this is almost a universal thing. Um, he, he had no inherent worth. I was definitely feeling, um, like I was without, yeah, I felt basically like a completely worthless human being. Felt like I had no value, um, to anybody in any way, shape, or form, and I, uh, I, I didn't really want to like live anymore, frankly. And I started doing this, and pretty quickly, I'm gonna say that that kind of, um. I don't know. You guys, you guys, uh, pr just proved me wrong on that. And I can't tell you what that really, um, what that really means because that's not, that's something that's really difficult to put into words. How grateful, you know, like I am for that. Um, I'm never going to forget what I felt like at that time in my life. And, um, Lux, thanks for the 50 months, man. <laughs> Um, yeah, I, I, I felt like despite everything I had, to, and don't forget, I did not start streaming on this website, this, this career, if you want to call it that. I did not start doing this till I was 29 years old. So up, up into that, that age, that's, that's late guys. Um, up to that age, I had been, I had gone through many, many, many disappointments and many failures at that point. So I, you know, that was easily, yeah, I mean, like, if you want that, 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 that's a rock, a rock bottom. I, I hope a lot of you never see where I was during that time. Melon and, and Deck M, thanks for six months. Um, I had tried and failed to do many, many things. Um, it was just, I was going really like nowhere fast. My life felt like such a fucking waste of oxygen. Um, and, I just want you to know that if any of you are are going through something like that right now, and, and and understand this too, at that time, okay, like I knew what, like I I thought I knew what this was. Like obviously I had a good friend of mine who was doing it, 
And and I I guess I I, I don't know I didn't I didn't really understand what it was, but I you know for, for I'm gonna say for like a while he Vinny had been trying to like get me to 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 to, to try this stuff for myself. Like he was having me come on his channel and and, and stream with him and, and, and all that. And I did a bunch of times, but ultimately I was feeling like it wasn't something I was ever gonna be. I was like, okay, I can't do that. You know, I can't do what he does. And basically what I'm getting at with all this is. Life, it, uh, uh, can really like surprise you if you let it. And, and and what I mean by that is like, for a couple years, I, I'm gonna say like about a year, maybe two years, I was totally like mentally closed off to the 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 um possibility of trying to do this at all. Like, does that make sense? Like, I was like, no, nah, I can't do that. I was just telling myself like I couldn't do it, you know. And I was really. I, I had like I had like tunnel vision just not to the fact that like I wanted to do something else because truthfully at that time in my life I was very like listless I was very um I was not driven by anything I had no idea what what really like I wanted to do or, or whatever except I was I was I was pursuing like creative outlets that weren't going to you'd be like you know um things I was going to be able to support myself with but I had like definitely blinders on to a lot of opportunities that were around me during that time. Um, I, and I never thought that like I would be doing something like this or that life would take the turn where like I would get to do something like this. Like it was the only way I got I got here, the only way I got better. And the only reason I'm saying this is because I think that there are some people out here who, who maybe that they could they could benefit from this. The only way I got better and the only way I I was able to like move from the kind of like the, the 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 stuck position that I was in was like by being open to new experiences by being open to new ideas and like when people were suggesting things to me and I was just like ignoring them and being like you don't know shut up and just you know I I think that you have to be open to things and you have to be open to the possibility that like there are avenues for you to succeed in life that you're not considering right now does that make sense that's all i wanted to say um because that's but me me just taking one of those things and saying like i don't know i gotta do it and, and, and don't get me wrong. I mean, just, I, and, and I'm not just talking about streaming. Obviously, obviously, you're, you're going to tell me that this had a, you know, there's a huge overhead to streaming. I, I'm, I'm, streaming is not specifically what I'm talking about. I'm talking about just in general. You know what I'm saying? Um, Super Dino, thanks for seven months, man. Appreciate it. So, just what I'm what I'm saying to you is, be open to things and just keep your ear to the ground and, and try to like uh i don't know um yeah and obviously when i started doing this i didn't say like oh i'm gonna become a a, a, a fucking full-time streamer and make a career out of it no it was like i'm gonna i'm gonna do this like you know something to keep me busy and like have fun with you know um that was like that was still that was that was a couple of years down the road where that where that shit started. But it was like just if I didn't again because the, I could have been streaming like a year or two sooner if I hadn't just been so obstinate in telling myself that oh that's not something I can do. That's not like I did with so many other things because there were other opportunities that I just didn't really you know fuck like, like take because I was being obstinate. You know, does that make sense? And telling myself, you know, like, oh, I can't do that. I can't do that. That's not possible. I can't do this. Starting is the hardest part with anything. Yeah. Uh, Muta, thanks for the 550 months. Point was, Deltron also at 19 months. I felt fucking worthless. And I thought that I always would. And right now, I don't. And that is because of you guys so thank you so much and again i'm just feeling like um if i could reciprocate that by just telling you giving you advice like like genuine like from the heart advice to to 
you have inherent worth, Michael. Yeah, I mean, I, I, you know, I had all these things that I had tried to do and like none of them were working out and it was just, it felt, life, life itself just felt so futile, you, you know, like futile, whatever. And just, um, and, and a lot of the times, and this, this is, this is kind of, this is pretty common with, there are a few exceptions to this, but when people, usually when people do become like, you know, when they find success with something, it's not with the thing that they thought or in like the way that they thought. Does that make sense? Like it's never in the way that you, that you think, like it's like almost like a, like a monkey's paw, but in like a positive way. I don't know how else to explain that. And all you have to do, really, is just kind of keep going and not give up and, like, have faith in, in, in yourself and not even necessarily whatever it is you're trying to do because the universe ha might have other plans. And sometimes you've got to just go with the flow. And just because something didn't work out doesn't mean, like, you failed in general. Maybe you failed at that thing, but, you know... You're not a, you are you yourself are not a failure. You're not. And um I don't know, that's the best way I know how to how to how to like I don't know, re reciprocate what you guys have done for me is just I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. I I maybe <laughs> I'm not a mental health professional. Maybe I don't know, I don't know. I I'm just sharing my anecdotal experiences uh with you guys, right? Have an op have op have an open mind to things that come into your space and like pay attention to the things that come into your space and consider like honestly like giving up on something if 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 something else seems smarter no matter how late in your life you are Does that makes sense I, don't know. I feel like I'm talking in circles now. But, um, guys, thank you so much for making this, uh, for making this possible for me. Um, I, it's, again, can't, can't put the gratitude into words, so, um, thank you. Anon, thanks for the gift subs, and, uh, Mo Rando with five months. I'm gonna do, uh, um... <clears throat> Some mobile game advertisements. I haven't looked at any of these, but first, I just want to give a shout out to the person who sent these to me. It was Gummy Worms. You are in there in chat right now. Gummy Worms is a legend for finding exactly 69 rancid is the word, as far as I could tell. Just look at the thumbnails for this. Vomitous. Vile. Mobile ads and mo mobile game advertisements and putting them into a a a just a zip and sending them to me, okay. Um, I don't know if they've included ones that I've seen. I don't know if uh yeah you you may yes you may see some games being advertised tonight that are very familiar to to you to us as a community and. Maybe we have to skip some of those. Um, you know, I mean, I think probably, yeah, I, th I think probably Vinny saw a, a lot of these. So if you watch Vinny, you've probably seen a lot of these already. I think, um, or Jer Jerma did this too, I, I think. So maybe some of these will be like reruns for some of you guys. But um, I'm looking through the thumbnails. I don't see a lot in here that... I've seen. So I, I've again. I ha I have not looked through through these. All right. I fur can. What's up? Thanks for being here tonight, man. My my pleasure, buddy. Um, gummy worms says I am a Vinny watcher. So I tried to find ones that Vinny didn't watch. Okay. Um, but keep in mind though that I mean I, I it, it, it shut her down. I can watch the ones that Vinny saw. That that's cool that you did that, but like if if I haven't seen it, it's new to me, you know. So, um, 
But that is, I guess that's kind of cool that we have some that's some that for a lot of you these are going to be premieres. That is cool. Um It's not like I would remember it. Well, I, I I imagine that when Vinny does his com uh, commercial chaos segments, it's probably similar to, to Finger Family in that, like, you just kind of enter a fugue state at a certain point where, like, your brain shuts down and you just fucking... You just go into, like, a fucking blackout. And, like, you just lose chunks of time from how, how many brain cells are being fucking... Ex just, just snuffed out from what you're watching. Right? It's a, it's like abusing alcohol, uh, or basically, or like Xanax, right? Anakin, thank you for the uh, resub. Don't skip any feet. I, I think there is going to be some feet in here. You guys want to see some feet tonight? I want to see some feet. This look. This is our first video. Um, oop. It, it's called Bonk as your lane, um, and I see a foot. I see a foot, like, right out of the gate. Um, so, so what, uh, so Azure Lane, I think, is, is it similar to, uh, to Figure Fantasy, guys? Is it, I, I feel like I've heard, why, why have I heard of this game before? Stay in your lane, Azure Lane. Something, oh, because this is the game with the anime girls that are that are are, are, are fucking navy boats, right? The, the the warships, like the like the aircraft carrier anime girls, the cowgirl with the huge tits. That's supposed to be like the USS fucking like Roosevelt or some shit, right? Static plays it. Are you here, Static? Do you want to uh, vouch? Airship anime. Yeah, we were doing a smasher pass one night and somebody included a image an image of an anime girl Who had f extremely fat tits like extremely fat milkers and she was wearing like a cow print bikini. I'm gonna say and Her name was seriously. It was it was like the USS uh, I don't yeah, like Roosevelt or something It was supposed to be some kind of and I was like wait a minute. How is that a how is that a boat? And chat, and chat was like, don't worry about it. The Japanese Navy ship Yamato. Yeah, it was like just... She's supposed to represent uh, the, the ship? Or does is it like Transformers? Do they transform into the boats, guys? What What's uh, USS Boat Milk? Like, what's going on? Like, cities in disguise? Like, what is this? She turns into the boat. They inflate into the boats. So it's it's not like a robot transformation. It's more like a, like her body just expands and contracts and kind of inflates and turn, until she is an aircraft carrier. Okay, when she becomes the aircraft carrier, though, is she still made out of, like, human flesh? Or is it... That's fucked, bro. She's still made out of human flesh, but she has like like her 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 tits are intact and just on the front of the boat, like those haven't been affected. Animorph, yeah, is it animorphs but boats? Like, how does it work? The, the lore is they are yokai who are the spirits of the ships. Turbo teen. I was thinking maybe like maybe uh. Totally spies like maybe that, that sounds like a totally spies episode right there, right? They're the souls of boats All right, let's find out this is uh yeah, Azure lane I'm gonna back that up cuz I don't I feel like the volume bar Nick, That is some insane jiggle physics, dude Bro tried to catch her cleavage in a Pokeball, and it just bounced off. <laughs> it just bounced off. Wait, is that... Yo, she looks stuck, guys. Somebody help her. Somebody help her. Yo, dude. Why, why isn't anyone helping her? 
They're just gonna leave her there like that? She's over. So this is a boat. Which boat is this? Oh, I know what this is. This is the uh, the Ever Given, and she's stuck in the Suez Canal. That's the uh, that's what they're going for, right? The bar on the left. The bar on the left is 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 a is a dick and balls. What it what is? What is it? I don't think that's a boat. No, that's a boat. Guys, this boat is is um. It's got life preservers. You know what I mean? Um, don't, 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 you, you should not worry about drowning on this boat, right? Um, it's got flotation devices. Someone send her a Luke. She could use a Luke. I'm gonna, why? I'm gonna watch this again for no reason in particular. Okay, let's just, I, I just want to get this out of the way. If you see, okay. Has anybody played this game? Can somebody get DLD, the Finger Family uh, Archival Project email in chat, guys? Can we get that linked? Many people in chat have played this. Does the game look like this? Because here's how I feel about it, right? If, if, if you see this advertisement... And you download it because you think this game this game is gonna look like this because you think your mobile phone is gonna be able to, to like support the graphics engine that will have dead or alive phys jiggle physics. He thought she was a lot punny. If you download this because you on your phone because you think that the game is gonna is gonna look like this, that you think the game can run like this, you are going to deserve being milk. I shouldn't use the word milked right now. Being having your bank account drained, uh, drained is bad too. Having every penny robbed from you by these people. Okay, like I, you, you deserve whatever happens to you if you fucking download this because you think this game is gonna look like this. Like who is stupid enough to believe? That the actual gameplay for this game is going to look like this. <laughs> what is that? What is that? What is happening there, man? You can't get, you can't catch people in Pokeballs, it's true. Why did, why is she eating her hair, bro? It's a ball, I, I thought it was a Pokeball. Like, it looks like a Pokeball to me. Like, is he trying to catch a Pokemon? Like, it, it, it's more like it's a billiards ball. Boing, <laughs> fuck. She's eating her hair because it's ramen. She's stimming. Okay, fair. She's got Pika. Because she's a Pikachu. That's why he's ch he's chucking a fucking... Chucking a Pokeball at her, bro. Watch the views climb. Oh, yeah. Do we... Yo, make this the thumbnail? She grew in popular... He grew in popularity from that. From what? There's a billboard... Right, yeah. So he chucked a, bill a, a billiards ball at her boobs. Guys, I don't recommend doing that. I feel like women tend to not like that. Uh, that's also, that's gonna leave a bruise, dude. Uh, Terry Quest, thanks for uh, thanks for six months, bud. The ad is showing skins, and they actually look like that. The cowgirl st stuck is the cowgirl you already saw. It's one. It it is one of the fairest free to play mobile games out there. Fairer than Genshin. All right. Well, you know, um, cool. You play it. Why do you? Why do you play it? Because it's fun, or because stuck cow stuck. She's got the horns and stuff. Wow. 
she's really stuck. No one is helping her. Bro, she's like a veal cow. Right? Like, fuck. Azure, what's up, dude? Azure is huge. Mm-hmm. Maybe, uh, maybe they want to do some, uh, some Jabroni mic sponsorships, man. Guys, how long do I, which, okay, which, which one do we want to be our stream thumbnail, chat? I think it's, I think it's this. I think it's gotta be this. Which one, dude? I think it's gotta be, yeah, it's gotta be this, this one. The stuck one? Nah, the stuck one. Hey, thanks for the bits, Neon. Yeah, we're gonna, yeah, 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 yeah. We're just gonna leave, we're just gonna leave that for a sec. Holy shit. This is, yeah, the boats. <laughs> they're boats. Can, can someone please explain to me how and why they're boats? Like, how is it, how is, how is this a boat? She's a rabbit girl. She's got bunny ears, right? Synergist, thanks for 15, uh, oh, 16 months, man. This is currently the thumbnail. Good, 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 good. They're good jinkas. Well, why is this? Well, well yeah, because the other one is a cow, right? Mike, the reason that you don't understand this is because you're a dino kid. Boat kids are a different breed. Guys, what do you think her breasts are named? I would not, I would not, I would not play this because I, I don't know, I have sex. No, I don't know. I don't know. First of all, I, I just, I know it's not going to look like this. Maybe, if, maybe if I believed it was going to look like that, I would play it. Okay. I wouldn't. And I just want to know, like, like how these, these, these fucking, and this is not specific to this game, but like these companies are basically doing false advertising. And then, they, they, like, aren't there laws for this shit? Like, when I download this game and it doesn't look like this, can't I just be like, hey, wait a minute, guy? Why, why is there a chat in here? Ego, thanks for fifty-seven months, bud. Thank you. Mobile games don't don't give a fuck. Stuck porn is the stream thumbnail. As a baby, I've been so stuck. Why? Please help me. I'm stuck. Oh no! Help! I'm stuck. <laughs> My boobies are stuck. Help! Oh, go away! Dijon, thank you for the uh, the gift sub, man. And also, Jojo, uh, jo Jojo, this is a fresh freak, freak who needs to be freaked up, guys. Freak him, please. Please freak him up. Alright. Uh. Okay, I need to put on headphones now. <laughs> no, don't you dare. You No. No. No, let the people that, that are in the room with you know what a freak you are for watching this. Let your freak flag fly. Fly. Fry. Okay. This happened to a different mobile game. They got sued, and to counter it, they added one level that looked like the ad. Is that is it who I think it was? Ebony. Uh huh. Okay. I see. I see. That's okay. 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 I mean, call me crazy, but why not just... Because they know their game doesn't look interesting enough to actually attract people. Like, attract people to it. Why do you think I'm waiting for this to become the stream thumbnail? Because I know that this stream isn't interesting enough to attract people on its own merit. Right? We're gonna, fu we're gonna reel them in with some false bullshit. Right? Um... I just can't believe they, they just get away with it, man. 
We're going to bait him. We're going to bait him off, guys. We're going to bait him off, guys. Um, Watch. No. Put the jabroni mic loud and proud. Put it loud and proud. Be, be, be proud of who you are. All right, and weed the weak people out of your life. That's that's that her fucking tits are too fat. I'm gonna tell you something. I, I I think I think she should be able to get out of here without help, though. Maybe her udders are in the way. Well, nice. Well, her udders are up here. How could she get out? She could just climb out like. How did she even get in this situation? Like, she's got the maid outfit on. So, like, was she was trying to clean something? Why would she do it this way? I'm Is there broken glass in her abdomen? I'm a little concerned. Mike, if you help her, she'll never learn. It's a sex thing. That doesn't look like a comfortable position to have sex in, though. Porn. Why is the phrase stuck porn so funny, dude? That's not a ladder. She crashed through the screen door. Yeah, yeah. How? She Because she's probably like really top heavy. She's door stuck. Everything is jiggling. Like every part of Every part of her is jiggling. This game makes more money than everybody here combined. Like, in, in a single day. In a single hour, this game mo makes more money than, like, our entire fucking combined net worth, bro. On fucking real, dude. On fucking real. Is it deserved? You tell me, man. I'm not gonna... I, I'm not... I'm not... I'm not passing judgment on that. But you gotta wonder what made what made Azure Lane like so much more popular and successful than the all the other like titty games like because this is a whole genre of titty game. Manda, thanks for six months. Appreciate it. Right, like what the advertising? The advertising, right? The advertising. Holy shit. Dude, this is where the money is nowadays in 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 mobile ads. Like, just fucking be, like, just create a mobile game with fucking anime tits, and it's like a it's, it's like a life hack. And then you just you just win, you know what I mean? Like, you just you just win capitalism. You know, it's fucking crazy. It's not even good. It's okay. People who play this, is the game any good? It's falling off. Samurai Edge Play says, no, this shit is falling off. It only made $12 million in February. Oh, it only made $12 million in one month? Oh, no. There's another game replacing it? That's okay. Those people never have to work again. Right? <laughs> it's okay. Right? Um, is it tied to crypto? No. No, no, no. Don't, do not fucking tell me next ad tonight, okay? Fucking shut the fuck up. I'm fucking, I'm in control. You're not. Shut the fuck up. People with a boat fetish usually work in high-standing Navy positions. So they can afford to have a $45,000 whale account. John McCain is probably a 1% whale in Azure Lane. Pawn Star, John McCain has been dead for several years. But interestingly enough, dude, there is a boat. There is an aircraft carrier named after him called the USS John McCain. Which means, theoretically... That there is a fucking anime girl in this game named John McCain. And is based on John McCain. The late U.S. Senator from Arizona, John McCain. John McCain in Azure Lane. John McCain in my Azure Lane is likelier than you think. Fate moment. That's fate. That's fate. 
John McCain with big fat fucking milkers. Bro, they gave her an eye patch too. They gave her <laughs> fucking. Right, he had an eye patch, right? John McCain is fucking. He did, right? His... No, he didn't. What happened? With him? Different guy. No, he had like a big scar on his face because he was in Vietnam and he was a POW and he got like tortured for like in intel apparently by by the Viet the uh, Viet Cong. He was like all fucked up and he had like a fucked up. Yeah. So she. So what if the anime girl has like the same scar? Right. Yeah, he did. He had a he 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 he. he yeah, they fucked them all up. Yeah. I, uh, okay, I have a friend that's a massive fan of this game. He's an engineer that works on nuclear submarines for the military. And boat freaks have big wallets. Dude, so he imagines that he's like inside the anime girls, like when he boards these boats. So this, it's like a form of vor for him. Right? Mike, imagine if your grandpa died in the Battle of Midway, and his only remembrance is the boat that killed him as a stuck porn girl in Azure Lane. Hey, there's worse legacies to have. Right? I mean, there's worse... I mean, I I'd be cool with that. Like, if that was the only way I was going to be remembered, I'd be, hey, at least I'm being remembered. You know? Um... Not awake yet. Thank you so much for the sub. Freak. This is a fresh freak. Mountain Dew was saying that that these these games like um, they kind of just come and go in like waves. What did you say? There's another one that like replaced Azure Lane. What's the, what's the, what's the new one? Do I, I was trying to read what you said, but then chat moved. I couldn't. I couldn't read it. The next one is N Nikkei, and it has fat asses. Oh, because. What happened was Blue Archive or Nikkei. Azure Lane went too hard on the tits. So, because they, they, they did, they did. Like, they just went, and this game is, they left a, they left an opening in the market for like fat ass, fat asses. Like the fat ass enjoyers. Like, if you're a fat ass enjoyer, you, you might not down, you might not play this. You know what I mean? Like if but if but a fat ass enjoyer, um, you'd be you'd be feeling a little a little bit like left out, you know. Um uh, why not both? The, the first game that ends up doing both will 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 reign supreme. Right? Um That's gonna, you know what? Maybe, maybe, maybe it'll be me. Maybe, maybe I, maybe I pour all my meager savings into a fucking, a new, uh, a new fucking anime titty mobile game. No mobile gotcha game. What do you think, guys? Prostitutes gotcha? This this file is titled Average Jabroni Mike Stream. All right, so did you see that? Is it music was re was DMCA and was replaced with a Pizza Tower OST. Gummy Worms, you're a legend. Thank you. All right, so they're making like a tie dye T-shirt, right? Okay, so you got yellow and then soak it, and then that's piss. <laughs> that's piss. Yeah. Uh, so, right. Awesome. Yeah, why though? Right? Why? Why though? Why? 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 Uh, why do that? Why do that? The videos are cut off at the top. That's because I fucked up. Should be better now. Um, 
What? Why? Uh, wow. Okay. Um. Hmm. Wait for it. What are we waiting for? We're waiting for this. We're waiting for th We're waiting for this. The patient will be rewarded, guys. Okay. Why is Rev dancing in a swimsuit? By the way, yeah, I, I fucking meant to say that earlier. Rev's not here. If you haven't figured that out yet, he had he had something to do tonight. He's got a lot of shit going on lately, guys. The guy on the right is is not Rev. The guy on the right is me. Man, why? Uh... Okay, can I ask a question, Gummy Worms? You, what what was the OG song that they that was DMCA? Was it like was it like a Taylor Swift song or something? Like what? A shitty pop song. So what is the game here? The game is, is, is called tie-dye. And you can... I guess the, the limit is your imagination. And the funny part is... These, these advertisers... Or I guess like these developers... Yeah, I mean like accurately predicted... What I, I would say like 99% of people would do with the game if they downloaded it. Downloaded it. I mean, like, what purpose does this game serve if not exactly this? And by the way, do, well, you have to ask yourself with these advertisements, is this even the game? Is this even it? Like, is it... Is this the gameplay? I'm going to assume it's not. You have to assume it's not. Dead K -R, uh, KG, uh, K, thanks for uh, 13 months, buddy. I appreciate it. Thank you. It almost never is. It's extremely doubtful that this that the gameplay would remotely resemble this. A five minute long crypto miner. I love this shit stain that like came all the way up to the front of the of the bikini. And they're just dancing in the in the I hate to admit this to you guys. This advertisement would get me to play this game. It would. This is my sense of humor. This is this is this this is the you know this is the type of shit I enjoy. I am the target demographic for this. He poops out the front. He wiped back the front. He did. Why? I, I don't I don't know uh hmm. Would you play it because you wonder what's going on, or do you just like the poo poo and the pee pee? A little bit of column A and a little bit of column B. Like that that's pretty funny that you could do that in this game. And and, and but again, like say I had say I was gonna do a, a stream where I had this game and they let you tie dye clothes, and that's what the game is. Okay. Chat, what is the first thing I'm going to do in that game? And in, in, in a universe where I hadn't seen this advertisement, or this advertisement doesn't exist, what is the first thing I'm going to do in that game? In that game, I am going to do exactly this, and you all know that that's true. Guys, I made a volcano the other day, and I made it into a cock. I, I couldn't not like like it's just that that's how I am. You know what I'm saying? Like if you give me the opportunity to do something like this, I am going to fucking take it. It's hardwired into you. It is. You all know that's true. Could be fun. Could be a fun game. I don't know. Maybe we got to try these games out one day on stream. All right. This one is called Booba. And it looks like I'm seeing some shit here, guys. I'm seeing some shit. It looks like shit, doesn't it, folks? Yep, it's shit. Yeah, cool. Seen a little bit of shit here, guys. Um, clean the picture. Oh my, oh my goodness. Gummy worms. Did you did you did you censor this or was the ad? Is that just the ad looked like that?
Hell yeah, I'm gonna install after that. The sensors are in the ad. Okay, thank you. Make her rich. She, if she was on a magic carpet? What is she doing? Tricky brain, tricky quiz, brain find puzzle. <laughs> what the fuck is this? This is name. Brain find puzzle, brain find. Yeah, I mean like, is, like like finding things. Find the brain. If you download this, you got no shot of finding it, right? I had to mute the music. Hold on. Yep. There's two audio tracks in here. There's there's two audio tracks in this advertisement. The fuck? I like the little applause after you clean off all the shit. Make her rich and she's on a magic carpet. So what I don't understand. What's the game? Just cleaning shit off of women? You, okay. So, so you draw they're all angry. And you draw the pole uh so she can start pole dancing. But it's like Could you have drawn something else? Like would it have worked if I just drew like a jackhammer in her hands. You know, like if I had gone for like a Rosie the Riveter approach here. You know what I mean? Like, what if I had just drawn like, um, yeah, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like, scribble knots for horny people. It's a puzzle. There's only one solution. Like, it won't work if you do anything else. Yeah, draw a college degree in there. Yeah, what if, you, <laughs> what if I did that? So I think the implication here is that she's getting fucked, like, over the, uh, the chest. But the guy's, like, he's too stupid to, to, to like, uncover the dude standing there. Is that, is that what's, is that what's happening? But you're going to be smart enough. You're not going to be stupid. You're going to be like, I'm going to do this. Right. Well, shit, I guess there's only one way to find out. We got to We got to download it. Play it. <laughs> Tricky quiz. Find brain find puzzle. Brain find puzzle. And what's that thumbnail? Somebody is just like pointing at her tits. Like he's like boop booba. Right. You got to find your brain if you download that. Okay, this is called BR... B R B R L R R L. I don't know what you're referencing there, gummy worms. But um. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> that was Robert Pattinson. She got the squirt. It's P. No grave route, bro. She's fucking dead. She died. You blew it. You lost. <laughs> She's dead. She's dead. Insert fucking. Insert five ninety nine Bitcoin to revive her. Yeah, Project Makeover is brutal, right? <laughs> Blue cheese, my best love. Help her. Uh, yeah, help her by putting her in, 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 in fucking... 
institutionalize her. Actually, guys, she's a fucking convict to start with. Wow. Dude. Did she just did she break out of prison? And then... And then <laughs> Actually, yeah, but she was serving a hefty sentence for, um, I don't know, d d breaking into cheese factories and jumping in the vats of cheese. Like, she was a... <gasps> this has got to be sexual, right? <laughs> it's like fondue kink. Wait, what is this? The fondue fetish? Okay. And she's stinky. I like how there's a poop button. Like, what happens if you... Please, please, please use the poop button. Please. Dude. I gotta download this just to find out what the shit button does. Dude, do you, like, do you fucking, like, hurl, like, fucking turds at her? Is that a, like what? Like what does it do? Like you just fuck fling shit at her? That's awesome. That's what they want. It's working. It's working. Yeah. Why did he take a, a hooker to a cheese factory? Oh, some they said XQC brought a hooker to a cheese a cheese factory, and the con a convict ruined the date by jumping into the molten cheese. Bebony Sauer says, I play the game, and the game is nothing like this. Wow. Wow. The game is a shitty Candy Crush. But then how do they, again, how do they not get fucking sued, or at least, like, fined by the government? <gasps> you, you are fucking falsely advertising, again. I gotta know what the shit button is, bro. Huh. The loopholes for it being free, but it isn't free because it has microtransactions and shit. In-app purchases, like that's and free to download. Mm -hmm. The shit button doesn't even exist. That's so sad. Guys, I went to a party city the other day, and I had to take a dump in the party city. It's likelier than you think. I went into the men's room, okay? This was a single occupancy bathrooms. I went into the men's room. There was fucking shit smeared on the walls. I was like, I am not. There was shit on the floor. And I said, okay, I am not shitting in here, okay? I took a peek in the in the, in the women's room, and it you know it was it was it was empty and it was clean. So I shat in it. I shat in it. I got went in, locked it again. Single occupancy bathroom. Nobody was coming in there while I was shitting. Okay, no woman was gonna come in there and, and see and see me shitting. Okay, I went in, locked the door, took a fat shit. When I here's the thing though, here here's here is where here's where it got, in my opinion, like ethic the the it became like ethically a, a problem. Um. The toilet wouldn't flush. There was something wrong with it. It wasn't, it was like, I guess it was broken. It had like a motion sensor flush and I put my hand in front of it and it wouldn't flush. Plushy, thanks for 74 months, man. So, uh, I had to, I had to leave it like that. I had to leave, I had, just had to leave. I felt terrible. I didn't want to do that. I had to leave it like that. So like I just been thinking about some woman going in there and, and and finding that, like just finding that, talking like, like anaconda logs, right? It was bad. Why didn't you take it home with you? I could have fished it out, put it in like a plastic bag. I could have done that. Um. Just thought you guys would like that story. I I just I I again okay just, just putting this out there. If anybody um, found that turd, I'm really sorry. It's been weighing on my conscience. Consider this like a fess. You know, like a, like a fess hole. 
I remember Fest Hole, the Fest Hole Twitter? I'm putting this out. I just want to put this out into the universe that I have actual remorse for doing this. I'm very sorry if if some if you found that, I'm really sorry. Okay? Um just say that that that's it. I just wanted to put that out there. I doubt the person is here, but it was just weighing it was just weighing on my conscience. Shitter's remorse. Are you that's, re that's real. Uh, this is the video is called "Definitely Not a Scam." Are you done with those fake cash game? Let's delete it. Many people come. That is that'll work. I mean, you that is one way to to, to uninstall an app off your phone. Are you done? It's gonna uninstall all the apps, but it will work. With those fake cash game, let's delete it. Many people complain about overflowing fake cashing games. They cannot withdraw money it's at all. Absolutely fraud, and it hurts players. That's true. Annoying. Therefore, it's a real fraud. I recommend you to download Lucky Tile. Once done, you can get twenty dollars prize directly, and you can win three hundred dollars every day if keep playing it. The promotion just starts. It's very easy to get the reward. Many people have withdrawn the money. If you still have doubt about it, why not just tap the button below to download it? Take a. Seems legit. Let's fucking go. Are you done with- Seems legit to me. Those fake cash game? Let's delete it. M are you done with those fake cash game? Many people complain- Many people are saying- About overflowing fake cashing games. They cannot withdraw money at it's all. It's absolutely fraud and it hurts players. <laughs> Annoying. Therefore- And we're not doing that. I recommend you to download Lucky- I recommend you to download Lucky- right, Once done. You can get $20- Why did the voice change, guys? Why did it, why did it change, why did it change? What was the purpose of that, right? Prize directly and you can win $300 every day if keep playing. $300 every day if keep playing it. Man, that is fucking depressed. That is fucking bleak, dude. Th this, this advertisement is fucking bleak. Jesus Christ. The promotion just starts. It's very easy to get the reward. Many people have withdrawn the money. Many people have withdrawn the money. If you still have doubt about it, why not just tap the button below to download it? Take a- That is fucking deranged. Holy shit. That's the mobile game ad equivalent of like the Nigerian Prince email scam. I love how they destroy a phone in the beginning of this advert for no reason. Are you done with those fake cash game? Look at that. Why not get a job? Right, you can get, get a job. I found the ultimate life hack. It's called getting a job. Let's delete it. Many people complain about overflowing fake cashing games. They cannot withdraw money at it's all. It's absolutely fraud and it hurts. Crypto bros being like, bro, did you know you could just go to a place and like, you know, work there and get money Players. like that? Did you know that was an option? And I didn't. Annoying. Therefore, I recommend you to download Lucky Tile. Once done, you can get $20 prize directly and you can win $300 every day you keep you playing it. Farm shrimp and make money. Bro, I'm like, bro, I, fig I figured out a total life hack. Just have a shrimp farm in your basement. It's like super easy. You make tons of money. You, that's good. You you have a small business now. That's not a life hack. Bored Lizzie, thanks for 18 months. The promotion just starts. It's very easy to get the reward. Many people have withdrawn the money. The shrimp market is about to go nuts. That's what I've heard. Especially if the shrimp are fresh. It's called IRL mining. You use your body to mine for currency to then buy crypto. To then buy crypto, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, they unironically they no, they unironically call it mining fiat. That's what they call jobs, mining fiat. That that they don't call it work. They call it mining fiat. I'm not fucking kidding. I swear I've I've seen like Twitter threads of crypto bros talking to each other. That's how they refer to it. If you still have doubt about it, why not just tap the button below to download Mining fiat. I swear to God, that's what they could. I, I, am I joke? Am I joking? Mining feet fiat. Wages be mining fiat. Yeah. 
When think about it, all all they have to do is just tap the button that below to download Take Lucky Tile. I, and that's it. Uh the name of this video is Dog Fetus Dog Life Simulator. I have a feeling we're about to watch something extremely disturbing, guys. Ooh. Celebrity family or millionaire family? Look at that dance. Classic or spicy? Spicy dog food, guys. You choose. Uh, so probably we don't want to choose the spicy one, right? The that's oh fuck. All right, so that's it. But hold 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 on, dude, because all right, okay. Frankly, again, if I was playing this game. I would be choosing the, sp the spicy dog food because that's fucking it. because because that because I'm a fucking child and that's funny to me. But what the fuck is that? Look at that. So you pick the breed and then you just keep clicking and it, like you could see the fucking like the fetus develop. That is fucking gross, bro. Katana Squirrel, thanks for us. Uh, 66 months, man. 66 months, my Maharaja. Wisp, we got another one that you got to ban, Maharaja. The fucking fetal puppy, dude. Look at the dance. Guys, can't dogs not even, like, taste most things? Like, don't, do they have, like, a totally different, like, 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 fucking taste bud system going on. Like, they wouldn't even taste f spicy food, right? That's cats. They don't react to spice. Birds can't taste spice. Like, yeah, I mean, all, all, I don't know. Would, would, would a dog, would this happen? Would he be like, oh my God, that's too spicy, Raggy. Run, 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 Cowan, thanks for 62 months, man. Oh, I hope you feel better soon, but no, this is not real. You're having a fever-induced delusion right now. Run, run, Draggy. Yeah, I, I've never seen, like, spicy dog food advertised, you know? I, I love the shit streak. Like, I love that the, the dog immediately starts sh fucking, like, liquid shitting and having an itchy asshole, like, the second it fucking eats that. Puma, thanks for uh, 25 months. <laughs> yeah, there's gonna be psychic damage tonight, but I don't think it's good. Guys, we we this community and myself have developed a very strong fucking immunity for psychic damage. We've been micro dosing for fucking like a year now. Like seriously, how long have we been watching Finger Family videos? Okay. Like we've been we've been micro dosing here. Okay, that's why someone was like one of these advertisements broke Vinny. Yeah, like Vinny sees one of these and then he's got to be in like a padded room for like a month. Like not nah, we're we're this is child's play for us, right? They got to put him in a straight jacket and let him cool off. No, 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 no. no. I actively want another episode of Family Guy. I'm telling you, dude. I am going to... I'm going to finance another... Like, I'm going to directly... Directly send him, uh, like, cash to produce new episodes of Family Guy. I'm thinking about it. Okay? None of these come close to the one that broke him. All right, maybe at some point tonight I have to watch the one that, that broke him. If it's that, if it's that good, okay? 
Do you guys have the, do you guys have the one that broke him? It was bad. All right, maybe I got to watch it then. I think you sent it to him. No, I only ever I only ever sent him uh uh, figure fantasy advertise. I sent him like four figure fantasy advertisements that one time. That was it. I, I never sent him anything else. I would choose the spicy again. Okay, this says Dumpy from a game called State of Survival. Oh my God, is State of Survival the one with the, with the twink and 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 his fucking like like um his like fucking. Like weightlifting, uh, like what's the fucking word? Like his top or whatever. The zombie thing with the, with the twinks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Twinks versus zombies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, they got some good ads. Let's see this. Congratulations on moving. And some hell hell of a housewarming party here. Again, not remotely representative of the gameplay whatsoever. Did you hear that? He went full uh, naked snake for a second there. Nathan Drake? No, naked snake. They're no clipping. It's amazing that even the fake gameplay is is like fucking like animated incompetently. Right? Like, again, has anyone played this? State of Survival had a licensed crossover with The Walking Dead. It had a sort of funny but awful live action advertisement. Why did it need to have a crossover with Walking Dead? Uh, because money? But it, think about that, though. It's like... Oh, God, like, oh, your IP has zombies. My IP has zombies. Let's do this. It's so fucking unnecessary. It's like, oh, you got zombies? Great. Yeah, 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 everybody has fucking zombies. And imagine being impressed by that. Like, who the fuck? See, this is what makes me mad. Like, like this, this fucking ecosystem, ecosystem exists because of stupid people with money. Like, that just... Fuck that, okay? That makes me fucking mad. Like when you saw that it said Walking Dead, like you saw the words Walking Dead, and you were like, <laughs> click, and installed it because it said Walking Dead. I hate you. If you did that, I actively hate you. State of Survival Zombie War. Yeah, it's, 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 fucking nothing here was relevant except that. They just get you with this. First, you had my interest. Now... You have my attention. Walk, uh, a walking stupidity. Walk, okay, aggressive stupidity. Aggressive stupidity. Help! He could have shot her. Fuck, you think it's sped up, but this this is actually, like, the pace of the gameplay. It is sort of similar to the actual gameplay. Yeah, this feels like I'm on fucking meth right now, dude. Why is it so fast? Quartet, thanks for three months. It just feels like I, I, I snorted meth. This is what this feels like. The hyper stimulation, dude. In meanwhile, in game, it takes you an entire day to cut down one tree and get like five wood. Yeah, but that's why you pay for the boost. You give, you give like three dollars, and he in, he instantly cuts down the tree, right? Imagine that is how the fuck do these people get away with this? Who? 
the fuck? Imagine valuing money that little. Like, who the fuck values money that little? Like, like, like fucking rich people? No, because no, 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 not rich people. That's abs that's a hundred percent incorrect. It's called being a spoiled child. I I I I feel like a spoiled child is gonna have better taste than this than to even fucking play this, right? That kid that kid's gonna have a fucking like he's gonna have a PlayStation Five and a fucking you know three thousand dollar gaming rig. He's not gonna fucking touch a mobile game like this. They want to protect the twink. Funko Pop oids. Your nephew played Stumblement. Yeah, maybe more like, I, I don't know, like. My dad spends hundreds a month on phone games for some reason. What the fuck? Why? Like, again, it, it's preying on people with addictions. I mean, it's got to be like, like, what is like, what did your what does your dad do for fucking work? Like, like, what is it? You know what I mean? Like, you could take, like, okay, so if I could pay $5 to fucking boost the, cut, the cutting down of a tree, or I can spend that $5 on, like, you know, going out to eat. Like, I know it doesn't cost $5 to go out to eat, but, like, you know what I mean? Like, like, like who the fuck? Also, rich, rich people don't spend money on things like this. That's how they became rich, chat. They hire addiction specialists to learn how to better exploit people. Holy fuck. <clears throat> Kerbussy, thanks for eight months of support. Appreciate that, bud. Um, like, what the, I, I, again, like, like, you know... What do you do, like, as a career, you know, where you slave away to, 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 to fucking, like, bring home the fucking bacon or, or whatever and just... And then you just spend it to, like, make a tree get chopped down faster? Like, aren't you, like, like, doesn't that bother you? Like, you had to work for that money, man. Like, what the fuck? Oh, well, we can have less groceries this month and the rent can wait another five months. Anyway... Time for more mobile games. Wargun, thanks for seven months. And Jesus, hey, thanks for 17 months. <laughs> like, just... The actual fuck, dude. It, it, it is a very, very, very upsetting feeling, guys. It is, it is very, very, very upsetting. Um... Sometimes, see, like I and I've, I've I said this in our Discord server in our announcement channel, but like these people, yes, I get paid by I get paid by companies sometimes to stream their games, and I'm I'm starting to feel a fucking ethical quandary with this, um. You just described a gambling addiction. Once you spend $5 on these games, you feel okay spending more. The first purchase always gets you. Weiss, baby, thanks for five months, man. I'm splurging on uh, Tears of the Kingdom, uh, Gigi said, but I rarely spend that much on a game. You, you can't make that comparison. Come on. Like that's okay. That that's fine. It's it's an expensive game, but if you listen to the ads, if you listen to the 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 um the sound effects, it's it's the same sounds that slot machines make in a casino. Like it's like the it's it's the psychology of like you know the exploiting the reward center of the brain. And all that shit, right? But again, it's like, 
If I go to fucking Las Vegas and I put like, you know, a hundred dollars on fucking, you know, the, the roulette wheel or whatever. There's like a chance I could double it or something. You know what I mean? But like, and that's exciting. But when you pay fucking five dollars to make a, a tree grow faster. You, you didn't. You're not getting that five dollars back. You know what I'm saying? Like, the fuck? Like, what? Like, explain that. It's because what you can then able to do, what you're then able to do with the resources afterwards? All right, this says Egg Hunt Identity V. Identity V is a 1v4 asymmetrical mobile game. Join the thrilling party now. Huh. <laughs> Where is the Easter egg? Dude, 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 dude. That's fucking like that that's that's uh that's Johnny Depp. And that's Helena Bonham Carter. And that's like, like, like fucking, uh. That's Orlando Bloom. And that's also Helena Bonham Carter. <laughs> right? It's, a, it's like a, a, a Tim Burton fan art. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Adrian Brody. Yeah, you get my point, though, right? If Tim Burton made a mobile game. Nope. 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 What the fuck did we just watch? <laughs> What's that? Where is the, the, the nope? Where is the nope from? I, 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 I know it's like a meme nope. Team Fortress 2? Okay. Eggplant insults you. Okay. Oh, finally, I'm alive. Let's match my color. Oh, finally, I'm alive. Let's match my color. Just mix the right colors and we can go home. Add more black, don't you see? I'm not that blue. It's getting worse and worse, although it's the simplest level. Next you'll have to choose between four or six colors. How are you gonna do it if you can't match only two? That's not rocket science, disappointing. The tomato was right. The tomato was right, what tomato? Oh, it, uh, oh, oh, so it's color man. Guys, I want you to, um, I'm gonna play this again, and I want you to imagine the text-to-speech voice is like a shitty Justin Roiland character, okay? Oh, finally, I'm alive. Let's match my color. Just mix the right colors and we can go home. Add more black, don't you see? I'm not that blue. It's getting worse and worse, although it's the simplest level. Next, you'll have to choose between four or six colors. How are you gonna do it if you can't match only two? That's not rocket science. Disappointing. The tomato was right. It needs more stuttering, though, right? Turn myself into an eggplant, Morty! The pickle was right! I'm eggplant, Rick! Evil... Okay, this is the... listen to the name of this file, guys. Evil Piss Sperm. Snake Troll Theft Master. Evil Piss Sperm. Bro, her tits are red. <gasps> what fucking happened? Uh, uh. What the fuck is this? What is this? 
What the fuck did we just watch, dude? What is this? His his troll fit. He's got a troll face. The sperm. <laughs> yeah. Dude, this is fucking bad. So, I, I, it, this is a thinly veiled porn game. Yeah, okay, what, explain this though. What is this? It is, it, it, it is. You said it's a fucking evil piss sperm. There's really no other way to describe that. It's the giant sperm colored like piss. For some reason, he's going up, like, he's going in her clothes. I thought he was going into her vagina, guys. <laughs> and she starts screaming, like, 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 sexually. <laughs> yeah, that's fucking porn. That's porn sounds. <laughs> he stole, he steals her bra. Holy shit. <laughs> And now you're trying to, I don't know, replace her clothes. What's the game? What's the fucking game? What even is the game, bro? What do you do? What are you supposed to do? Like, are you the sperm? Are you the the, the character? What to take off next? Is this... I know this is a long shot, but has anybody played this? Pac-Man fell off. <sighs> And then what's this bit? You, you control the sperm. You have to trace a line to get the sperm to the bathtub. What am I supposed to be looking at right now? That's a, that's a Wapowski. <laughs> Holy shit, it is! That's the Swayzo from Monster Rancher. Oh, it is. Yeah. Well, it, it, the, the Swayzo is, is a Cyclops. Right. Holy shit. What's up with his face, by the way? Check out this character's face real quick. That's some, like, fucking Ed, Ed, and Eddie looking face right there, right? What a disturbing fucking uh, concept. Snake troll, it's called. Like, we're supposed to believe that's a snake? And you play as a sex pest who's a giant sperm. Guys, that's not, has this guy seen a snake? You have to play some of these for a stream? Well, I mean, like, I'm not fucking installing this shit on my fucking computer, dude. I mean... You know... Hmm... I, actually... Can I can I see something real quick? Yeah. Okay. Uh. Cause cause I have a an emulator, right? For for mobile games. Um. It's called. It okay. It's called Snake. Troll Theft Master. Th okay, I got, I got, uh, I, 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 I think it's Snake Troll Thief Master. It has 10 million downloads. Dude, this is it. We're, pl we're playing this. We're playing this right now. We're playing this right now. Yeah, we're playing. <laughs> we're streaming this right now. <laughs> We're gonna stream this right now, guys. Uh, the 32... Okay, 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 okay. Cool. Made in Unity. Alright, guys, is this, is this game... Snake Troll. Is, 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 there's two. There's a pink sperm, too. 
Okay, guys, is there anything in here that could cause problems? Chess saying I'm gonna get banned because there's fucking there's TOS in here. All right, start. All right, guys. Here, here's what I'm saying. Your the sperm has to get to a monkey in a tree, and the, and steal his banana. I guess. I mean, I don't know if I if I grab the banana, and like the monkey's cock pops out. Like maybe that'll be a problem. I don't know. I don't know. I'm I'm gonna do it off screen in case the monkey's cock pops out. Holy shit! Look at the gameplay. Look. Look, look, look what happens. Guys, there's no way this is going to be a TOS. He, he is like stretchy. His tail is stretchy. The sexual content is behind paywalls. App store policy. His face. <laughs> his face. <laughs> look at his face. <laughs> look. Look. Oh, man. Right, and then the monkey is crying. Okay, great. Look. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> all right, all right. Next stage. Okay, this is stock porn. The next one is stock porn, guys. Yeah, it's stock porn. You gotta help me. I'm stuck. Yeah. <laughs> Did you hear that? No, it's not stock porn. It's not stock porn. They just made me watch an ad for another game. Is it? I just watched an ad for another game. Is what it was. Is what it was. Because there's a fucking. What did you did you hear it say? Help! I'm stuck. Did you hear it? Because the audio is doing some fucking dumb shit right now. Did you hear it? All right, choose. Stop. I have to. I have to choose. Wait, is this the game? Save her from the heat. I think I'm playing an advertisement. Okay, here's what happened. You 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 get forced into a fucking advertisement. This is how fucked this is. You get forced into an advertisement, and then you have to like play to continue. And basically, you get you, when you try to play the game you immediately get taken to the to the download page for the for the other for the other game so you download one, like say you see an advertisement and you download the game you all you did was download the uh, 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 several more advertisements that you get forced to click on when you play it it's like a self cannibalizing ecosystem i don't i don't know how to fucking explain that Right? Like, you just... Mike, what was that flash? You saw a flash, guys? An infinite fractal of shit. Like, you're forced to fucking play the advertisement to, 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 to progress. And then you can say, it's like, ooh, a new game to download. 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 And on the and it's funny because on the on the landing page for the game, it also advertises like this is not play. I can't fucking play this. But it advertises like the ability to pay them to remove the advertisements. Hey, Noop, they said, I used to work uh, in the free-to-play mobile games industry, and that's exactly what it was. It was a hall of mirrors, as far, also as far as cloning gameplay and advertisement went. That's the, that's the whole game. That's the whole industry. That is so fucked, bro. Holy shit. Do you guys... Remember the story of demon sperm? The legend of demon sperm? Do you guys remember the legend of demon sperm?
My five-year-old nephew plays around on my dad's tablet and downloads every single game he sees an ad for. It took me an hour to delete them all last time. Because you download one and it rams more ads in their face. I saw my, my, my nephew on his tablet once was playing this really shitty fucking, like, I don't know, Marvel, like, Avengers game. And it was just... Every time it was like a fighting game, so you would have like a like a like a fucking two second like fight, and then he would ha he would be forced to sit through like four minutes of Ed's, and he was just happily doing it too. Strange Rope Hero is the name of the game. No, it, 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 I, you want to hear something fucked up? I actually think it, it, it I think it was Lice Marvel licensed. I think whatever he was playing was actually Marvel licensed. Brain rot. Yeah, that, his brain is fucking soup now. And he's just, ha he's just happily watching advertisements. And, and, and he thinks, like, that's normal. That's why when Nintendo starts putting, like, like fucking, like, ads in, like, Breath of the Wild 3, okay, or whatever the fuck, his generation is just going to be like, this is fine. You know, you know what I mean? Like, it, cause they're, they're being eased into it. They're being eased into that shit. And I want you to imagine, you know, you're on the toilet, you're looking at, you know, you're looking at your favorite, you know, your favorite OnlyFans page or whatever, and you, you know, you're going to rub one out, right? You got your favorite OnlyFans creator up, you got to, you're taking a quick moment of, of, of solitude, okay? Checking out her OnlyFans page while, page while you're pooping. She looks fucking, she put up a new picture, it's got feet in it or whatever the fuck, you know. And you're like, oh, this is great, I'm gonna rub one out. So you start rubbing one out. And all of a sudden you feel an immense pain where you're just like, Fuck! It's like a, an immense pain like, like in your balls and like at the base, at the base of like your dick. Oh! <laughs> the fuck and you look down like at first you were feeling it was feeling like you were gonna nut but then like you look down and you see like something emerging from the base of your dick like and what i mean like something imagine like you ever see like a snake swallowing like like a rat or something like what it looks like as like there as it moves down their body that's what it looks like and you're like huh Oh, and you're like in, in, in immense pain, but like you just have to keep going because there's nothing you can do. You just have to keep, you just have to keep jacking because it's like too late to go back. You know what I mean? And it just keeps working its way through and it's like immensely painful. And it, look, it looks like, yeah, it looks like a snake swallowed a football. And you're just like, argh, argh, argh. but you just keep going because you know that whatever this is has to come out. And it gets to the tip, and it's like you know you, you you know you get like like the birthing canal opens like right, and there's something white in there coming out. There's something white, and it becomes clear. You're in immense pain, okay? And it becomes clear that what it is is a giant sperm. This happened to my buddy Eric. This happens to a lot of people, actually. I'm talking a yeah a sperm that's like the size of a football. Okay, and as soon as it get, it get it gets out, right, like like three quarters of the way, and then it starts gasping for air. Well, not gasping for air. It's more like a sound. Like it's like. <laughs> Like, think like fake Pepino. Remember the, the noises like fake Pepino makes? It starts like shrieking like that, right? And it, it fucking like, it, it, the, 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 you know, the tail just kind of like <laughs> slides out like spaghetti. You know, that's the tail is, is the easy part. And then it hits the, it hits the fucking tile floor like. <laughs> like with a thud. It hits the fucking tile floor. And cracks it like the the, the, the the tile floor fucking shatters underneath it, and now it's flopping around on the floor like, 
and its tail is like freaking the fuck out like and it's like it's like like it's the tail is whipping about violently and like it catches you on the leg and like it draws blood because of how fucking in, like intense it is you know and then your mom hears like the tile <laughs> the tile breaking and she's like Reginald are you okay in there and you know you're just like yeah mom fuck off oh my god yeah get yeah of course of course get out of here yeah, leave me alone, God, Mom. Oh, God. Reginald. I don't know why it's Reginald. And meanwhile, th then this this thing is violently flopping around on the floor. What do you do? Go. What is your next move, chat? What do you do? Jesus is watching you, Reginald. Flush it down the toilet. That's not fitting down the toilet. Next. That's not fitting down the toilet. That ain't going down the toilet, bro. That's not even close to not even... That ain't fitting. No. I, I'm telling you, it's the size of a football. You just gave birth to like a football-sized sperm. What are you going to do? Apparently, you know how you know how like they say it's he it's healthy for men to to jo. This is because if you don't, this is what happens. Like if you go like this is why you're not supposed to retain because this is what happens. Like if you go like a couple of months, this will happen to you. Someone in chat said buy an aquarium. Okay, actually, not bad, not bad, not bad. It, not a bad idea. The dark side of retaining. Tell my mom to call the doctor. Sounds like the creature from The Visitor. Me and my friends have been posing this hypothetical to people since college. It's called the demon sperm hypothetical. Like you just, you describe it exactly that way. Like that's how it's described. I described it perfectly by that. I didn't forget any aspect of it. And then this, this is a very old thing that we came up with in college. How has this not come up before? This is the third or fourth time I've, I've brought this up on stream. I wonder if Vinny remembers the demon sperm hypothetical. I'm going to ask him about that when I see him. Um, Cause, it, cause he was involved in the, we we this this was like you know, this was our friend group was talking about this in college. Um, yeah, this was the same. This was the same friend group that was talking about this. Um, this is a Junji Ito story, but this was before we even knew about Junji Ito. Um, I found a clip of you discussing this with Rev. Yeah. I think my move would be fill up the bathtub. Because don't forget, this is happening in a bathroom, right? That's that's the setting. Fill up the bathtub and then chop. But he's a, see, he's a sperm. Like, is he necessarily going to survive in, like, just in, like, tap water? He might just die. I want to keep him alive because my plan is to, is to, like, take him on Oprah and shit. That was my answer. I was like, I'm finding a way to monetize that. You know? Like, I'm going to find a way to take... Yeah, I'm, I'm taking it on Ellen and everything. And I'm going to be like, look, look, came out of my balls. Look. Poop knife, 17 chunks down the toilet. <laughs> okay. And you know what? I'll never forget. When I saw Prometheus. And I was like, duck, 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 that's it. That's the demon sperm. That's it. Because Prometheus has the demon sperm in it. I think that the, the 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 top answer for most people is actually like they take like a potato masher and just like fucking mash that thing into a paste and then fuck down and then down the toilet like a potato. I think a potato masher is the one. Yeah, yeah. Go ham with a with a potato masher. Take it to Maury. You are the father. <laughs> Apparently, giant sperm is an actual thing in hentai comics. God, no part of this is supposed to be sexual. It's supposed to be like funny slash disturbing. It's not supposed to be like it's supposed to be hot. Like the fuck. 
Number 15. Honestly, if I ever saw that damn thing in my living room, I'd stomp it until it was a small white stain. <laughs> Uh, that's what macrofalco sperm are like. Oh, d dude. Okay, let, let 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 let's figure this out for a second, guys. Because for for your sperm, I, I think we could figure this out with math. Need one. Thanks for nine months, buddy. For your sperm to be the size of a football. How big do you have to be? Like, how much do you have to be scaled up? Because don't forget, it's a cell, right? Like, that's tiny. So you would have to be, like, fucking planet-sized or something, right? Like, you'd have to be, like, yeah, fucking, you have to be, like, the size of Jupiter, dude. To have sperm that big, right? Like, 10,000 size. Cells don't scale with body size. But what if they did, though? Fat Earth Theory. <laughs> Mike, you've asked this before. 80,000 feet is the size for, sper for sperm. <laughs> for sperm as big as a small dog. Mike, you've asked this before and we've done this before. <laughs> we already have the data. We already have this. You've asked this exact question, and we've already run the calculations. <laughs> Man, that that's bad. This is the worst deja vu. <laughs> Holy shit, man. Why is he like Cuphead animation? Like, look, no, he's not really. Flying Fettuccine has a great answer. I would call up the lady in the radiator from Eraserhead since she stomps a mean sperm. <laughs> I fucking... <laughs> I fucking forgot about that. Yeah, remember that shit? Oh, my God. Um, All right, guys. It looks like we got some Amo, Amo guy over here. Uh, am I seeing that right? Uh, the name of the uh, file is Finger Family Core. Guys, how are they? Uh, oh, Christ. Guys, how are they not in fucking prison, dude? What the fuck? Is Bro, they stole the they stole Among Us. They stole Choo Choo Charles. Like this, this is IP theft. Like people go to jail for this, though, no? Like, no, seriously. Like, what the fuck? How are they? They don't care. Because they're untraceable, I, I, right? They, they're out of the reach of like copy international copyright law, China. Right? Holy shit! This is just yeah, blatant fucking. It's not even like a little guy that kind of looks like Amogus. Like holy fuck! What's up, Twink Master? He said this is why capitalism doesn't work. What was it? What was the, the the last time somebody said something like that like that in this channel? What was it? It was uh because oh they said because I was mad that that wax got spilled on my t on my on my TV. I got liquid wax on my television, and chat said that it was capitalism's fault. Do you remember that? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
They were like, capitalism, I can't believe capitalism did this, Sedge. Sedge. Yes, I got the wax off, yes. I b blew that out of proportion completely. I overreacted to that. I know, chat's gonna be like, no way, Mike overreacted with so about something? No, uh, no way. No way, no, no way, no way. Yeah, yeah, I overreacted about, horribly about that. Um, most of these games are headquartered in Virginia. Well, this isn't headquartered in Virginia. Chew survival imposter shoot. They, I mean, it, it, it is a fa finger family core because they're just fucking stealing whatever IPs they want and slamming them together in some kind of fucking vomitous cocktail. Hey, Skip Man. Mike, for your sperm to be the size of a football to scale, your average human male would be nearly 300 times the height of the Empire State Building. It's so best. So cool. Dude, not only that, but isn't this gameplay, like, exactly Choo Choo Charles, except, like, 2D instead of, like, in, like first person? This is Choo Choo Charles. Like, Choo Choo Charles, if I, I didn't play Choo Choo Charles. He chases you, and you have your own train with a gun on it, and you shoot him. This is, this, this is Choo Choo Charles. Except fucking 2D side-scrolling with the mole guy. Oh no! Oh. Mike, this math means that a busted load could submerge the entire state of New York in seconds. Imagine, like, what would that would be like? Like, there'd be giant sperm, like fucking all over. You'd be in a in like a like a like a miasma of calm, and there'd be like these giant sperms, like f fucking swimming around you, like piranhas, like trip, like ripping out chunks of flesh. That'd be fucked. Imagine. Mike, stand up. I'm not reading the little fella. You fucking, you did horribly. I saw it. They even stole the Among Us music. Choo Choo Charles would have been better this way. Guys, think about that for a second. Like, when you blow a load, like, onto the carpet... There's, there's like, little mites and stuff running around in there. All right, there's little, like, creatures running around. There's, like, micros got tardigrades and stuff running around in there. And if you blow a load on that, that's what you're doing to them. Microbes, yeah. That's fucking crazy. Think about that, right? I feel like Joe Rogan right now. Like, is, is they just... That's fucking crazy. Wow. Jamie, pull up giant sperm. Mike, why are you blowing a load on the carpet? The carpet. One time, I was at my friend's house, and we were gonna we were gonna play uh, Halo. Do you, okay, guys, we were gonna play Halo, and I sat on his computer chair, and he was like, "You don't want to sit on that, bro." And I said, "Why?" And he was like, "Because if you zoom in on that, it look it's like sperm blood gulch. It's blood gulch for sperm." And I got out of the chair. But like Blood Gulch was, it was a Halo scene, right? Or something? Like it had something to do with Halo? Blood Gulch, he said. Yeah. It, it was a map. And it had a lot of bodies on it, I guess, because that's what he was implying. It had a lot of bodies. It was a flood site. That, that's, yeah, yeah, that's what he was saying. That's what he was saying. All right, so 
here's a ad for a game that we all love. Hero Wars. It says, get revenge on your ex. <gasps> and, I mean, I played Hero Wars, guys. And I don't remember... I don't remember um, anybody getting cucked by a horse. I don't remember any equine cuckoldry when I played that game. Get revenge on your ex. I don't remember this part of the game. Guys, I don't remember this part of the game. Maybe we didn't get far enough? Back in the 90s, I was in a very famous TV show. <laughs> and now I'm in a very famous mobile ad. G gok, guys? G gok. B block? <laughs> Sock. Sock? He became the Hulk, yo, fat TV. <laughs> oh, he's getting revenge by graffitiing his house and destroying his, his furniture? <laughs> and then he blew himself up. Failure. Guys, if you were playing that game, would, 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 you, would you deliberately place the TNT barrel on yourself? <laughs> Guys, I think that if somebody cheats on you with the horse, um, the horse sex is probably its own punishment. Right? Um... Mr. Hands, allow me to introduce you to Mrs. Hands. Mike, I just looked this up in Tardigrades Love Cum. It's nu nutritional and proteinous. Don't feel bad about flooding your carpet with cum. They microbes love cum more than your mother. I find it amusing that the horse is wearing underwear. That's a nice touch. Like, usually horses don't wear underwear, right? Wow. Hey. <gasps> so you got, like, some macro kink uh, to start here? And, and how are these creatures not dissolved by the um, by the dragon's stomach acid, right? Because I feel like they should be, right? Oh. I guess what? I did forget to put that. Remember I put it on the to-do list to put that on the soundboard? I fucking forgot. So. Did I order the tea? Actually, yes. Yeah, so the tea's on its way. Ah! 
the, the see like this is not remotely representative of what this game was like this fishing mini game wasn't in it like there was no yeah yeah okay to be fair that is in it that yeah that is in the game okay that is in the game that is in the game <laughs> Wow, look at that. Look at- Whoa, she's presenting. Can you, can you fucking imagine for a second though? Like... If the gameplay was like- if this was the game? If the gameplay was like this? That would be fucking psychotic! Like how is it gonna how is it gonna be this? And 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 this and this and this and that wait, what the fuck? <laughs> yes, have you guys noticed the um the file name? Is it possible that it's parodying these types of ads? I'm gonna, I'm gonna be, let me be honest with you. Um, if like, I, 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 I see these sometimes, and I think to myself, there's no way it's not self-aware. Okay. There's no way it's not. There's no fucking way that it's not. It can't be. I don't. This this is not a good a good example of it. But like sometimes some of the maybe maybe there will be good examples of of this tonight. Right. But I don't, this is not, so, sometimes I, when I see them, it's like, dude, you, you have to know what you, do you guys remember the video with, with Family Guy with, um, when, when Quagmire is like stealing Lois and P, and Peter's like, Lois, you can't cheat on me with Quagmire. And Quagmire's like, yes, I can, because I have, I play figure fantasy and I have 20 million power level in figure fantasy. Remember that one was fucking awesome. Mike, uh, there's a trend where purposefully bad ads get more people to try your game than real ads showing the actual game. Enough so that many mobile game companies do this shit. I mean, like, dude, did I not download and play the sperm game? For that exact reason? Everything I'm fucking seeing right now, and none of it is, is gameplay that I saw in that game. None of it. None of- not any of it. <laughs> Society is heading down a dark, stupid path. That's kink shit. <laughs> we are going to be in in a future in a future. Oh God. In a future where I mean I don't I know I'm not I'm not trying to 
invoke like idiocracy or, or, or whatever, but like we are going to be in a future where I really want you to think about this. Like I, 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 I broached this. I'm going to leave that there for a second. But new, new thumbnail. I kind of like breach this topic when I make the jokes about like the future U.S. senators and shit like that. But we are going to be living in a world within the next decade or two where people are going to be so fucking stupid. They will have been rendered so mind, so brain dead. That like, worse than today. I know it's people saying like, oh, the future. No, 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 worse than today. Worse than today. Where like, if you have a single brain cell, you are going to be like a god amongst men. Like, does that make sense? Like in a land of the blind, like the one-eyed man is king or whatever the fuck. You, you know, you know, like, like. Just, it is really, really, really fucking concerning. And I'm not, I'm not, I'm not trying to like doom. If anything, I'm saying there's opportunity in that for us, you know, because we're, we're the last generation with, with the functioning like brainstem guys. And I mean, like, I know, I know I'm, I'm saying that about myself. Okay. I, I, I hold on uh lumpy. Thank you for eight months, bud. I'm saying that about myself, Kappa. And it's not that I'm it's not that I'm smart. I know I'm not smart. It's just that it, it, everyone else is so staggeringly fucking stupid that like it, the, the the bare minimum will will look like Competence, you know what I'm saying? Like the the, the bare minimum will, will look like the greatest effort ever made. You know, like Mike. Not everyone watches the shit we watch. They do though. That's the thing, right? You're watching this right now. Yeah, but my my listen. Here's the difference. My formative years were not shaped by watch looking at shit like this. Okay. Nintendo, thanks for the gift sub. We're watching this ironically. I mean, I, I, I get this creature off the screen. No, I think it's making people come in because people are like, "Oh my god, this!" Yes, yeah, no, no, it's working. It's working. People like it. People are seeing it, and they're saying it's making them click on this because they like that. They like that. They like it. Yo, great intro to stream. People are clicking on this because of this. I'm leaving this here for another like five minutes. Somebody chat said, I, ca I can't believe Mike is on ironically having this conversation. Why? Because it's a, it's a kids these days thing. I'm doing a kids these days thing. I mean, yeah, I am. What of it? Does that really bother you? Is, am I wrong? Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm fucking wrong. A ripe future for the bot takeover. Well, that's a whole nother flavor of doom right there. That's doom of a different stripe right there. Um, my people said the same shit in Latin 2,000 years ago. I saw a really interesting article about that recently. It was using a bunch of historical examples of people complaining about, like, you, you know, like Pliny the Elder writing about how, like, the next generation has no respect for anything that matters and they're going to ruin our society. But you know, the thing is about all those people, like, and, like, like, like Mozart writing about like, you know, modern music. He was like, music today sucks. They don't, or like Beethoven or so whoever the fuck it was, like some classical composer was like whining about like, you know, what like the kids were listening to and how bad it was. But it's like, 
Guys, all their all all their civilizations failed. Okay, they weren't wrong. They were all they were all right. Yeah, they all of them were correct. All of them were correct, guys. Austria still exists. Okay, okay, that bad example. The 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 the, the, the fucking Greek empire is not a bad example okay their, their society ended okay the cat boys are at the gates guys we're gonna be sacked by the cat boys the barbarian cat boy tribes you guys ready to get sacked by cat boys and yes that does mean they put their sacks their ball sacks on you And yes, that does mean exactly what you think it means. It left a noticeable impact. Yeah, but it still failed. Greece still exists. Okay, you guys are you guys are just too dense to have this conversation. You, you guys are just not. You guys you you guys don't understand like like context. Like I just fucking I give up. I fucking give up. I think you're just wrong. I'm wrong about what, Herg, specifically? What am I what am I wrong about, Herg, specifically? Can you be more specific? What am I like what 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 specific point am I wrong? Like like people being too stupid to carry on civilization forward? Like it being the end of humanity because people are too stupid to survive? Humanity peaked in 1997. That civilization receding is a failure and not a normal part of its life cycle. What it okay. No, the, the the woman shitting on screen is 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 very is very um is very deliberate, guys. Um I mean I don't I don't I don't I don't know that it's not. I don't I don't know that. I don't know that it's not. Do you want everything to grow forever and shit has to decline eventually? I mean, like, I I know that. I, I know that. But I, I'm just I'm just saying that it's happening. I'm not I'm not I'm not talking about like the reason why it's happening. I mean, we're not really you and I are not really in disagreements about about anything. I mean, like me, you could you could maybe point to 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 factors like the, like the, like this, you know. I mean, like this this <laughs> What if this, what if this wasn't happening? Would it slow the decline? Would it would it reverse it even? You know, like what if we didn't have this? Like this. What if we didn't have finger family YouTube videos? Right? Would that maybe would that slow or would would, would that slow the decay? Right? Would it? Um, do you want to do you want to do you guys actually want to watch this video what if what a philosophical and and educated conversation this is what a what a super educated this is such a big brain conversation right now to be having right previous civilizations declining came from the fact that they were playing a zero sum thing with a lack of modern technology the modern global society is economically positive sum which while bad for the environment currently is very good for incre increasing quality of life and civilization Wow, what a, what a what a what an interesting perspective from somebody named Benito Mussolini, and their name is spelled M O O S E. So like, if it was a like 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 with antlers, moose. This is a really big brain stream. This is the smartest stream on Twitch right now. 
right? This is the smartest, most highbrow, educational, thought-provoking stream on this website right now. Right? Look at this. I was, I'm just stalling because I want this. I, I this need this needs to be the thumbnail for like the next twenty minutes. Like I want this to be the thumbnail. Remember when I was on Twitter and I got in an argument about the national debt crisis with somebody named Shrek's Piss Slave? Guys, maybe Shrek's Piss Slave isn't worth. Maybe their opinion doesn't need to be respected. Maybe their opinion doesn't doesn't have to have doesn't have to get like equal consideration. You know. Then the then the guy not named Shrek's piss slave, right? Did they have an anime profile picture? I think if their I think their profile picture was was like Shrek pissing in someone's in someone's mouth. Need one. Thank you for the gift sub to Philosophy Tube. Thank you. This is a Philosophy Tube stream right now. Mike, you have gained over 200 viewers since this has been the thumbnail. Uh huh. I love when people go into serious conversations with their stupid ass profile name. Well, that that's my that's my absolute fan. That was my point. By that was what honestly that was the only reason why I read Benito Mussolini's comment out loud. I would have completely ignored it if his if his fucking username wasn't Benito. Like, sorry, it's not like what you said was stupid. It was just. It was just, I enjoyed the, you get it? Okay. Yeah, no offense. Right. Don't change it till I'm finished. All right, now we have to, because I'm getting concerned that people are actually masturbating to the, uh, to the video. It says, God is shit fast. Let's play it. Oh, he's getting closer, dude. Dude, it's Pizza Face. It's John Pillar. Oh, he ran out of time. Oh, you're trying. She was trying to get ready for the date. So what's the problem? She's like constipated. Guys, it's too loud. It's too loud. It's too loud. Oh no! <laughs> Hi, friends. Did you have a lot of fun with the videos? Do you want more? Subscribe to our channel to have more fun with me. Click here to continue watching more such beautiful sing-song rhymes. Okay, um... So she's constipated, right? Like, she's constipated, she can't shit. Javes complement oublie ses rendezvous. All right, can anybody translate that? We got any Frenchoids who could translate that? What is what, what does that say? I had completely forgotten about this date. Oh shit! La Habalair. Does it say help her? The solution is to put duct tape on her leg hair. I like how she's shitting into her skirt like a poop hammock. Yeah, dude. Um, she's... What is she doing? I mean, I, I is she, is she just not shitting? Like she's just sitting on the toilet, like to take a break. Well, well, th dude, that's the thing. Her underwear is down. It slides down her skirt and onto the floor. Maybe she's got like a little zipper in the back of her skirt for like, like it's like it's like a sh like a like a poop zipper. 
So like there's a little gap in the back of her skirt where like the turds can slide through. Or like a little ramp, like a poop ramp. Mike, look at the floor. Is that piss or is that like, is that liquid shit? What is that? What is, what is that? She's trying to make it bounce. She, right, so the skirt acts like a trampoline. That's the, the hair, right? <laughs> Guys. How many of you, okay, would knock on the door, right? The door opens. You see your date like that, and it just, if anything, makes you more attracted to her. Okay, here's my here's my fucking question for this chat. Who's stopped by that? Like 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 who's not gonna take her on the date because of this? She's not afraid to show her true self. Guys, she shits. Okay? She shits. This girl shits. Like I don't know how I don't know how to tell you guys this, but but some, but women shit. Guys, I'm so sorry. I gotta be the one. It's like telling a it's like telling a kid there's no Santa Claus. Fellas, women shit. Guys, women shit. They do shit. I like men. Men also shit. See, I told you this is the most educational stream on Twitch. I want to see, I, I want to see, you know, yeah, like Hassan talk about these things. He's, he's, he's too much of a coward to have conversations like this on stream, right? It's too much of a coward. Kill the imposters. It says Gushin Gun Granny is the name of the um the file. That's a grandma? Okay, so it's like a horde survival game, but you play as a grandma against like Amogus zombies. Or <laughs> some shit. The fuck? Why does that exist? What? You know, honestly, it doesn't look that bad. It's called Granny versus Imposter. Why a granny? Is this like some IP I don't know about? Like, is this some kind of like like fucking algal vomit IP? Like, is this like like Poppy's Playtime or some shit? Does the game actually look like this? Do you want to find out what it looks like? We could, dude. We could we could find out what any of these games look like. That's the exciting part about the stream right now. We can actually play any of these. Jarpis, thanks for six months. Oh, hold on a minute. The game is still running. The fuck? It's called Granny vs. Imposter. Let's see if I can find it. It, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're get, I'm I'm installing it. Gr it's called Granny vs. Imposter Spy Master. Crypto Miner. Guys, should I not be installing these games? Like, is this actually this is this is not a good idea, is it? There's also a Garten of Rainbow Monsters. What is that? Like Garten of Ben Ben or whatever Ben Ben. Mike's apes will be gone. Guys, my apes? Game gem. Okay. There she is, Granny. She's got a hundred next. Alright, so Granny's ice cream gets abducted by a UFO and she chases it. Swipe or drag to change lanes. 
That's it? Where's the Amoguses? Oh my god. So it's not so it's not even a shooter of any kind. It's it's a, it's it's like a a subway surfer type thing. What the actual All right, hold on. I, I, this is oh, 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 Okay. 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 Oh, 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 oh. She's shooting at nothing. Granny is shooting at nothing. Granny is shooting at men, dude, like soldiers. He's <laughs> fucking like actual GIs, right? Like, or... what the fuck? Like infantry men. There's, there's a tank. There's a. <laughs> it's a tank. <laughs> Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, uh all right. I, I would like to have that. Can I have that, please? Okay. Granny is too tired to continue. See and Ed to help her. No. Guys, by the way, it was extremely difficult to control Granny. Like, she was really slippery. Okay, if I press the home button, there is no... I, I don't have to see an ad. There is, they're not showing me an ad. No, they did not show me an ad, to be fair. Grandma got run over by a tank. Actually, she just got shot, so... She slides. Granny slides. It's weird. She's slidey. Guys, where are the Amoguses? <laughs> Fuck, Granny, back it up. Crackdown, he says, NGL, I would play this for an hour. Now, Granny controls like shit, dude. Okay, and then there's... The, okay, so there's a green play button, and there's a home button. So what do you think happens if... I, pu I press the green play button? Advertisement. Uh, you're like a hand ghost that's a barista? Guys. They... Do they put it in there, guys? Not much. This is the game that where you put it in there. This is... This is... It's called Coffee Stack. And they're trying they're trying to make me download it. No, I don't want to take me back to Granny Spy, dude. Dude, dude. Are you hearing the The game audio became an uh, like an audible advertisement. Adware installed, guys. I am fucking freaking out. Do I? What did the? What do I have to do? I have to uninstall these games immediately. Right? Holy shit! By the way, there is no Amogus in this fucking game. That turned out to be a complete lie, complete and utter fucking lie. There is no Amogus. Guys, Azure Lane is is I can download Azure Lane. I see Azure Lane. Oh my god. All right, Snake Troll, how do I uninstall these games though? I can't leave these games on my computer. This is terrifying, guys. What do I do? Granny Spy. <laughs>
Oh, uh, we gotta, we we gotta delete these. All right, I'm gonna leave this. I'm gonna leave this the emulator open. All right. Um, all right, so that was Granny, uh, gu Gushin, sorry, Granny versus Imposter. Okay, the name of the video is, Have You Tried Honey and Tea? It's relaxing. You liked the last one. <laughs> he fucking kills you! No, this is me right now, for real. That's how the ad ends. Gummy Worms, did you edit this, like, in a comical way? He <laughs> just kills him. Uh... Mm -hmm. He is totally my type. Oh. New life. <laughs> Turn back. Okay, why is she covered in shit? I feel like he's probably not gonna be into her though. That's the penis bunny girl? Dude, those are those are the the mega evolution La Pony stockings, guys. I don't. Okay, so she's stinky. She's stinky. These these fucking these ads are so fucking rancid, dude. Okay, but why are only her legs stinky? Maybe the stockings are stinky. <sighs> It would be pretty technically impressive if you could make a game that looked like this, don't you think? This is a story about how he prefers her covered in shit all the time. And the moral of the story is always be yourself. Is that what they're trying to say? Mm -hmm. Like, he, he forces her to be covered in liquid shit because that's what he's attracted to. Look at the- look- look at this. It's just honestly, it's it's random shit to just get you to fucking click on it. <laughs> it's it's just it's just fucking random shit to get your fucking attention. Yeah, it's... And it's working. Yeah, it's working. But it's all the more outrageous when you realize that this is just advertising a a a, a fucking shittier version of Candy Crush. Like because that's what this game is. It, it's just Candy Crush. <laughs> stinky. I like how in the thumbnail, the the paint, the stockings are stinky. <sighs> what is the little speech bubble? That emoji is vomiting blood. I would have gave her the lobster costume. You look at these videos and tell me there's a god. God is dead and these videos killed him. These these ads killed him. This is oh 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 no. The live action? Uh uh oh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Where's my report? I'll, I'll get it done, Susan. I'll get it done. I'll get it done. I'll get it done. Later. SpongeBob? I was Hellstormer. He destroyed my elven city, wiped out my legions, and looted all of my resources in Call of Dragons. Hellstormer? 
the top orc with 50 million power? It is said that he's never lost a battle, which is unbelievable. He once challenged an entire alliance and won effortlessly. More than that, he the first anti dragon by himself. With the full star legendary General Hosk as his commander, this orc legion is outstanding in both attack and defense. Why is he targeting me? No, 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 no. Here he goes again. His orcs have a 10% siege speed bonus. They can crush my defenses in no time. Help. Help me now. Nothing to do with me. I'm moving my city right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna quit for a while. See ya. Who the hell is House Stormer? Ah! Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> Magic Monsters Mastery. It's a completely unrealistic situation in every conceivable fucking way. It's just, just not realistic that you could ever be in a situation like this. Like I, I, I know, and I, I know, I know it's supposed to be a funny advertisement, but it's just it's just fucking Oh my fucking Christ. Hey Gathnix, thank you so much for 15 months of support. Mobile trash that makes five million dollars. This this fucking this this mobile game yeah it made like five million dollars this month. Done. I'll get 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 done. Who the hell is Hellstormer? Dude, I want to fucking make like. Also, like the intro, right? Check this out. Like, just watch this for a second. I'll, I'll get it done, Susan. I'll get it done. I'll get it done. I'll get it done. Later. I want to write and direct like a like a heavy drama about like you know just just like this guy like a guy working in an office and it's like you know his life his life is like you know Kafka esque or whatever like the futility of of you know modern like you know capitalism whatever. And just have it be no, not funny. A drama. It's not a comedy. It's a really serious fucking movie. And then, like, just have it be like kind of, kind of like, kind of like poignant and like a little bit, you know, like Oscar Beatty. And just and just have it be emotionally charged as well. And then approximately an hour and ten minutes into the film, this happens. Who the hell is Hellstormer? He destroyed my elven city, wiped up my legions, and looted all of my resources in Call of Dragons. Hellstormer, the top orc with 50 million power? It is said that he's never lost a battle, which is unbelievable. He once Like, ju just really make you care about the characters and, like, the story before, before, be before being like, Fuck you, it's a mobile advertisement. You know, like fuck you, it's a mobile game advertisement, right? And like you don't you don't find out until like an hour and ten minutes <laughs> ten minutes into it. Right? And it's just like there's there's like a, a a scene where like the characters are in a heated dialogue and then and then suddenly one of them just says something like this. It is said that he's never lost a battle, which is unbelievable. He once challenged an entire alliance and won effortlessly. More than that, he even No, something like this. The first ancient dragon by himself with the full star legendary general Hoss as his commander. And the music start and the music like immediately like kicks in. Like this this very specific kind of music starts playing. This orc legion is outstanding in both attack and defense. Why is he targeting me? <laughs> Submit it to cans and and then like cons excuse me the, the the once the advertising segment ends roll credits Here it goes again. like it'll be like download now and then just and then just roll and then roll credits on the movie yeah no resolution nothing nothing Noob says this happened to me on the hub. I was watching a beautiful four hour goon sesh video and two performers looked right into the camera and said the best part about waking up and then he blew a load right into his stepsister. Guys, I'm going to need you to like, like, okay, forget timing that person out. Find them and hurt them. Cryptid Martyr said that would 
actually be extremely smart as a capitalist piece? Well, I mean, people like you will say that, but it's really just a shit post. Like it's it's really just a just a fucking elaborate shit post. Yeah, somebody will will blow smoke up as it, but that's that's what the best art is uh, and elaborate shit posts. Mike, you're wanting to do postmodernist performance art. Why are you making it into anything but a shit post? Why are you calling it that? No, it would just be a shit post. And it would be like a fuck you to people who sank an hour and ten minutes of their lives into it. Like, no, you don't understand. This this film is gonna have a story and like characters and themes and like it's it's gonna be a real story before b before that happens in the middle of the movie and then that is just gonna be the end of the movie like people are gonna be mad like it's not gonna they're not gonna be like oh well that was th that was very thought provoking and and oh my god how um it really says something about society no they're just gonna be pissed magic monsters mastery it's gonna have a ninety-eight percent critic score and like a fucking like a like a like a nineteen percent audience score on Rotten Tomatoes, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, and I have like a, like like a two like a two percent Rotten Tomatoes. Other way around, I got it. Other way around. No, the critics will love it. The audience will hate it. Okay, this says help them start a new life, uh, and there's a uh, that that is the the fucking robot thing from Squid Games. <laughs> yes. Or oh, we we've seen we've seen these characters we've seen these characters before. Solitaire home design, right? We we've seen this character before. Dude, look at look at her fucking like wily coyote, like 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 fucking chalk outline body right now. <laughs> oh my god. Cascading Psycho's got a good idea. Hey, bud. I had a similar idea where it's a several seasons long drama like Game of Thrones with really good acting and writing and cinematography. And in the final few seconds of the series, the main character decides he doesn't want to be king and gets in a brand new like Kia Cilantro and drives off. And the whole thing you just watched was a car commercial. The thought experiment is whether that ending ruins the rest of the show. Um, if you did that, that would be better than what Game of Thrones is. If you did that, that would be better than the ending of Game of Thrones. That would be better than Game of Thrones if you did that. I'm not, I'm not joking. That would actually be a better fucking show. That would be a better ending than what they actually did. Okay. I love that. Actually, I love that idea. I love that idea. Kia Cilantro. Yeah, I made up a car. Sounds real though, doesn't it? Kia Cilantro. Tell me that's not a car. Sounds real. Killed in action, caused Cilantro. It's Kia Coriander in the UK. Oh, it's a it, it, okay. So the the real car is Kia Sorento, but like, who cares? Well, you, you you don't expect me to give a shit, do you? <laughs> We're gonna help them start a new life. This time, there's kids. The stakes are higher, guys. Yay! So the stove is going out the window, like the, the it's going into a, it's going into glass. 
Dude, please let this advertisement end with the roof collapsing on those children. It doesn't. Homoerotic bullying with mud. Okay, and she says, don't you dare join the cheerleading. <laughs> Why is she dressed like this at school? Dude, that's awesome. That's like Carrie, except like if instead of instead of like pig's blood, it was shit. Dude, honestly, how much more based would that movie have been if it was shit? It was a like pig shit instead of <laughs> instead of blood. If it was if it was shit instead of blood, right? Would have been way funnier. It would be worse. Fecal carry. It's the same fucking scene, dude. Like, if you watch, right, whenever we see this, she doesn't just have shit on her. She has, like, a fat suit of shit. She has many, many layers of shit. Mike thought Carrie was a comedy? Well, it, it would make Carrie a comedy if it was shit, right? Dude, it's a little funny. It's a, it's, it, dude, that nerd gets, gets, like, you know, gets bullied. Like, when is that not funny? A poop golem. Yeah, she's like a poop golem. Yeah. yeah. Dead. Please, please, the lobster suit. Please give her the lobster suit. They never give her the fucking lobster suit. It's so obvious. That's why I have to download this and play it myself. Chat wants to see the homoerotic part again. I love how this high school always has, like, emergency pig shit buckets, like, installed besides every classroom. Like, some schools have fire extinguishers. No, they have fucking, like, like pull string shit buckets. Couldn't afford sprinklers. How much for a Mike Lobster suit stream? We gotta start doing dumb shit, like... When the, when the IRL streams get off the ground, I'm still looking into that, by the way. I really do want to find the most streamlined... Like, honestly... The, the path of least resistance. It, and it could be the backpack, but it might not be the backpack. Okay? But anyway... Like, doing things like, if Mike, you know, like a sub-goal or something, where, yeah, Mike goes to see Plymouth Rock in the lobster suit or some dumb shit, you know? The path of yeast resistance. Are you still thinking of the phone? Yeah, I've been Googling it, like, or looking at YouTube videos about it, and the phone thing is possible, but it's not as easy as you think it is. Yeah, I have been, I actually, I, I did talk to Zod about it, yeah. And I think what's going to happen, I think I think at some point, at some point, I think after the summer, though, like in the fall, I'm, I think I'm actually going to try to meet up with Zot because he has one, but he, he, Zot made one. Like he, he made his own. He didn't, he didn't buy the one from, you know, the gun run people. He made his own from the, uh, was that website? And... It, for for not only for for a fraction of the cost, but it, it's it's way more like lightweight, and I don't, I don't know. I don't. I I might do. I might do what he did. And he's willing to. He's willing to like you know help me out with it and like walk me through it and stuff. So that's cool of him. Um. So yeah, that that's where that's that's a work in progress, guys. I, I did not forget about it. And somebody pointed out to me recently. They said, Mike, when you did that, um. That 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 subathon for your birthday, you made it a goal that there was going to be IRL streams, 
in, in 2023. And there are there are going to be IRL streams this year, guys. But it's just I'm I'm trying to. One of the main things I'm worried about is, and I'm not. I know I'm I'm not I'm not trying to fucking go back on something I said I was going to do, especially since you guys you know raised raised money for it. But like, one of the things I'm super afraid of right now is spending a bunch of money on this and then just having tech issues. Like I'm I'm afraid. I'm afraid it's going to be too hard, basically beyond my technical ability. Like, that's what I'm worried about. I'm afraid it's going to be beyond my technical ability and it's just going to be a, a huge, like, time and, and money and effort sink. And it's not, we're not even going to really, like, get the content that we're looking for out of it. Like, does that mean? But that's what I'm worried about. So if you're wondering what the holdup is on the IRL streams, it's, it's, it's that. Hire a tech goblin to follow you around everywhere. I, I'm not Mr. Beast, man. I, I I can't hire a tech goblin. Like I don't know what. Um. Zot will help if he's gonna provide you with tech. I mean, we'll 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 see. I also you know don't want to like be annoying to him and shit. So we'll see what happens. And yeah, I see people doing it with the phone, but the phone is not really. Like, you still need a portable modem and all this shit. Like, it's almost like when I, when I looked into the logistics of, of doing IRL streams with, 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 a, with a, a cell phone, with a mobile phone, it kind of just felt to me like I might as well get the backpack. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. So we'll see. Uh, all right, we got Huggy Wuggy lays an egg. Crypto, thanks for twenty-seven months. Matt said, Did, "Didn't you promise in your birthday stream that you would buy the backpack if you raised enough money?" Matt, I want you to do me a favor, buddy. Go into the bathroom and fucking. Get a Q-tip and go in there. Sp spend like fucking, spend like 40 minutes just scraping the cum and shit out of your fucking ears, bro. So you can hear. Okay, just clear out your fucking ears, bro. And you wipe your ass while you're in there, man. Okay? Because you have some severe listening comprehension issues, buddy. I, I, I love you, but holy fuck, you have not been listening to a single thing. You must not have listened to a single thing I said in the past 10 minutes. C Star, thanks for 10 months, buddy. Yo, that's shit. <laughs> fuck. Yo, that's bad, man. That's bad. What is that? What is that shit? And then it starts to hatch? What is this? Bro, it's fucking Togepi. Huggy or mud? Mud. Okay, it's mud. It's just, guys, it's just mud, guys. What do you think his eggs smell like? There's, there's no audio. Huggy or mud? Oh, he couldn't go through that one. What the fuck did we just watch? What the fuck are we watching? Guys, do we gotta play that? What, what, what was that game? Monster Egg. Guys, Monster Egg? No? The chat's saying no. They're, they're saying no. Please, no. <laughs> Monster Egg.
someone, someone in chat said, what? <laughs> be, be quiet for several days. Hey, hobo, he said, wait until my therapist hears about this. <laughs> Oh, that's fucking great. Um, oh. <laughs> A new low. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Holy Christ. What? So what's the, the idea of the game is like you're trying to hatch the egg? Mike, how many therapists do you think know your name? You know, they're, 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 they're like talking about me in hushed tones, like in like, the, I don't know, the therapy like network. It's like, yeah, you got to look out for that jabroni Mike shit, man. That is fucking brutal. Like, yeah, I've had fucking so many broken minds, so many broken fucking future U.S. senators come in here. He's like the boogie. I'm like the boogeyman of therapy of therapists, like the pee pee poo poo man. Like the big, I'm the big bed for all these therapists, dude. So I was watching this 37-year-old Italian man trying to suck an egg up Huggy Wuggy's ass. Skip man says I was trying to eat. Oh, please. Oh, please. Oh, please. You make it really hard to support you sometimes, you know that? You're not subbed. Okay, shut the fuck up. Mr. Plant, thanks for eight months. Arpeggi with 21 months. Thank you, buddy. Look at this. Look, look at this. This is fucking awesome. This is one of the best ads I've ever seen for anything. Nintendo, thanks for the gift sub, man. How did he fail, by the way? He walked into the, the post? Silver Stars 24. Freak! That is a fresh freak, guys. You know what to do. Dump it up. Dump, dump, dump Adelphia. Take him to dump Adelphia, chat. Consumed too much shit. I guess he ate too much shit. Like, you're supposed to, like, moderate, like, like maybe microdose the feces. Like, moderate how much feces you consume. Like, everything in moderation. Karis, thanks for nine months. Appreciate it. And also, Ghost Pop Ruby, fresh freak! Freak! Thank you so much, Ruby. I saw this viral tweet the other day. Uh, where they were talking about, they were like, ooh, post the Star, the Star Wars image that lives rent-free in your head or whatever. Like, post the Star Wars image that, like, you think about all the time. And, like, people were posting, like, all these... I don't know, fucking stupid, like like generic Star Wars moments, like you know, like like Luke hanging off the fucking thing, you know, hanging off the, the fucking you know Luke on Tatooine right after you know the fucking you know stormtroopers come or whatever. Ghost Pop, thanks for the gift sub as well. And somebody quote tweeted it, and they put the image of of Welcome to Your New Home, freak. And it just, like, ratioed, like, all the other fucking tweets. It was just fucking... Everybody was like, fuck yeah. Welcome to your new home, freak. It was awesome. It was awesome to see welcome to your new home, freak, like, out in the wild. Mine would be Anakin killing the younglings. No, it's welcome to your new home. A, a moment, it was like mo a moment from Star Wars media that lives in your head rent free. You, you laughed so hard when you saw. Uh, why is it so funny, Herg? You know, I'm gonna. Can, can I actually give you a theory about why I think everybody finds it so funny? You're usually not used to seeing Yoda getting treated with that much disrespect, I think, in the Star Wars series. Like, usually he's, like, this stoic figure that everybody is like, oh, yes, master, yes, master. And, like, for the first time, you have a bunch of people, like, violently, like, abducted, throwing him in chains, and then fucking, like, just 
Yeah, like like chucking him into a dungeon, and he's like r walking around on all floors, like in such an undignified fashion, with his fucking dumpy like up in the air, like he's presenting, right? Like he's all caked up. Like it was very, very disrespectful to Yoda. And you know what? That's fucking based. He looks like a like a chubby short stack. Yeah, just the the disrespect for that fucking character is is hilarious. I mean, I I feel like I don't know, man. I I feel like I'm just I'm just like the part of my life where I felt any enthusiasm for Star Wars was a long long time ago. Lizzie, thank you for the the gift subs. Um Oh yeah, what we're talking about is from a com a Star Wars like extended universe comic, from some fucking extended universe shit. Jarpus also with the gift subs, thank you. And uh Ram Ranch manager with the uh with the 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 bets. My friend randomly sent me the welcome to your new home freak along with a Tumblr post about how there's a Twitch streamer who uses that when there's a fresh sub. I told her that was you and she said, wait, that's your Sonic Elsa Gate streamer? Why is there a Tumblr post about me saying welcome to your new home freak when somebody subs? What? What is? Why does that exist? Got him? Got him. Mike has breached containment. You do numbers on tumblers. Do I? Should I use my tumbler again? Puma, thanks for the uh, gift sub. But why would I use my tumbler again? Okay, but yeah, but to be fair, numbers on tumbler is like six. It's like fucking six. Because how many people are still using tumbler? You know what's fucked sometimes now? I'm scrolling Twitter and I get advertisements for tumbler. Have any of you seen that? Tumblr is advertising itself on Twitter. Sponsored tw sponsored tweets about how like you should use Tumblr. And I'm like, what the fuck? Why? What? I recently saw some uh, some statistics on that. Yahoo buying Tumblr. In like 2008. For like. Billions of dollars. Billions of dollars. Yahoo. Yeah Yahoo. They bought Tumblr for billions of dollars. 20, was two, it was 2016? They bought Tumblr. For billions of dollars. And it is now worth, I think, three million dollars. Three million dollars. That can't be it, Matt. That's it. It's that fucked. It's actually that fucked. Tumblr is worth three mil. It can't be that low. Google it. And right now, that's happening to Twitter. Yep. I w They bought a plat. Check it out. They bought a platform that was ninety percent porn. Right. Is ninety percent of the user base was using it for the either the the posting the the disseminating or the consumption of porn. And then banned the porn. How? Just how? How? Fucking like literally how? 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 How could, how could people commanding that much wealth and power make a mistake that big?
That's that's one of those like imposter syndrome moments. Like if you ever think that you have imposter syndrome. Boomer brain business management. I think it was something to do with like, yeah, like pressure from MasterCard or something. You know how the, the credit cards like bully fucking like platforms into dropping porn and like becoming Christian for, or, for some reason. CEOs fail upwards. They fail upwards. Apple threatened to drop the app from the store if they didn't drop porn. So they dropped the porn to appease Apple. But like I think they would have been fine without Apple. Like that would have been meeting. Would wouldn't that have meant nothing if the if if Tumblr wasn't available on the App Store? Wouldn't that have meant nothing? Like people have Androids, right? Like it was like who cares? It would have been meaningless. It would have been fucking meaningless. Like Tumblr. Me and my lads would have killed Steve Jobs with hammers, I tell you what. You that, that's just the ET meme, but you replaced ET with Steve Jobs. Tumblr Mobile is notoriously S. Yeah, probably most people were not looking at it on mobile. Okay. There was allegedly child porn on Tumblr and that's why that happened. Okay. That's why they banned porn. Okay. Well. I mean, like, are you, is that, is that true? Is that, is that you said allegedly? So does that mean ban all porn or does that mean like that's the solution is you ban all, what about like cracking? What about moderation? What about like cracking down on, you know, the problem instead of just being like, well, no more porn now. Because look, I mean, I think I think we can all agree that that's what killed the website. Right? That takes effort and money. Okay, does it take like one uh 1.1 1 .1 billion dollars worth of time and money because that's how much money they lost from banning porn? That that the, that's that is not the value of the company has dropped like one point one billion dollars, and is is essentially worthless now because of that. So I mean, like, what you know, what were they supposed to do? Was there another option? Corobo, thanks for six months of support, but um, then you have to hire people and admit responsibility. It was worth $1.3 billion, and now it's worth $3 million. Okay, it doesn't help that Yahoo's CEO didn't understand what Tumblr is. She said, okay, so here's their qu a quote from the this Yahoo CEO. Yahoo wanted to turn Tumblr into the next PDF. Okay, that is criminal fucking negligence, like, on, on the part of, like, that is, like, business malpractice. What If I was a shareholder in that fucking company, I would have probably done something very violent. I don't know. That That is... That is fucking infuriating. Doesn't begin to describe what that what that is. Yeah, I don't I don't know. Like if like if if I had fucking significant money invested with that with like Yahoo and that wow. These people constantly fail upwards. Another reason why Tumblr died is because the minute the ban went live, it was false flagging literally everything as porn. Garfield 
for some reason, was constantly taken down as porn, whether it was fan art, the actual strips, or whatever. Garf Garfield. Someone says that for some reason, he's naked. If you think that Garfield isn't porn, that means you've never seen a Garfield strip. This makes perfect sense to me. Honestly. No, I'm going to tell you why that happened. Because, guys, John Chug's dog come. He has like a fucking, there's like a Bukaki strip where, where John Chug's come. Like, what are you talking about? It's not porn. Do you guys remember that comic where Garfield is a fucking prostitute? And the sad part is it's like extremely well drawn. Remember that? What was that? What was it called, guys? Show it? I think that shit's fucking actually TOS. I can't show it. It was called Madame Lasagna. It was by Dave Raposa. I don't know. What, what, it, what was it? What was it called? It was called Gar Maybe that's why they took. Maybe that comic is responsible for what happened on Tumblr, right? Garfield's eyes look like two huge breasts. You're telling me that's not porn material? If you've seen Garfield, you know it's porn. Garfield is inherently sexual, and I, for one, completely understand why that happened. Personally. I want to play this game. Guys. Did you see the the huggy wuggy thumbnail like up in the top left? Look up look up here. It's got the head of huggy wuggy but not the body. I got to pee. Bro, is that just a pitched up Mario? Yahoo! <laughs> Guys, where's that scream from? <gasps> Help the girl. That was Peach. We've heard all these sound effects before from fuck from Finger Family videos. All right, so P here. Okay, so not only does she piss, like, how many metric gallons is a fucking swimming pool? Like, she fills the entire pool with, with her fucking urine. This bitch can piss. Holy fuck. But as soon as she starts to piss, her pussy starts to fucking... stink? Like, like what's that? It's asparagus piss? Why does her pussy stink when she pisses? Is that how- is that- guys, is that like normal? She had a UTI? Yeah, but she didn't before. Why does it start to stink at, when she pisses? Dude, and then he pops up. Look how red he's red. Why is he red? He's like, hmm, what's going on here? He's fuck as the piss dribbles down his fucking body. And he's turning red, he's blushing, he's flustered. Bro. He is fucking loving what is happening right now. He's loving this, this, this fucking what? Yeah, he's loving the situation he's in right now. He is totally my type. Uh, 
Forget the golden shower, dude. This is a golden bathtub. <sighs> and you just what? You like fucking hose her down? You hose all the piss off of her fucking legs? You hose her down like she's a fucking golden retriever? That's Peach, apparently? This is the leg washing discourse among Redditoids when showering. Well, her whole body was covered in piss. Maybe he should have hosed down the whole body. The mentality is, I don't have to go out of my way to wash my legs because water drips down there and my legs get washed anyway. There's no reason to wash my legs. Is that right? Right? Is that... Like, it's all getting wet down there. What's the point of washing your legs? Right? Mike is wrong. Explain it to me, then. I, I'm, I'm not agreeing with it. I'm just explaining the, the, the mentality. It, you, right. The last, week, the last time we talked about this... He didn't even give an opinion. You notice that, Joaco? Mike is wrong, like, fucking just as a knee-jerk reaction to anything I fucking say. Right. The last time we talked about this, it was just the feet. There were a, certain, there were a contingent of people that were saying, you don't have to clean your feet in the shower. Because you're stepping in water and they're getting wet down there. They're getting wet and they're getting soap. Why would you go out of your way to like actually wash them like manually with the loofah or or whatever the fuck, you know, like soap or, or whatever? You're backpedaling. I'm back. Now, the next time we're talking about it, it has evolved into did they have they they have don't have the ability to listen. They just they just they can only say things. They can't listen. They have negative reading comprehension. Right. They're getting soaked in the water that was used to wash your shitty ass. Yeah, there's there's shit water down there. And all the filth from your body is down there. So, we, yes, we came to the conclusion that that was extremely stupid. You have to wash your feet manually. But now, it has evolved into, into legs. The, the Redditors now think they don't have to wash their legs either. Because the water is running down their legs in the shower. What? What's? What's next? What's next? Penis? Like, don't wash your penis. Mike, why do you hate women? Sorry, I was watching cock porn in another tab. Anyway, Mike, you're wrong about whatever you're talking about. All right, I don't know. I don't care if you think I'm wrong or not. Okay, here's here's what it comes down to. Wash your feet and legs. Wash your penis. When you take a shower, if there's a part of your body that you're not washing, that's disgusting and you're a dirtbag. And it's also a waste of time. Dude. If you're not going to wash a part of your body, why are you even bothering to take a shower? Chad is saying some people appreciate stinky feet. Okay, then don't listen. Then, then you know what? You're right. I'm wrong. I'm wrong about this. This is a bad take. Do whatever you want. Okay? Disgusting. That that is insane. You're insane. That's disgusting. 
Foot freaks ruin it for everyone. Cap gun, thanks for 23 months. Um, I know a guy that got an adult circumcision because he couldn't be asked to do more than let the water drip down there. I'm sorry, are you trying to tell me that somebody... I don't have words for how angry that makes me. Are you fucking you're 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 not serious. You're not serious. You're not fucking serious. You cannot be fucking serious. Making the adult decision to chop half your cock off. Holy shit. Tell him I hate him. Tell him I fucking hate him. If you ever see him again, tell him I fucking hate him with every ounce of my being. And I wish everything horrible hap to happen to him. Okay, listen. Somebody in chat was trying to tell me that there is some kind of weird tech issue with my screen flashing? What's going on there? There's a clip of it. Scary red flash. Yes, we came to the conclusion that that was extremely stupid. You have to wash your feet manually. But now... Oh, the webcam does it. Yeah, what is that? That is fucking strange. Demonic? It's a demon? But now Holy fuck. That is scary. Guys. Guys. Guys, what the fuck is this? What is this? Is this this is Satan? Dude. Have we have we peeped the horror? Guys, what the fuck is that? What is this? Guys, I'm ser this is seriously freaking me the fuck out. What is this? It doesn't look like me. No, it it like it like morphed my face. Who is that? What's wrong with what's wrong with my face? No, this is not a bit. No, this is not a bit. It's not a fucking bit, chat. Dude, this is freaking me the fuck out. I don't know how to turn off the John Pillar. Just kidding. It's you from the red dimension. It's actually terrifying. It's legitimately fucking terrifying. I have no idea what that is. Mike is dragged down to hell screaming, It's not a bit, chat. Guys, that's not a bit. That's fucking Satan is among us. And I have no idea what the fuck. Like, evil walks the earth and it's choosing to fuck with my Twitch stream. I have no idea what the fuck that is. Droid, thanks for nine months, buddy. That's my demon form? Guys, that's fucking horrifying. What is this shit? Dude, I look like a Star Wars alien. Like Kit Fisto or some shit.
Somebody Googled it. The red lights beside the webcam start blinking when there's an application software that tries to log in using the Windows Hello feature. Disable Windows Hello. I've never heard of Windows Hello. I have no idea what it is. That was fucked up, though. Hold on. Right, yeah, th 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 this is behind the webcam from the other night. You think it's this? Mike, you look really red today, King. Mike, you look like the red M&M today. The emulator is accessing the camera. The emulator is running in the background. Do you really think it's crypto mining or some shit? Holy fuck, dude. I... It's freaking me out. That is legitimately freaking me out, guys. Don't like... <laughs> Don't like it. Don't like it. The granny game is logging into your online banking. Dodgy mobile ads legitimately access your camera and shit. Dude, what if it's not my computer being hacked, but my fucking soul? His corporeal form is being infested. What if that's real? Guys, I have to uninstall these games. I have to uninstall these games. How do I uninstall these games? Does anybody here use LD player? I'm freaking the fuck out. Holy fuck. Holy shit. What have I done? Holy shit. I don't even know how to delete apps off the off the hold icon on install. Uh yeah. Granny Spy is now being uninstalled. Snake Troll is being uninstalled. All right, so if it still happens, then we know that it's not whatever the this, this emulator, okay? Mike, where's the homunculus you transferred your soul to the other, the other night? I flushed it down the toilet. Do you think that made it mad? LD player can't do anything without your permission. Fun fact, right, Lore? LD player was the only one that I could get to work on my computer. Hi. Sonic the Hedgehog would have been all over that shit. He would be like, what's that shit? Oh. 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 Hmm. 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 Lot happened all at once, didn't it? Lot happened all at once. Right? The game is called Summoner's Greed, and the advertisement starts with someone throwing a pot at somebody's head. And then there is a sequence of, of, of these, like, chibi-looking characters. I don't know who they are. Some some of them gets got, got, got fat tits. There's a song that's really pissing me off. The game is called Summoner's Greed. Is that Ursula? Camels? What is it? Camel by Camel? What is it called? They censored her vag. I think it's like some kind of belt fastener or something. Dude, is there really a pussy under there? Oh my god. 
as like a satyr. It's just it's the same characters in a loop. And then you get the um, what is this called again? Brody Kulo. The bro the Broly the Broly Kulo. And then you get your Broly Kulo. And he's blushing. Look, he's blushing. And that's the uh the advertisement. And then we have to see these to see this. And it says, I want you to know that the the name of the file says, I'm so sorry. Honestly, if Satan is trying to fucking like if 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 a demon is trying to enter my body, just just do it. Like just go possess me, just take it. I'm done. Drag me to f drag my soul to hell and just yeah, I I don't want to. Dude, do your fucking worst. I'm already in hell, okay? Like actually do your fucking worst. The demon is getting scared watching the mobile. Like, we're scaring the demon away by watching this. What, what, what's, what's he going to do? He's going to drag me to hell. I'm in hell. Thinking about that person in the chat who said, we're in the deepest layer, dude. Think about the person in chat who said, there are people who appreciate, um, I don't know, foot stink. In the sense that, like, and using that as an argument about why I'm wrong that people should wash their feet. Like, that was the counter argument. I said people should wash their feet in the shower. And the counter argument was, no, because some people enjoy foot stink. You should stop thinking about that. It'll be less painful. I can't. I, how? How am I supposed to stop thinking about that? Who are you to spoil a good vintage? All right, let me uh, let me I'm going to I'm going to put it to I'll put it to you this way. Okay. If you have a foot kink because like you like feet, like like you think feet are an attractive body part for some reason and like they you just you just like them, I respect that. Fine. What I don't respect is you getting off on smelling dirty feet. That means you have something deeply wrong. That's not that's not good. That's not, that's some, that's something else. Okay. That's something else. That's you're a fucking, you, you're, you're, you're a psychopath. You are a fucking actual pervert. You're an actual fucking, there's something deeply fucking wrong with that. I don't care. Ch emails incoming, F send them. I don't give a fuck. I, you, you, you're, you're, you're getting hard because her feet smell. You need therapy, man. I, I'm sorry. That's what is that? What else do you like? Shit. You like shit. That's filth. You see, you're 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 getting a boner from filth. Like like like. like that's that's that. I I'm gonna throw up. I'm gonna throw up. That's disgusting. Couldn't be me. Keep it paused here, though, if you don't mind. My, this is like the time we talked about the people who want to fuck cars. Why are you getting off on body odor? Because what, like pheromones? Okay, so like some people... Sweat contains pheromones, right? Like... But not the, like, like, not, not, not the feet, though. Not the feet, man. Not the feet, man. The feet, guys? My, this is going to be the thumbnail. You think I don't know that? You think, you think I don't, you think I don't know that, man? 
you're smelling bacteria. That it's right. Okay, so if if you if you're like, you know, enjoying pheromones because I don't know, you're you're like okay, like she's a little sweaty, like she I don't know, she just worked out or something. It's it's kind of hot. All right, maybe that's that's pheromones, yeah. But like, if you are enjoying like her armpit smell, or her like specifically. Arm, if you're enjoying the smell of like armpits or feet or like ass, that's fucked because that though because that's bacteria, right? Like that's yeah, that's that's bacteria. <laughs> you, like 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 go lick the fucking, like go lick go lick the straps on the subway, and shit like that because that's the same kink. Like go, like go lick seats in public and shit like that. At that point, like go, go take gum from under like a fucking desk somewhere and chew it because that's the same shit. That's that's what you're getting off on. You're getting off on filth and disease and fucking bacteria. Mike, this is why I I sub to you because your stream this because. Your streams are consistently hysterical. Fritty Kidders, that's an awesome compliment. Thank you so much. And I'm glad you're enjoying... I'm, I'm glad you find this shit as funny as I do. Okay, we got a... a, a we got a comment from Jabroni Mike Enjoyer uh, that I want to get to. Cheese, which is produced by concentrating and changing the proteins... And fats in milk depends on the actions of microbes to drive the transformation. The manufacturing and ripening of cheeses results from microbial successions that can induce bacteria, yeast, and filamentous fungi or molds. So the argument is that because cheese exists, it is not weird or bad to enjoy foot odor? Is that is that the implication of that? Makes sense to me. <sighs> Fucking rancid. Oh, oh. Oh. Ah! Oh. Can we just talk about how fucking excellent this is right here? So first of all, there's something like deeply wrong with his face, which 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 starts with how fu which which is what starts the comedy, right? Like the kind like for the, his his face. I'm already laughing because of his face. Okay, and then the, just I want you to pay attention to the the way he vomits and the sound effect. <laughs> yes. <laughs> totally, totally fucking involuntary. Totally involuntary. In the bed, right? In the bed. Vomits gently. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's 
so good. Right. And then it says, I'm sick of your smelly feet. And I was like, and he's leaving with the suitcase. And that made me think, uh, lives from based. If I was in chat, I would type lives from based and press enter. If that, that was, if that, that's how I feel about that. I'm sick of your smelly feet. Like, like wash your fucking feet. You nasty bitch. Fuck. Divorce or makeover first? Oh, no. Because all she has to do, guys, is wash her feet. Like, all of this could have been avoided if she just washed her feet. Like, this is, she's a Redditor. She thinks, like, it's just, again, like, you don't need to actually... Guys, I take a fucking loofah and I fucking scrub my feet. Like I do my I do my whole the rest of my body. Okay? I get in there. And I do the shins and I do the fucking th the thighs. I go in the ass crack. I scrub in the ass crack. Balls, taint, penis. Loofah. Gotta use a loofah. Gotta use a loofah. Belly button, absolutely. Armpits. My fucking under boobs. When's the last time you washed behind your ears? Every ship. Before this stream. Before this stream. Every shit? Every shit. But when I poop, I end up getting getting some poop behind my ears, so I got a scrub back there. Mike is using a shit scrubber on his knees. Are you using the same sponge for every everywhere? Yeah, and then I take a toothbrush, and my my I take my toothbrush and and go in my asshole and scrub inside the perimeter of my asshole, and then and then um, and that's when my shower is finished. Okay. Holy fuck. You have separate loofah. You don't use ass and balls on face. I don't actually use the loofah on my face. I I actually just use um, my hands on my face. Because I don't want to like scrub my face with the loofah. I feel like it's bad for my skin to do, like my face to do that. Um... Chad is saying the, the ad that mentally broke Vinny is actually very similar to this one. I, I wanna see the I wanna see the one you guys are talking about. Someone in chat said, can you please download this and play it? This game is a is Candy Crush. The game is just Candy Crush. There's no feet, there's no people, even it's literally just Candy Crush. Okay? What is the... F There's feces on her fucking feet, guys. And you use a poop knife to scrape it off. Yeah, dude. How, like, how can you look at this and say there's any hope for the future? How can you look at this and tell me there's a God? You want to make somebody a fucking atheist? You send them this shit. Eggs any style? Freak! This is a fresh freak, guys. Please, uh, please get some some fat, big fat Yoda dumpies in the chat for eggs, guys. There's an anti-spider spray. I like the fucking shit flakes at the bottom. That's like the other night when I when I busted open the volcano to get the gemstones. Look at look at that. Yeah, th th someone in chat said, "This makes me hope there is a God because I want this, these people to go to hell where they where they belong."
I agree. I agree completely. Fuck, it's still licking. It's still licking, guys. It's still licking. I want to see the one. We're, we're going to watch the one Vinny. Can somebody get a, a link to the one Vinny saw? Holy Christ. Get, get it ready. Get get that one ready, guys. All right, so it looks like you got um, a Chad and somebody with fat tits. They're going to play rock, paper, scissors. Jump scare warning. Okay, thank you. What is okay? Let's let's start with this. What the fuck is this sound? What the fuck is that? What is that? She's still doing it. And then he 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 ties her. So the rock paper scissors is like sexual, and he ties her up and tickles her feet with a a a, a, a fucking paintbrush. And if he loses, she gets to put um, clothes pins on his nips. This is porn, yeah. That's the joke. The joke is porn. I think the implication there is like, yeah, user only. And I like how it's the Pornhub logo, implying you're going to get to see her tits. Guys, do we need to play this game and find out if there's tits? There might be tits, but you it's its beyond several miles of paywall. They want clicks from children who haven't found out that real porn exists yet. Uh-huh. The internet is mocking you for watching porn. That's what this ad is. <laughs> The back room's pulsing humming sound is back. I wish it would stop. <sighs> okay, okay, do you hear it right now? It's gone? I actually think I just fixed it. Yes, no, yes, no. What was it? I pushed the fucking the, the PC like a quarter of a centimeter away from the fucking mic stand and it stopped. Like I'm not I'm not even exaggerating that. Like literally a quarter of a centimeter away. The fa it's something to do with the fucking computer fans, yeah. Yeah, please let me know when you hear that shit, guys. Because it's not that hard to fix that, okay? Holy fuck, man. Dust in the bearings? I there's There is some dust on the fucking... I don't know what the hell it is. Like the, the screen that the that the fans are in front of. 
It was literally a centimeter that I pushed it to get rid of that sound. Something soft under the feet of the PC case. That could that could work. Mike's PC setup makes me medge. That that mic stand is there because there's nowhere else to put it though. Do you understand? Ponce, I really Why is it medge? Why? What's wrong with it? Someone had the vine sauce clip. Let me see that shit. We got distracted by the John Pillar sound. We're going to have the top care, it says. Okay. All right. Here. So is it, wait, wait, wait. Is, is, is this the whole advertisement? Like it, st it starts here, like you're not cutting it off. We're gonna have the top care. Hello. Nasty. Ah! Nasty. No! Hey, stop it. Nasty. <laughs> nice. I, I like how it's the snake that's the snake sound pop care like it's it's the metal gear solid sound that is fucking bad though that's fucking bad That is fucking bad. Stop it. At least she got offended because it was sexual. Nasty. <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen to him. Listen. He, yeah, he's. You can hear his fucking psyche is is shot. It's it's, it's gone. His psyche is fucking destroyed. Have you ever heard Vinny make these sounds IRL? No, no. This is bad. He sounds like he's getting fucking waterboarded. Master Doctor. That's a different game though. That's that's not that's not what uh what, what is this game? Stop replaying it. It's fucking bad. Probably the same ad comp, like the same marketing company. Holy fuck. No, feet are bad, guys. Like, like foot shit is fucking nasty, guys. It, it's, it's. Like, like, especially fucked up feet like that. Like, that is, I don't know what the fuck. I, that, 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 that activates some primal part of, like, my brain that wants to just, yeah, like, like, flight. Like, fight or flight center of my brain. Yeah, it's like, fucking, it's not good. Holy fuck. Said by someone who's never gotten a foot job under the table at Applebee's. I'm just saying, man, like, I want, you know... I, dude, clean your fucking feet, okay? End of story. Clean your fucking feet. Clean your goddamn feet, okay? She is so hot. Lesbian ghost. Why did you wash all the mud off? She could have made a sculpture out of you. Yay! Yay! <gasps> wow, that's a pretty annoying sound, huh? Dude, that fucking thing went flaccid the second she stood up. 
Why is it framed in the why why do this? Is this supposed is this supposed to like is this supposed to stimulate me sexually? Is it working? It's not... Not working. Yay. <gasps> ming, ming, ming. <laughs> ming, ming, ming. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Literal dog... Dog shit. Not me. The dog did this. Do we buy that though? Do we buy that? Do we buy that? You can endure him or divorce. Amber Heard moment. The story was that Amber Heard took a shit on Johnny Depp's bed to fuck, like to, to mentally abuse him. Or something, right? Is that what happened? She took a shit on the bed. That was the so they so they just discussed that in court, right? And she blamed the dog. Guys, I would this directly could have been inspired by the the Johnny Depp trial. Like this absolutely could have been fucking taken. The person could have like listened to it and then went home and fucking animated this that day. Johnny could tell it was hard. Dog shit is very different from human shit. Okay. You can you, you just look at the difference and you, you look at, at, at it. You could tell it's human or, or dog shit. Hey, Faze Palmer. Do you think depressed people like me should be watching this? It's making you lose faith in humanity, isn't it? You can turn her hair into snakes and cut off her fucking clothes. And put spiders spray. What actually happened here, guys? Like, what the fuck happened? There was a banana suit. Anybody else would? I, I would have loved to have seen her in the banana suit. There's also a hamburger. Like, do you feed her the burger, or is it like a clothing item? Guy, what a fucking image that is. Can this be the thumbnail? Look at all that shit. <laughs> and she blamed it on the dog. It's very easy to tell. Right. Why would he do it? I feel like when you shit that much in the bed, that's intentional, right? Like, this isn't like, you know, like, oops, I shat the bed, you know. This is like, I ate a bunch of White Castle to prepare for this. And then I stood up on the bed and I took one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven like, I, in separate different positions. Okay, like, I moved, I created a minefield. Seven strategically placed shits is what I'm saying. This was no accident, what went on here. This was premeditated pooping. And I gotta tell you, look at his face. Look at his proud face. Look, he's proud. Oh, yeah. He knows what he did. Not only that... Let me look at the shirt. Like, the, the shorts, too. 
He's proud. This is a man who knows exactly what he's done. Right? Honestly, kind of a power move. If I'm being real, poop Chad. Yeah, Chad. <laughs> Chad. A real Chad. You also have the choice to endure him, which is interesting, right? Like, the implication being that, like... This is the first day of the rest of your life. This is gonna happen again, and again, and again, and again. He must have played the tie-dye the tie -dye game, too. Yeah. <laughs> Make a happy birthday. Grow into a female prostitute. Three months old. Fifteen. Yeah, what? Yeah, what? What? Make a happy baby. 25 years old. Hear me out. Lord have mercy on us pitiful creatures. That's the anime Betty Boop. That's the lady in the radiator. <laughs> it is. It is. Oh, God abandoned us su such a long time ago, right? Died at 30. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, guys, guys, guys. Grow into a female prostitute. She's yelling at the baby? What could this game possibly be like? Guys, do we want to do we want to try this one? Make a happy baby? No. It's probably like a candy crush. What the fuck? It, what, what could it possibly be? The Chinese government will steal your information. They already have it at this point, okay? They have all yours too. You're not hiding anything from them. This is Mori Mobile. Oh, no. Dude, I just heard the Amogus music. Not the phone. What? You need the baby. <laughs> he just <chucks> the baby. <laughs> <laughs> he just chucks it. <laughs> That's great. Not my problem anymore. Say it. <laughs> Holy fuck. All right, those are condoms, guys. Uh oh. She's got some fucking jiggle physics though on that on that dumpy. You see that? Oh, it's one of these. Okay. Huh. Guys. How does her body work? The, who's built like that? She's built like a fucking she's built like a one piece female. The fucking rock, paper, scissors game is like if you're gonna smack their asses. Playing down. I like the, the, the man like randomly aggressively telling you to play now in the middle of like the dead silence of the audio. Playing down. Oh 
okay. <laughs> Please don't hurt me. <laughs> All right, fine. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'll play now. <laughs> Is that it? That was that was the that was the fucking entire thing. That was the entire video uh, commercial. You get virtually no information. What is going on, man? This is fucking bottom of the barrel. Holy fuck! More sperm shit. Baby ma and mom. Three D pregnancy sim. Hold on. The game has four and a half stars. Well, dude, here's the thing. Th this this is fucking part of the advertisement. So it's 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 yeah, it's fake. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Dude, imagine if other things were like that, like, <clears throat> like other, like real adver real advertisements, like other advertisements were like that. Like, oh yeah, look at our positive Yelp reviews. Like, look at, look at how we have, you know, like this restaurant just got like five stars. We're awesome. Come on down to Happy's Pizza. We got five stars. Check it out. We, we, we lost our minds. We got five stars. It's about to go nuts. And you just go look and there's aren't, there's just not five stars. It's just a complete lie. They never had five stars. They might have two. I would go leave a negative review just because they lied. Maybe we should do that. Maybe we should do that on the app store to those people. Hi, I'm giving a negative review for the false advertising. <laughs> Yep. Failure. <clears throat> <gasps> Baby and mom, idle three D simulator. This is a this is a mobile game about me and Chat's mom. Here it is. I like how the sperm has voice acting, guys. Week 18. Okay, so you can feed the baby an apple. You can feed him I like how he just like it, it the implication is like he threw a dumbbell at her fucking ovaries. And then she tried to feed the baby a stinky sock. <clears throat> I would not. If I played this game, I would choose to not feed the baby a stinky sock. <gasps> and then she drank water and immediately pissed herself. To be fair, that's what happens to me while I'm streaming. That's why I don't, I don't hydrate during streams because then I immediately have to piss. By the way, that just reminded me I have to hydrate. Everybody hydrate. What kind of sound do you think my sperm made when it penetrated the womb? When it penetrated the egg? You think it said anything? What do you think it did? It said sploosh. Iku. One or two? Mud flood. Fucking dead. Wow. Okay. 
<clears throat> um, why does the renovation sim have to start with heartbreak? See, that's the best part. Is this isn't even a renovation sim? This this is one of those things where it's like, try to guess what kind of game this is from watching any of these advertisements. Like, what kind of game do you think this is? Like, do you really think it's going to be a Candy Crush? Like, what the fuck is it going to be? Like, like, oh my god, anything but a Candy Crush, maybe. That, that's, that's fucking Edward from Stardew Valley. Right? His name's Edward. Mm. <laughs> My husband. For all these women get divorced or like they get kicked out of the house and their first instinct is to run to an abandoned building. Like they have no other options just immediately to an abandoned building that's fucking collapsing. Like the most unsafe environment that you could possibly be in. Like just straight to an abandoned building covered, filled with liquid shit. The towels blocking the window was a poor choice. Right. And you think to yourself, I would do that differently. And then you download the game and it's fucking Candy Crush. Someone in the chat said, this is, this is why there need to be women's shelters. Yes, there need to be women's shelters so so fucking freshly divorced women don't, I don't know, drown in liquid shit? Is it? This is fucking insane. Specifically for people who have been kicked out of the house for having their period. Mike, this problem is way more common than you think it is. My big fat swampy wedding. Okay. Dude, that was deafening. That really hurt my ears. <laughs> Hi, friends. Okay. Um. That in. Oh, look at the name of the. <laughs> Look at the name of the video. Look, look. Oh. I'm having a hard time imagining the situation where somebody sees this ad and it makes them download something. And by the way, what am I even fucking downloading? Like, 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 where's the fucking, like, download now? Like, what's the game? What is this? This is a CIA sleeper cell activation video. It's an emoji kind of, I mean, th this... Oh, so you can use these fucking, uh, right, okay. Man, fuck me. Holy shit. Well, I mean, like, it's definitely gonna, you can't say it's not gonna get your attention. I mean, it's gonna puncture your fucking eardrums. 
He's definitely going to get your attention. But I'm just, again, I'm having such a, again, with so many of these ads, I can't see somebody downloading it. I say that, but I downloaded and played two of these games tonight. <gasps> Stuck porn. Please, help me! Huh? Fine, I'll help you. But only if you tell me how you get all those legendary heroes. Well, that's easy. Just enter the gift code SOS 2023, and you'll get them. Stop the crap. I already used that gift code and got millions of units of food and wood, and I used those resources to build my settlement. But there were no legendary heroes. You bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry, please don't do this. I'll tell you my secret. Just use the link in the description to download the game, and any new player will receive 777 draws without spending a penny. You won't have to worry about not being able to fight off zombies because those 777 draws are going to get you at least 10 legendary heroes. You'll instantly have a team with 10 million power. What are you waiting for? Download it now. State of survival. Play now. Look. So the idea was her. She got Please. stuck. So the idea is like what like one of her tits is bigger than the other one cuz like like significantly bigger than the other one Fine, I'll help you. But only if you tell me how you get all those legends heroes. Well, that's easy. Just enter the gift code SOS 2023 and you'll get them. Stop the crap. I already used that gift code and got millions of units of settlement. But there were no legendary heroes. You bitch. You bitch. And she pushes her back through the fence to get actually getting her on stuck. That was the problem. She got stuck. I'm sorry. Please don't do this. I'll tell you my secret. Just use the link in the description to download the game. You like the ADR fucking like vo like du the dubbing of her voice acting? And any new player will receive 777 draws without spending a penny. It wouldn't help her get good rolls because she's already deep into the game. This is this is the the fucking game. We we watched an advertisement for this one earlier. Going to get you at least ten legendary heroes. You'll instantly have a team with ten million power. What are you waiting for? Download it now. State of survival. Play now. Man, that is fucked. We had how many times? We had we had two instances of stuck porn tonight. This game looks super good. Okay, you don't like the game. You like her tits. Do me a favor. Go to google.com. Are you on a web browser right now? Open up your web your web browser and go to google.com and type in boobs and then click images. You're welcome. You're welcome. Now you don't have to download this horrible game. Did you notice the warp effect they applied to her tits to make them fatter? That is what that is. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's it. That's what they. That that's what Fat TV did to Mary Jane's mouth in the Spider Man video. Please help me. Huh? Fine. Huh? I'll help you, but only if you tell. But Mary Jane, I am gay. Her tit shrank when she moved her arm in front of it because they didn't want it to look bad. Oh, that would have been horrible if this if that effect looked bad and she had like a fat arm. That would have been horrible. Oh god forbid. It deflates. Mike, I opened up Twitch and saw your thumbnail being a sperm trying to penetrate an egg. We, I wasn't even trying to make that one the thumbnail. That fucking rules. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. That's fucking... Dude, God shines upon me. Oh, wait. There is no God. If there's one takeaway from tonight, it's that there is no God. You like that character, by the way? That's like... It's fucking... Who is she? Who is who is this character imitating? Harley Quinn, right? Discount Harley Harley Quinn. Jinx. 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 
The tit got big again. Look, it shrank, and then it got big. It got big. Look, look. Don't do this. I'll tell you my secret. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's amazing! And she restocks herself. Why did she restock herself? Just use the link in the description to download the game, and any new player will receive seven hundred and seventy-seven draws. Without She's got like some kind of like quantum tit where like it's only big if you're looking at it or something. Stuck. It's 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 fucking expanding and contracting. Why is so many dude, you know what I'm learning from these commercials? That that so many people are horny for stuck. Like, why is stuck so fucking, like, erotic to people? Holy shit. No clue why they're wearing masks. They're furries? How dare you steal my clients? And why are you why am I so stylish? Because I'm playing Love Nikki. Is there like a story I'm supposed to be following here? I'm not I'm not fucking Love Nikki. Yeah, Love Nikki is an addictive graphic game featuring high quality graphics and a rich and captivating. I see I believe that's gameplay footage right there. It's like a visual novel. Wow, is this a, is this a mobile game actually showing you the fucking gameplay of the of the game it's advertising? Is this serious? Vampire, fairy tale, fox tale, angel's wings, map. Holy shit, that happens? Besides, with PK system, you can beat others in the styling competition. Where can, can we download, download the, game? the game? Just tap the button below to download the game for free. That's an actual game my little sister plays it. Well, I mean, it's still terrible, but but like, at least the advertising the advertisement isn't fucking completely irrelevant. It's not like somebody's foot fungus and fucking somebody getting divorced over foot fungus for absolutely no reason. At least it's actually showing you the fucking game that's actually they're, they're advertising. Care for your own horse. Not a real game, but a classic. It's like you've never cared for a horse before. Oh, this is a okay. This is fake. It's it's a it's a meme. It's like you've never cared for a horse before. I need to blink. Can't you see? How did I get stuck with you, as my caretaker? My eyes need moisture. Click on my eyeball so I can blink. <laughs> This must be hell, and you are my tormentor. Finally you figure it out, and yet it was so simple. You know you're worthless, right? You can't even properly care for a horse. How are you gonna make it in this world? What are you doing now? My hair isn't tangled. Can I get a minute to to just to fucking get eased into that? Like you just you open with that. You just that's how you start it. That's how you start it. We're just gonna start it like that. Like I can't have a second to just get to just 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 fucking like like. Can you put a finger in there first? You know, like we're just ramming it in there, huh? We're just we're just going straight to the. Maybe spit on it a little bit. Nothing. Just, just, just fucking, fucking raw, huh? Wow. And and you know she's loving it, right? Look at her. She's in, she's enjoying that. 
But you know who's not gonna who, you know who's not gonna like it? You know who's not gonna be into this? Look at Stinky. It's Stinky too. You know who's not gonna like it? Her uh his wife who is standing just out of frame. And right after he finishes licking that armpit, this is gonna zoom out. And you're gonna see that woman going, <laughs> and then there's gonna be a choice, right? Where she could divorce her husband or she can, you know, tolerate him or whatever. And then the hand is going to choose divorce. And then she's going to end up going out to a fucking abandoned building. And then somebody's going to hose all the fucking shit off of her body. And then put her in a lobster costume. And then it's going to say Project Makeover. Lick. Why aren't you licking? You have to use the lick. You you should have used the lick button. Should have used the lick button. And then he does it. And then he does a deep puff. He does a deep puff. Look. Two licks and a deep puff. <gasps> Bro, someone has to go. To, yeah, like someone's got to go to jail. No trial. No trial. Just straight to prison. That's called technique. Do armpit freaks do this? Like, does, does somebody... Somebody is projecting these fetishes. Yeah, we've, we've speculated that before. We've speculated the, the, the projection theory. Um, we do, yes. What do you mean, we? Ladies and gentlemen, your new thumbnail. We... 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 There's, there's hair, too, so she's got a hairy armpit. Why? Okay, which, do, which, which frame do we want as the thumbnail? I think we want one where his tongue is, is pressed up against her fucking pit. Like, imagine animating this. Like, there's no way this guy wasn't fucking hard while he was animating this. Okay, armpit freaks. What do you like about armpits? The, they smell good. Tight. They're smooth. Why are there so fucking many of you? Musk. Dude. Bro, he's fucking licking it like it's a fucking... Like, like how many licks to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop, bro? Holy fuck. Yeah, this is our thumbnail. Why does she appear to be liking it so much? Like, I feel like if somebody was really, really attracted to my armpits, I'd be like... Like, like not like like. First of all, annoyed by that, and then it would just be like, like grossed out. I'd be like, no, you're not gonna. No, I'm not gonna. You like, you know, I'm. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna indulge this. 
Like women indulge this. Women will be like, yeah, get in there and, and, and enjoy. Like lick that shit and smell it. They indulge this. They let, they let you guys do it. Like they let you do it. Why aren't they fucking leave, like, kicking your ass to the curb? You know, like, what the fuck is going on? Superiority fetish? Women indulge foot kink, and this isn't any weirder than that. Yes, it is. I, I think it's, I think it is. Yes, I, I think it is weirder. I mean, it's an armpit. It, it's, 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 it's a fucking just, it's, it's, it's just the breeding ground for bacteria. Is it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Feet are weirder than armpits. They're not, guys. Come on. Come on. An armpit isn't even... like the An armpit is an absence of something. Like, I don't know how to explain this. Like, you're, you're, you're attracted to negative space. Guys. Your kink is for negative space. Like a vagina, spoken like somebody who's never interacted with a vagina. You know? She's looking away coyishly because she loves it. She likes, she likes it. She likes it. He's going to huff, he's going to huff it up. This is fucked up. And now she's just like, dude, who is she? Okay, who is she? Help her. Who is she to either of those characters? Right? Like, is it, is it her? Like, they look ashamed, like they did something wrong in there, you know? Is she his, his wife? Like, what is it? She's horrified. She's also very stinky, right? So he would, yeah, he, right, right. He would love her, actually. Why not knee pit fetish? If you are horny for armpits, okay, then you're also horny for, for this. Yeah, how's it? Yeah. What do you think of that? That get you off? Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Look in there. That's hot, right? You like that, you freaks? You like that, you sick fucks? Or the back of somebody's knee? Mike, that's TOS. Remember... Remember fucking when I said, when I was saying how I didn't understand foot kink and I asked you, where's hand kink? Same concept. Where is, where is hand, where is hand fetish? Where is hand fetish? Hand kink exists. It's, it's 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 gonna be like two guys. My name is Yoshikage Kira. I am thirty three years old. He had a hand kink. It's a JoJo thing. I don't remember that. It's in the manga. It's in the manga. My ex had a hand kink. Oh my god. Did you not watch part four? I don't remember. 
Oh, he fucking walked with right. He had the hand. He was walking around with the hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I, remember. Oh, I remember. I remember. Yeah, he had the hand. It was like his girlfriend. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. I remember. Um, I, I, I mean, like, did he have a hand? Did he have a hand kink though, or was he just a fucking insane serial killer? Oh wait, those things go hand in hand, don't they? Because if you tell me you have a hand kink, I am going to look at you and tell you you're fucking crazy. Hand kink. Like, at least have a foot kink, for fuck's sake. Does nothing. Wait till you hear about hair kink. How are you guys fucking hair? You know who's got a hair kink? Remember that the um What the fuck was his name? The guy who had the, the Sonic the Hedgehog Hot Girls Club or whatever that was? So the hottest girls in Sonic the Hedgehog? Remember that? Hot Chick Heaven. Yeah, hot chick heaven. He had a hair kink. Yeah. Wamba. Thank you for 27 months. I made a little bit of a poopy, but I gotta make more later. Thanks, bud. Have you ever heard of a hair job? Where she like wraps her hair around your dick and then the, and then does what? Can we like a body part without having to call it a kink? Apparently not. Well, I mean, like, do you admire an armpit? Like, do you think it's like kind of something about it makes you f like makes you feel it's like, ooh, that's you know, that's kind of a sexy part of her body. That's nice. Or do you bury your face in it and fucking lick it deeply, like it's a fucking ice cream cone? You know, like, I think there's a difference, right? Like, I like fat asses. Does that mean I, do I have an ass kink? I don't think I have an ass kink, guys. I think I just like fucking dumpies. No, it's not a kink, guys. No. No, that's not a kink. He loves smelling assholes. Did I say assholes or did I just say fat asses? Yes, you hypocrite. Guys, if you like penis, do you have a fucking cock kink? Like, do you have a penis kink? Like, if that did, this, this is a conversation about language, guys. No, it, no, no, no. No. Chad's saying, yeah, they're saying yes. They're saying yes to be contrarian. I have a penis fetish. No, you just like dick. You don't have a fucking penis fetish. If you like boobs, you have a boob kink? Boob, nobody's ever even said boob. Okay, you know what? You know when you have a boob kink? When you're static and you like, tr like triple J size, triple J cup tits. That's when you have a boob kink. Yes, I like my women with triple J cups. Yes, that's when you have a kink. Un until then, you just like boobs. Fucking hell. We call that hyper. You know what I have a kink for? This amazing audience. Guys, thank you so much. That's weird. I didn't know. I shouldn't have said that like that. I was trying to be funny, but it came out weird. Guys. Thank you so much for being here. I'm not going to end the stream, but I just want to take a moment to thank everybody. It was supposed to be a segue, but it came out weird. Guys, thank you so much for being here and watching the stream tonight and supporting um, this channel. You guys are fucking amazing. Um, it's, that, it's just that time. I like to do this once a night where I thank everybody for coming and, uh, and hanging out. And I'm having a lot of fun. You know, I, I, I keep, I've always said this is my ta favorite type of stream to do. Um, and, uh, just, just, just looking at the dumb bullshit is my favorite type of, type of stream. So 
Guys, thanks for supporting it and coming and watching and hanging out. Sad Sheep, thanks for the five months. I appreciate you, chat. And hey, thank you again for getting me to 50K. And I just want to put this out there, guys. If anybody here is new to the channel, I did see a couple of new names here tonight. We even had some fresh freaks tonight. Guys, I'm going to pop some links in the chat um, for your perusal. It's my Twitter, my TikTok, my YouTube channels. we got a full stream channel and a highlight channel. Uh, shorts channel as well. Um, see you tomorrow, guys. Stream's not ending. Uh, if you want to support what I do, you can do it on, of course, you could do it on Twitch, but you could also do it on Coffee and Patreon. There are links there as well. Or you could do it on our beautiful Discord server where we have subscriptions enabled. Um, and uh, you can also just, uh, you could just get, you know, get stream notifications there. You don't have to be in the server if you don't want. Please, if you're new here, click that Discord link and... Read the read the um, read the rules, the instructions, rather, on the landing page for more information. It's a great server, great time. Everybody's got um, you know, just the best stories, the wildest times in the Jabroni Mike server. It is just a a a a, a, a hoot nanny of a good time. No dildo talk. That's true. Not allowed to talk about dildos. Um. But uh, you could talk about other things. Dicks be floppin'. <laughs> Dicks be floppin'. <laughs> Dicks be floppin'. Thank you so much for five months. How have I not noticed your Twitch name before? Did you just change it? You must. There's no way you've been fucking... You, you've been subbed to me for five months and I haven't noticed that before. I, you just changed your Twitch name, didn't you? Dicks be floppin'. Holy shit. You just changed it. Oh, fucking. That's amazing. Their name is Dicks Be Floppin'. 69 420. Oh my god. I love Dicks Be Floppin'. It's spelled, by the way, if you're, if you're watching on YouTube, it's spelled D I X B Y. Underscore flopping like it's like it's a first and last name. <laughs> Ooh, ah, uh, well, fuck. Got you got you got my attention. Dude, that's a Street Fighter character. Who's that? Um. Chat the fuck? Chat, what the fuck? What the fuck just happened? Whoever also another another kink that the people who make these advertisements are um projecting is like shaving women. Right. Like shaving women bald. Lobster, please. Please, please, lobster. I, I, I fucking... Th these people belong in, in, in prison and or hell. Humiliation kink. She kisses her, okay? But then Chun Chun Li, apparently, right, Chad? Fucking, I don't know, like like regurgitates up a pregnancy test. And the pregnancy test is C T. So like, what does that what does that mean, guys? What does that mean? Guys, that's not a pre that's not a pregnancy test. That's a COVID test. Control and test line. If they're both solid, you have COVID. 
It's a positive pregnancy test. Guys, is it pregnancy or COVID? Stop fucking fucking around. Which is it, guys? C stands for COVID and T stands for test. No, it the fuck does not, dude. She's pregnant with the bird. Inshallah, I am issuing a fatwa on the inventor of the woman's half-shaved haircut. Is it bad if I like that haircut? Remember Peppermint? Peppermint's haircut was not the reason I hated her. My, that means you have a hair kink. Okay, cool. So is this a pregnancy test or a COVID test? Pregnancy test? I haven't, guys, I've never seen a pregnancy test, okay? I've never used a pregnancy test. I've never seen a pregnancy test. Okay. They're identical. So it could be COVID, it could be it could be pregnancy. Well. Either way, Ch uh, Chun Li is really unhappy with the result. And I guess blames her for it. Vampire, thanks for uh, 50 months, buddy. Oh, that's okay. It's all Well, I'll I'll think about I'll think about forgiving you, Vampire Jason. The implication is that the girl slipped it into Chun Li's mouth as a surprise. What? <gasps> Guys, this is this makes no fucking sense. Why would she do that? During the kiss. Yeah, I got that, but why would she do that? Why would she slip it into to achieve what? I know what trope they're going for. Hi, Hedgehog. Can you please fucking explain it to me? Because I'm... She wanted to give her good news. If one of them had to pee into the pregnancy test, that means she slipped in a peed test. That means that the piss test was in both of their mouths. Surprise, they are prego. So she chucks the... I don't know what the fuck happened. Maybe she like... Guys, that's a horse. Guys, it's a... Sh it's a shorse. <laughs> it's a fucking shorse. <laughs> what? It's a shorse. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> what the fuck is that thing, man? <laughs> it's a shorse. Or a hork. <laughs> it could be a hork too, guys. Mike, that's a seahorse. This escaped from the fucking Mother 3 laboratory, the Chimera lab. Holy shit. Wow, what the fuck? Holy shit, I hate it. I fucking hate this. Look how not, like, uh, 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 aqua dynamic it is. Look at that. Look, look at <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> That's a weird pokey fusion, guys. It has balls. Kind of. It has no enus. Is aqua dynamic not a word, guys? Is it not? Hydrodynamic. It's gonna be hyd hydrodynamic. And look how quickly she's... Rowing away. Your mother is hydrodynamic. I'm I'm just baffled by the piss. Yeah, the like if you're pregnant, I don't want the baby. If it's COVID, you gave me COVID. Fuck you, bitch. Well, well. also, um. I just, I just, this, this isn't, this is a waste of time to try to understand this. The Hork is awesome. You like it, Vin? Could be a new, um, like, fantasy creature, right? New life with Hork?
Dude, the hork is so good. I would love to fucking... If this game had actually had horks in it, I would fucking download this game right now. I would do it. I would. They never put on the lobster suit. They never put it on. It's such a cock tease. I would download this shit in a second if it actually had- if it had horks in it. Oopsies. Time to throw out all the baby shit! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh my god, her face! Oh, it took her seconds to fucking get rid of the shit, bro. It took her seconds. Bro, she, she realized that the baby was in the fucking- in, in the washing machine. And she was like, well, that's just the way she goes. Time to start throwing out the shit. <laughs> Finally, a sewing room. <laughs> yeah. Finally, I can have my own office, right? Holy fuck. <laughs> it's so good. Oopsies. The guys, the baby will die. But hey, that corpse will be very, very clean. And smelling like... Fresh linen. Look, look, look at this shot! Look at that! <laughs> look at that, man. Oh. And the music, too. It is cinematic. It is cinematic. That's a Kubrick shot. <laughs> Fuck. And then she just immediately starts throwing shit out. Yeah. Bro, that's that's, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> that's it. That is so good. What the fuck? What the actual fuck? That's brilliant. Dude, imagine being this stupid, right? Like, imagine... That... Oh, my God. And it's it's not like just... Impl it, 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 it's not like a gotcha that didn't actually happen. Guys, that happened. The, this baby is dead. And there's like a, the fucking psycho OST? Like, the, the psycho fucking score? She needed a Luke... This is what happens when Luke's leave their slow living bloggers alone for like fucking more than five minutes at a time. You can hear the baby banging around in there like coins. <laughs> oh man. And it's like, wow, doesn't the baby's room look much nicer now that there's no baby shit in it? Penny and Flo. Finding home. What is, what is this game? What is this? It's, it's another Candy Crush? It's really another Candy Crush?
of all the reasons to redecorate, they chose that. Well, again, it's 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 fucking shock shocking to get your attention. It's it's same reason you had a guy fucking licking an armpit. Same reason you had a woman with fucking shit on her face if there was like piles of shit in her bed. Same reason you had all this fucking shit tonight, right? It's just it's it's shock value to get your attention, and it fucking works, dude. Dude, this is what I have to do to like you know grow my content. Like, I should just smear shit on my face and fucking chalk babies in washing machines. Like, this is what I should, this is what I have to be doing, guys. Mike, um, you already do that. Well, I gotta do it more. You did eat poop. It wasn't real poop, though. I need to do real poop. I need to smear real shit on my face next time, guys. Lick, lick armpits. Um, what else, chat? Um, lick feet. Love, don't leave me, please. It's called Emperor and Beauties. Yeah, don't leave me, please. <laughs> What's the matter? My life. She wants to divorce. She is not a anymore. Nobody wants her. 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 Nobody want. Nobody want. How is this going to make anybody download this game, guys? Like, what is this going to fucking do for anybody? Like, like, I, what, like, I don't know what it is. I don't know what's happening. What is the actual fucking selling point of this? Like, what, what, what is this? It's for morons. But I, I mean, like, not even morons are going to fucking be interested in this because this advertisement doesn't do anything. This advertisement this gives you no information. Like, it doesn't... The dan- the... Nobody want this game. Let's just get this over with. <laughs> Dude, this baby dragon has a really rough time of it, though. But th this baby dragon... Is... He's got it rough, right? All right, I'm gonna tell you why this fucking game sucks, okay? Because, because this, this... Okay, this middle evolution of this dragon, it turns into a bird. Look. It turns into a, bir a bird-like dragon. Like a bird, look, look, it's got a beak and feathers. That's the middle evolution. Okay, and then when it evolves again, it's just back to being like a reptilian, scaly dragon. Why did it go back and forth like that? They stole models. <laughs> so this this dragon locks the other one in the toilet. And then like a sheriff comes in apparently. Who's the sheriff? Is this your, your the playable character? The, look at that. Holy fuck, bro. That is bad. This dragon was Ooh. just basting and shit. Like, somebody called the cops. Ooh. Look at that. Fuck me. <laughs> it's, 
And he, he's stinky. <laughs> You're so stinky. Get out of the fucking house. And then he ejects the dragon from the house? Like, is he good or bad? Like, he rescued him, but then he ejected him from the premises? You gotta go find your... Make your own way in this world, kid. Life comes at you fast. Right? Go find somebody else to play a solitaire game to put a roof over your head. Because you know what? I'm, do I'm done with you. You've disappointed me one too many times, shit dragon. Time to solve your own fucking problems. That's his shit. That's his shit. Okay, this video is called Pragandanant. Dot NPV. Guys, those are sperm. Collecting sperm. Collecting the sperm makes her more and more pregnant. Look, 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 look. Each sperm she gets, she becomes more pregnant. Look. <laughs> the original video did not have Pizza Tower music. It's because the it was DMCA. So thank you, Gummy Worms, for editing this. Hold to fly. Dude, why is Pizza Tower music actually perfect for this? This is like Pizza Tower platforming. Sperm Tower. No. Oh, man. That's the game. <laughs> That's the game! It's like a home run derby, but you're fucking ejecting a fetus from your vagina. That's the game. She's a baddie. Hero Wars. Uh-oh. Imagine if the baby landed in a washing machine. That would be a fucking 10 out of 10 commercial. 666. 666. 666. Six six, call me, and it's it's a demon. He he's not okay. He's polishing his sword. Got concerned for a minute, guys. But hey, at least his wife wasn't fucking a horse this time. Remember, no matter how bad it is, your wife could always be fucking a horse. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, remember him? Remember him? Remember that character? Th okay, th this is starting to remotely... Res this is still not the game that's being advertised, but at least this som somewhat looks like it. Choose the next level. Play now. Choose the next... Oh, no. Um, God, the fact that they would start a, a, a fucking advertisement like this. There's a baby launching ad for the original Xbox. Her ass is visible through the dress. Holy fuck it is. There's no sword in the first shot. You would be able to see it. Well, I mean, I think it's 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 cleverly uh No, you should see it. You should see it. Okay. It says Sigma Mel.
The Calamorningan. Gan. See ya! <laughs> Lily's gone to play now. What about the fucking gameplay? What about the fucking gameplay, dude? Holy shit. <laughs> That's the get. What's the gameplay? Leaving your wife? Lily's garden got more ads and she's a bitch. This game is notorious for weird ads. I've never heard of this before. Where it, it does it doesn't show you a, it doesn't even pretend to show you gameplay. Like a lot of these will will show you like fake gameplay. This doesn't even do that. This just shows you absolutely nothing except something completely irrelevant. Holy shit. There's a video, a YouTube video with all of these in chronological order. I fucking, somebody please email that to me. I would love to watch it. Uh, Archaeologessi, thanks for 10 months. Do you play as Lily or do you play as the, the lever husband? It's the lore and it's very important to the game. How? It's another Candy Crush. It's a Candy Crush game. There's an ad for the game where Lily and her friends j Jill off on laundromat washing machines. Best. Matt Pat had made a video on Lily's garden. Dude. <laughs> Holy shit. This almost feels like a meme. Like, this, does, this doesn't even feel like a real game. The game exists. 90% of these are Candy Crush clones with bait shock ads. We're gonna, we'll, we'll, wa we'll watch that. We'll watch all of them one day. Maybe next week, if Rev is around, we'll watch all of them. It's a Candy Crush game with story, specifically made for wine moms on Facebook. It has an actual story. It does have an actual story. And it, it, and it's this. She's pregnant and her, her husband was like, you're pregnant. See ya. I, I feel like somebody, like, like if you told me somebody was out there making mobile game ads for games that don't exist just to fuck with people and like flood the zone with shit, I would believe it. I would believe it. Share the link to the full Lily lore video. Just, just email this shit to me. My email is in the chat. Thank you, Coley. Lumpy has made some. Lumpy, are you here? Did you make fake mobile ads? It's pretty based. Um, somebody's what? Does does somebody's husband leave them after they find out they're pregnant, and then it just ends? I think I I think I I actually I think I saw one on Twitter once. Oh, uh, what you're talking about. It was something to do with, like... It, w it was, like, yeah, like a, like a mobile ad, but it was, like, a, it, had like a, it had, like, a creepypasta element to it, right? Matchington Mansion. My husband. You could be single mother or marry again, and it says Zane Stalooge. I love the idea that the person, like the supposed idiot playing these games for the advertisement is like deliberately trying to sabotage the character. Right? Like like to like 
Because they think it would be funny? You know why? Because we would all do that. Like, that's the conceit right there. The idea that we would want to download this game so we could do a better job of helping her. But actually, I want to download this game so I can fuck up her life worse than this guy did. Like, instead of putting the dynamite in the stove, I would put it in the baby's mouth. You know what I mean? Like, I want to know, I want to see if I could fuck this up worse than he did. Is it possible to do this worse than him? <laughs> like, yeah. Like, yeah, let me smash the windows. Fuck you, bitch. Help them. Matchington Mansion. What are these naked men? Guns of glory. Right, that guy got shot. Fat TV. Dude, man, man, a bolt. Man, a bolt. Man, a bolt. Dude, the man cannon. <laughs> Guys, that uh, th that unironically uh, looks fucking great. Dude. How many how many of you would actually play th I would play this. I would play this. If this was the game, which we know it's not, right? The American Revolution, colorized. That's a thing in Peace Walker. What, a manipult? The man cannons, they're very effective. All right, so there's some more fucking horrid, horrid shit coming up here. Another one of their kinks is, is is like their their projection kinks is like women with hairy legs. Like they they like hairy legs on women. Blue Jay, thanks for the uh, the raid. So I, I think what's happening here is like she's the one with the stink kink. And like she... Terrible time for a raid though. I apologize for that. Yeah. She's the one with the stink kink. And like she's trying to force it on him. She's like she wants... Her... She gets off when like men enjoy her her her, her funk. When men enjoy her disgusting smells, like, that makes her fucking, that gets her off. Right. And if I'm not mistaken, she's getting high on her own supply right here. She's huffing her own filthy underwear. Is that what I think I'm seeing? Remember before I was saying, I think the, the, these people belong to, deserve to go straight to prison with no trial? Summary execution. Z fucking put him against the wall. Like, actually, time to fuck. Yeah. Up against the fucking wall. Yeah. Face the wall. Blue Jay, thank you for the sub. Freak! Thank you so much, buddy. Appreciate that, man. Holy fuck. Dude. Look, 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 and she's like, ooh. ooh. Wow. And then she sticks her, her, her foot in her innocent, by the way, gamer boyfriend's face. Okay. He's literally just trying to enjoy his PSP. He's playing Peace Walker on the PSP. Mike's view count would drop to double digits if those people were killed. I'm not saying the people enjoying it. I'm, I'm, I'm saying the people making these advertisements.
need to be killed. She skipped the usual cup and huff and went straight to her underwear. Mike, if he doesn't bust a load over her game over her gamer scent, he is not a true gamer. She has Amazon forest armpits. The Amazon. That's fucking Fangorn forest, bro. There's ants in there. You fucking kidding me? He knocks her off the bed. That that's the least of what she deserves. Okay. Someone chat said de said deserved. Charm up. Dude, you can lick. You can lick. See? That's called washing your feet, chat. It's not that hard. Bucket of goop. This is pretty good goop physics. She slips and busts her ass. Get gacked, you dumb bitch. <laughs> Get gooped, you idiot. These ads. You look so cute. Wow. Guys, time to have class. Wow. How about the others? Uh. Is this that Tim Burton bullshit again? Hey. <laughs> I, I want to say that th th this looks like a gameplay, though, doesn't it? Like, this looks like actual gameplay. Like, he's walking around the. the is it? Like, what's this? Is he doing. It is. It's dead, but it's a dead by daylight asset swap. I say it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. It, it, it's like a Tumblr, but instead of like a monster, it's like a weird Tumblr sexy man. So hoot. Is this a mobile game? <laughs> it's Identity V. It has a lot of Tumblr sexy men. It's, it's called Identity V. Right. Um... It's a mobile game, though. Like, it's a multiplayer mobile game. It's popular. They did a crossover with Death Note, somebody said. So, like, the, the killer is, like, like, uh, like, Light Yagame will, like, chase you through the fucking... the castle or whatever. Are you able to mod Genshin Impact for bounties? I found a mod that changes one of the characters that you have into Shrek. Definitely not. Like, I'm definitely not allowed to do that, no. I mean, like... I could look into that, I guess. I, I, don't, I don't think so. It's this shit again. Okay. Mm. Yeah, never feed the pregnant lady a stinky sock. PSA. <gasps> oh, these women are always pissing themselves. Jesus Christ. It it was bird shit. <laughs> Says sorry for the quality. <laughs> I don't get how the fuck do they get away with this? 
stinky breath. The prince invite you to dance. Make up. Her breath is still stinky. That w would help, though. He fucking died! And then she went to jail for, like, regicide. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, the... Your next Disney princess, ladies and gentlemen. As soon as they're done making fucking vomitous looking remakes. I saw a tweet. They're showing all the, the live action Disney movies. And talking about how they are without fucking question. Maybe the ugliest movies ever fucking made. And I, I, I really do think so. Like, guys, I'm sorry, but, like, did you see The Little Mermaid fucking, like, the trailer? Did you see what, it, like, they, all the characters look like and shit? And then I saw, I, I had never seen, like, The Beauty and the Beast and, like, seen what that looks like. That is fucking vomitous, dude. They are so fucking ugly. Holy shit. They are dark and dull. They look like ass. What the fuck? Why is Disney doing this? There's no artistry to make it look real. There's no, they're not stylizing anything. Like, they're, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just... Flounder is a fucking fish. It's like a... It's like, go to the fucking supermarket... And, like, go look at the fucking dead fish in the seafood section. That's just what he looks like. He looks like a dead fish. That's somebody, like, animated by squeezing its mouth. It's fucking rancid. People generally like those movies, even if a lot of us on the internet don't. They look horrible, though. The references are off the cartoon and then they translate it to a real animal. I mean, like, I guess, like... Okay, let's be let's be real, though. If you tried to make, like, a, a, in a live-action setting, like, a CGI, like, like, Sebastian, he would be horrifying. He would be horrifying, dude. He would be nightmare fuel for for children. So don't do it. No, 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 you're right. No, no, that the answer is to not do it. The answer is to not do it. Yeah. Finding Nemo. It, well, I mean, like making it just making it entirely CG. Like you, you might as well not. You know, I was fucking anyway. I, I, my theory for this, by the way, is that the cat has been like spraying in her mouth while she's asleep. You know what I'm talking about? You know when cats spray? <laughs> the music is fucking infuriating. Cat Jenkum. Wasn't there like... An episode of South Park where like fucking people were huffing cat piss to get high? <laughs> It was called cheesing. The he right, the one where it was it was like a uh, 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 a heavy metal parody. Right? Like every time you huff cat piss, like the world like your your perception turns into the heavy metal cartoons. This is where the fucking people who make these advertisements belong. Behind bars. First to life. Okay, guys. Content warning. The name of the video is Sweat Frog. Alright, that's a lot of sperm. 
Okay. Boy. Pale skin, dark skin. Burgers, light eyes. Cigarettes, red hair. And then what the fuck? What is, what is that? How many cock porn like finger family videos did we watch during the last finger family though? Like how many was how many like yeah, the dies of cock. That yeah, dies of cock. <laughs> the fucking dies of cock. You know, cock porn for kids. Holy shit. I love when the punchline is like the the baby is black. Isn't that so funny, black baby? When the when the when it's like we, that that is the joke, black baby. Isn't that fucking hilarious? Really, really funny. Very funny. Very funny, black baby. It's never a black couple with the white baby. It, yeah, that's true. That's true. That's never reversed. That that trope is never reversed. Because that's not. I guess that's not funny. Is it, is it less funny if it's reversed? Is it? It's more sperm. Okay. Guys, the games where you play as the sperm don't look that bad. Like, devil's advocate here, guys. Pay attention in class. Instead of looking at fucking mobile ad games for sperm. Take a pick. Turn around. Yeah, should you do that right in front of her, though? Take my pick. Sorry, I lost control. Guys, he's fucking six. Chat saying rusticated? What? Rusticate. Oh, dude. This is the same. Okay. Pay attention in class. Where are you guys seeing the word rusticated? It's a Vinny thing. Okay. How dare you take my pick? I like your top. I like your top. He's got Riz. Aw, so sweet. Oh, he fucking he he clutched that, dude. Perfect lie. How good a liar are you? Can you fool mom? Uh, baby's first foray into fucking sociopathy. Yeah, let's teach kids to lie. This is a great game for kids. Vinny watched one of the ads for this game and, ended, and it ended with the teacher yelling, you are rusticated. Rusticated is not a word though, right? Yes. I feel like that's not, I feel like that's, it is, apparently it is, meaning, James, pay attention, oh, he fucking, he sees her pussy, holy shit, that's the end of the, that's it, that's it, that was the commercial, A super old way of saying bard. It means like to suspend a student from a university as a punishment. Rusticated. Huh. I learned something today. You are rusticated. She's totally my type. At least Project Makeover is like, you know, embracing like lesbians. Like that's cool. A lot of, le a lot of LG... LGBT rep in the in the fucking in the fucking project makeover ads, right? That's cool. We don't claim them. Well, they claim you. Sorry.
<laughs> Just throwing combs at her? Oh no. What? Mm -hmm. What is the third thing? That's like a fuck some kind of fucking eldritch horror? What is that? Look at the thing on the right. It's like a fucking Hylix character. What is that? Dude, that one had a happy ending. See, you thought putting on the roller skates was going to be a fuck up, but it wasn't. It rolled her right into her arms. Then she caught her and it was like a romantic moment. Love wins. Wow, you know what? I guess the, and the, as the consumer of this advertisement, I guess I don't need to play this game now because really uh, that's been resolved and there's no way I could do that better. Guess I'll never be downloading this. Right? Right, guys? No reason to ever play this shit. It says the three genders. What is your gender? Lesbian, gay, or bisexual? <laughs> Lesbian, okay. And then you, which one suits to you? Polygamy, pansexual, monogamy. So this is the person playing the game in the bottom right? Okay. What the fuck, what the fuck was that? Ah, yes, a pansexual lesbian. Someone in chat will tell you that's possible. Don't, don't, you know, don't, wor don't worry about it. Someone in chat, no, someone in chat will say that you're, you're ignorant for, for, for thinking that. There's coins you collect. And how do the coins affect your uh, gender slash sexuality? Right? Mike, no, he doesn't know he's going to get into the discourse. I'm trying to help him from getting into the discourse. I'm trying to save him. Mike, I thought you were one of the good ones, Hell Whiskers says, and then they posted a Sag. Motherfucker, do you have that, like, copy-pasted somewhere on your computer? And just you and you just whip it out, like, sp specifically to piss me off? Like, are you copying and pasting that from, like, a Word file somewhere, like, specifically to piss me off? You are, aren't you? I can type that in five seconds, but it's ready to go. Okay. Shove it up your ass. Let's survive together and fight off the zombies in Last Fortress. Oh, it's zombie virus. Dude, those zombies are fucking stacked, though. Hold on. Look at that zombie's tits and ass. Holy shit. Holy fuck. Vaporwave, thanks for seven months. God damn. Mike, kids piss the zombie. I did miss this part. No, the, the zombies are pissing into the pool. And it is infecting. The, the, the virus is in the piss. Right? So that's how the... <laughs> that's how it's spreading. But for some reason, that guy is immune to it. Guys, I, I, the only conclusion I can come to is that the zombie piss virus enters through the vagina. It's the only thing that makes sense. That's the meme where it's like you, the, the guy gives up before hitting like the mother load on the other side, right?
And he's growing fruit in there? Okay. Man, if, if that game existed like that, it could actually be pretty cool. That kind of now now that kind of looks like um the Fallout mobile game. What was that? Remember that? Uh Vault Vault uh, something? Fallout Shelter. But like The idea that you have to like have water tiles and you could put the farm plots next to the water tiles, like that doesn't that 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 that, that could be cool. But I know this is not that game. This game does not is not anything like that. Space Monkey is a new viewer. Thank you for coming to check out the channel. Loving the zombie piss virus content. Oh, well, you're you're in the right place for zombie piss virus content. I get not that we've ever seen that before, but I'm I'm hoping we'll see it again. And also, Retro Dog, thank you for the gifts up to that person. Freak. Of course, making them a fresh freak. Thank you so much, Retro Dog. Last fortress. God, that looks like shit. Play free now. Did you hear it? Interesting to note that the horse who who's always fucking like, who's always cocking him by fucking his wife is in her, is in this woman's stomach as well right the horse is down here the cock horse guys she's a slime girl slime vor for the for the record fucking the gummy worms edited yes edited pillar john onto the fucking video Thank you, Gummy Worms. Thank you so much. How did you get sponsored by this game again? Hero, Hero Wars did not email me. They go through marketing companies. So the marketing company emailed me and they said, do you, and I had never heard of it before, by the way, just for the record. They emailed me and they said, do you want to do a sponsorship? I said, Give me more details. This is Hero Wars. It's a game called Hero Wars. We want you to... They gave me They gave me a number for what they wanted to pay me to stream it. I responded to it, and I told them I wanted more for something like that. And they agreed to it. So I did it. They also emailed FFAP. Do you think it was worth it? Um, in what way? The damage to my reputation having streamed that game? Do, do, do you think that's real? Someone in chat said, I thought less of you honestly. Somebody said, I didn't watch your streams for a week after that because it poisoned your brand. It poisoned your brand. So, in your mind, okay, in, 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 your, in your mind, because guys, if you're serious, then I can't do things like that. If, if that's real, then I can't do things like that anymore. Like, are you serious? You know, are you joking? Are you serious? Or was... Inverse, thank you for the gift subs. You're not serious. Okay. 
Wait, I have to tell you something. If you are serious, if if okay, if if anybody if anybody feels that way, but here here's here's my here's my mentality. Actually, here's my actual mentality. All right, here's the here's the truth of the situation, guys. Um, I'm staring down forty years old. And I have no savings. I don't own anything, and I'm about to lose my my Medicare. I'm fucking broke. I have no. I have nothing that's fucking mine. I I own nothing. When I do things like that, if you don't and, and and you don't like it, and you're gonna like leave my community as a result, if you if you're if you're gonna not watch me as a result because I because I do things like that, that's a net positive for me, because I am removing people. I don't want people like that in my life. Like, does that make sense? Like, I don't want people like that around me. If you're gonna if if that's your attitude, then I don't want you on this journey with me. So it, it's it actually it has also has that effect of like removing those people from my life. So it's I I get I get a bag, I get money, which I need to survive, unfortunately. That's that's life. You know, again, we we can't all be fucking XQC and Hassan and Jerma, we all, we can't all be that, you know. So I get money that helps me survive and 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 hopefully have some some fucking semblance of a future. And I eliminate people that are fucking worthless human beings from my life. I I trim the fat of like assholes from my community. So that's I hope that answers that person's question. It, the answer is yes. It's a win-win. The answer is yes. Because the people that I want around me, the people I want in my community, the people I want um, like watching my content and being a part of this, um, understand what that means that I have that I have to do. Why I would do something like that? You know, does that make sense? Um. And uh, we got some gift subs, man. Th thank you, Def Null. Thank you so much. Um, I see what you're saying, Fennec. I really appreciate it, buddy. Uh, and also War Boss Gegas. This is a fresh freak, freak who was inspired by my words, I suppose. Thank you so much, War Boss. Guys, let's get some dumpies in here for the War, War Boss. And also for Head Puppy, who has gifted 25 subs. Oh my god, guys. Aquaphobic Seal. Why are we getting a fuck? What is, what is all this shit? What is what is this? Thank you. Neo again, guys. Thank you so much. Oh my god. Um, Caddy with the gift sub, guys. Thank you. Oh, thank you, thank you so much, guys. Yeah, it's uh uh retirement money thank you i'm never going to why 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 would i retire from this this is this this is this isn't something you retire from you retire from streaming it's too fun right the only reason i would stop doing this is like i for some reason i physically can't but it, it's it's nice to have savings you know what i'm saying you know, obviously shahar thanks for 7 months bud and uh oh thank you for saying that um, Thunder Angie with the gift sub. Oh my gosh, you guys are too good right now. Puppy, thank you again. Head puppy gifted another twenty five. What the actual, actual fuck? Ronicles is gifting subs. What the fuck? <laughs> guys, thank you. Scroglio with the with the bits. Oh, uh, chat's worried about me. They're like, no, Grandpa's not gonna ha be able to pay his medical bills. Guys, you're too good. Purple stuff. Anna LRK, guys, thank you. 
Thank you. Uh, for the resubs. Zef with the gift subs. Guinea fowl with gift subs. What the fuck, guys? Guys, thank you so much. Uh, and chronologues. Uh, Anon, thank you. What the fuck? Guys, thank you so much. Uh, Guinea fowl. Zef, I want to make sure I'm not missing anybody here. Oh, there's so many. There's so much. Oh my god, Android priest. What did I did? What did I do? I just fucking bitched about being old and not having money. I, I didn't think. I, I guys, 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 guys. I, I come on. All right, thank you. But but seriously, it's it's good. It's good. I'm okay now. You could stop now. Holy fuck, that, guys. Thank you so much. Plastic squid, Android priest, nifty. Holy Christ. Oh, uh, you're making my you're you're warming the cockles of my ancient heart, chat. Thank you so much. Thank you. Roll a point. Roll a point. Thank you for the bits. They said I can't spare much, but please have this. Do me a favor, please. Please, you gotta do something for me, guys. Okay. And just like that, Mike decided to invest in NFTs. Shut up. You gotta do me a favor. Do not give me or any stream or any streamer money if you if you fucking can't afford to. Okay, please don't do that. Don't do that. Just just I'm gonna be okay. Yeah, I'm gonna be okay. I'm starving for you, Mike. It's for you. I'm doing it for you. Okay, real talk. Cass, uh, Cass Hangs, thanks for the sub. This is another fresh freak. freak. Thank you so much, man. Head Puppy with the bits. I, uh, thank you. I really appreciate it, guys. This is going to be very helpful to me, guys, obviously. Thank you. But listen, if you don't have money, if you don't have money and you want to support this channel, there are ways to do that. All right. Watch the sponsored streams. When I do, or, 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 did, well, watch them. Does he understand what I'm saying? Watch them. When I do when I when I do Twitch bounties, watch them. Watch them, guys. Thank you so much. Um, raise the CCV. Th this this person understands it. Yeah. Um, or like when it's one of those when it's one of those sponsorships with the when it's like they they want like they want to see people downloading and playing the game download and play the game but then for the love of god immediately delete it afterwards okay rico brahe thank you for 13 months thank you there are legit legitimate ways that you you can help me and this channel out a lot without actually spending money so i just yeah, keep that in mind. Shadow Fairy, again, thank you for the gifts up to Pogger Dinosaur. Thank you. Pogger, very Poggers. On related, uh, on related topic, a little bit of a segue here, kind of out of left field. But if you need to mute streams on Twitch, you can use the mute tab button in your browser instead of muting the stream to keep the viewer count counted and supporting the streamer. Is that how that works? I um You know what it is, guys? And I, I know I know I talk about this a lot, but it's because I think about this a lot. Basically, I fucked up my 20s so bad that now I'm at, at this at this stage in my life, I'm like scrambling to like fucking like fix the fuck up like i'm i'm trying to like 
I'm trying to make up for the, my 20s being a completely lost decade. You know what I'm saying? Um, and that and that's part of what motivates me. It's like you know, most people my age, or you know, I don't know some some people my age, like I got a fucking like I got a cousin who's my age. Listen to this. I just did this. I was thinking about this recently. I had a cousin my age. Worked for the sanitation department, right? Makes six figures, the sanitation department. Is gonna is gonna retire at forty. Listen, he's gonna retire when he turns forty, and he's gonna get a fat pension check every every fucking month for the rest of his life with full benefits. Guys, I could have did that. 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 But you know what I chose to do instead? Coke. And fucking smoking weed with Gamby. And fucking... Ba go going to bars like twice a week... And blowing every penny I made at my fucking, sh at, my, at, at my, like, you know, at my fucking, like, the loser jobs I was taking on booze and drugs. That was, uh, that was what I chose to do with my 20s. It's not for everyone or everyone would do it. I could have, I could have took that. I took the test. And I, th I, I think I passed it, if I remember correctly. Like they, 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 they do tests for that shit. I absolutely could have done that, but I just chose not to. I just fucking chose not to do that. I totally could have did that. My life would be completely different. Obviously, it would be a totally different life. But like, fuck, man. It doesn't help your dad. My, my dad, yeah, my dad was not. I bl could blame a lot of shit. I mean, you blame anything on your parents if you want. Mike, if you couldn't handle garbage, we wouldn't be here right now. Of course you could have. Of course you could have done it. Yeah, I mean, doming about your regrets won't do shit. No, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. I'm just saying that. Um, that's why I take fucking sponsorships, okay? Because these, these, these fucking people, like, like, he was saving money and shit, and he's gonna buy a house and all this shit. Regret is for trying. Slime girl tits is the thumbnail. Oh, him and the cuck horse are teaming up. I like how there I like how there's an exit arrow so you can like escape through her fucking like urethral passage or whatever. Was it urethral? I can't believe he's having this conversation with slime girl tits in the background. It just kind of it actually really ties it all together because it's like, well, I fucked around in my 20s and now this is my life. You know, I hope again, I hope I hope that 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 younger people that are watching this, like take some something away from this and be like, yeah, maybe I should stop fucking around. You know, like if you're fucking around like I was stop. OK, and no, don't 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 fucking glo don't don't glorify this shit. But Mike, I want to be like you when I when I grow up or whatever the fuck. No, stop. No, no, no. Stop. No. Millennials are America's lost generation. I, I, it's. Something like that, yeah. Yeah, yeah, really. Don't listen to him. Do coke now. Do not 
do coke. Do not. I want to grow up and be an epic gamer streamer with a super gamer house. Stop that shit. Grow up. There's so many, there's, there's, again, I, I mean, like, I mean, look, if you want to be a fucking content creator, just go for it. You know what I mean? Like, I, 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 but, 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 you know, you got to not be disappointed when it doesn't fucking work, dude. You know what I mean? Like, dude, there are so many fucking people that come out of nowhere. Like, there, there, there are people who have been streaming for like fucking two years that are like the biggest streamers. You know what I mean? Like, it happens. It happens. It's not impossible for that to happen. But, like, y y you gotta be... Whoop. Whoops. Y you... I, uh, it, it's, it's a long shot. It's almost like a lottery, really. A lot of it's luck, right? Just go into it understanding that it's extremely unlikely. Right? My, I started putting uh, money into a 401k because of you talking about it at this rate, I should have a million to retire on. That's cool and everything, but like, I don't know. I don't fucking trust it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't trust it. That's cool though. I, I feel like if I were to put money in a 401k, what would happen is like that shit would just implode. Like, I don't know, the 401k industry would just die because because Jabroni Mike bought one. You know what I'm saying? Like, like it would just, yeah, it would be, and it's gone. Like, as soon as I buy one, like, the entire industry would just fucking collapse because I bought one. Do high risk when you're young, low risk the older you get. That sounds like the type of shit boomers said to me that that caused me to lose thousands and thousands of dollars. So I I, I don't I don't I don't I don't fucking yeah like when I when I had money that was that was one of the things that that I fucking that, that I've told we talked about this we talked about this boom boomers said that shit to me and now fucking again it's not. Again, all the stocks I bought are just, they're just, they're, they're, I haven't sold anything. Like, it's just red. But it's like, man. I don't know. I don't, I, I think, I, I think all that shit is just getting more and more unreliable, frankly. I like getting advice from boomers, so I know what not to do. I don't know, man. Just, I'm not gonna, I, I can't give you fucking financial advice. You know what I mean? Like, do what you're going to do. I, but I don't know. I mean, I, I, I followed advice like that and got ass fucked. So I don't know what that, that's anecdotal, but. Exit through the vagina. That's it. It's just over. That's it. <laughs> Oh my god. Wife level 30. Level 1. The options were fight back or give up on life. <laughs> oh, he's leveling up himself. Father, the family business will be handed over to you. You must carry it forward. I was wrong. Marry me. Oh my god, that was like Fabiosa revenge porn type shit? Holy fuck. Right? Like... I, uh... That's fucking... Joker from per Persona? He turns into jo He turns into Joker. He's level 100 now. Marry me. Look at the... Someone in chat said the, the uh, human centipede of waifus. 
The girl on his leg is from the Wii U Fire Emblem X Shin Megami Tensei game. Oh, so these are just stolen assets, like, all across the board, huh? Who is the hottest hunter in your mind? Identity V. Who is the most handsome hunter in your mind? Who is the most handsome hunter in your mind? It's it, this is the that same game, the, the, the Tim Burton bullshit. Fuck this is fucking Edward Scissorhands. That's Edward Scissorhands. That's fucking Helena Bonham Carter, and that's the fucking guy from fucking Has Been Hotel. Okay. That's the fucking D David Bowie Has Been Hotel. David, I almost said a Habbo Hotel. Yeah, I did. Holy shit. My God, the Ripper has banquet. This is like monetizing thirst for like Tumblr sexy men. It's it's just the Azure Lane of Tumblr sexy men. Right? Like it's it's the opposite of uh of like, you know, big titty waifu. There's a licensed Edward Scissorhand skin in that game. No shit. Mike, did you get some productive shit done in your coke days? When I was in my coke days, actually, something like my mid to late 20s, I wrote something. I wrote a uh, um I wrote a uh, uh, a graphic novel. And I still think about it a lot. I might try I might go back to it. I might I might return to it and and like kind of rewrite it. I still have it, yeah. How much like Transmetropolitan was it? A, a lot, honestly. Honestly, a lot. Um, when was the last time I looked at it? It's been a couple of years since I looked at it. Um, do you mind explaining the synapses? I don't want to get into that right now, but I'm I'm thinking I might get used. To, I might I might I'm I've been thinking about it a lot lately and like wanting to get back to it. But like I also feel like want like just wanting to go work on it again. But I I feel like I just don't have the time, and I feel like. Part of the reason it doesn't exist is because I knew that I would that I would never I would never be able to like find somebody to do the art for it because I would ne I would never and I still would not be able to pay an artist what they're worth to create the art for this thing. Does that make sense? I volunteer. I know a lot of you were going to say you would want to do it, but I, I actually don't, I don't, I don't want to do, I don't want that. Like, I don't want to, because what it, re what it, re it, it's, it's extremely long and, and what it would require is it would, it would require so much labor and I would never be able to pay somebody the labor that I would never be able to pay somebody what they, they des would deserve for it. Does that make sense? You have a legion of artists who would do so if all you offered was beer and a dry shit nugget. I don't... I, I'm not comfortable with that. I'm not comfortable with fucking trying to get people to do... Especially when you talk about the amount of... The amount of things that would need to be... That would need to be drawn. The amount of... The, it, it would be hundreds and hundreds and hundreds. I, if The last time I did a page count on this thing, it was... It was 
it was like 1500 pages or something it would need like 1500 pages of, of fucking of, of art yeah and and like i'm not gonna fucking try to make somebody do that like because they like me you know i'm like fuck that no and I hate to fucking say this to you guys, and I, I know, I know, I know how a lot of you are going to react to this. I, I might want to learn how to use like an AI ge generator to make the art for it. Now I know what you're going to say. A lot of you are going to say, well, I will never, I will never read it then. A lot of you are going to say, I will never read it then. But it's going to be either that or it doesn't exist. Realist like, like, like realistically, honest to God, it's that or it doesn't exist. And that, that's, <clears throat> that, that's part of the reason why I've been thinking about it again. Because that, because that AI, those AI programs make it look like it makes it look like it, it could happen. Does that make sense? Um, because I can't I can't pay somebody to do that. And also, it's like it be it 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 becomes collaborative that way. It uses stolen art though. Then then this won't then then this won't exist. Then it won't exist. So I mean, like that. I mean that that's that's where it's at. It's not. It's not like like oh, well, Mike could have paid a real artist. You know, Mike could have paid a real artist to do this, and instead he chose to use AI. So he's a piece of shit. No, it just won't exist. Does that make sense? Like. Crowdfund it. I don't, I don't know. I, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Um, you could go for it once there's better policies and ethics in place when the things it's trained on aren't stolen. That's what the artists are lobbying for right now. My, listen, I don't have anything against real artists. I'm not like... You know, I, I, I'm not I'm not like a huge and I'm not like a huge proponent of this technology, like replacing artists or anything like that. But like. He's not saying he's going to sell it. He wants it to be real. And this is how it can feasibly happen. Hop off the AI hate train for a minute and listen. Yeah, some of, some of the AI hate stuff is like, it's, it's, it's fucking intense. It's intense. And like, I do understand some of it. I, 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 I understand most of it, frankly. I do. But, but it's like... It, it's, it's a reality that's not going anywhere. You know what I mean? Like it and it's and it's it's something that like also there's a level of collaboration that would go into it if I was like working with another like a part of me is feeling like like I don't necessarily want to work with another person. Like does that make sense? Like um My my idea for what should happen is like the, the people who want a cuz some people will will some artists will actually like want the opportunity to say yeah let your AI train on my art but I want to be paid for it. I think that should happen. I think the legal framework should be this. Artists should be able to opt into allowing an AI to train on their artwork. And if they do, they are going to receive payment for it. Um, and then if, if, it's, if it's determined that an AI did train on somebody's artwork without their consent, that's prosecutable. Mike is engaging in wrong think. Cancel him now.
there is there is a, a, a possibility. I'm not okay. I'm not against the crowdfund idea, but for right now, and again, I'm I'm, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna look, tr attempt this again for like I think a couple years. I do want to see where the technology goes. I want to see if it moves in a direction that where I yeah where I can be comfortable with using it and not feeling like it's I don't know exploiting somebody you know what I mean um but yeah that's that, that's that's I'm I'm not gonna start working on this again now, but I I want I I think probably within the next couple of years I am gonna I am gonna like start working on this again. And whether or not can you give us the name of it? I don't want to talk about it. Or I don't want to tell you anything about it because because I just not ready to do, not ready to. Um. All right. So fucking anyway. The Ripper counts banquet. I think that is that is the that is not the Edward Scissorhands skin that's in the game. Photographer Moonlit Gentleman. Photographer Moonlit Gentleman. Is she fucking okay? Broken blossoms. Choose the most handsome hunter in your mind. Dude, they all they all look like shit, frankly. I'm sorry to be like this. I don't want to be a hater, but they look like absolute balls. These fucking character designs are dog shit. Are people really shelling out big money to goon for these fucking things? Mike, she sounds like a family gal character. Yes, <laughs> she does. Choose the most handsome hunter. Also, the fucking music is a car commercial. Who is the most handsome hunter in your mind? Who is the most handsome hunter? The Chevy Twinkadero. Oh Sometimes a man just wants to butt fuck a tumbler sexy man twink. And sometimes he wants to be the bottom. You never know what a man is gonna want out of life. But that's why the fuckhole Congadero is the number one rated sports utility SUV in my asshole. Least one now with 0% APR financing in your fucking cockhole. Real men take it in the ass from sea to shining sea. My wife left me. And that's why I'm going to take a shit in the bed of this truck. Bro, look at her fat, delicious ass. What the fuck? Twerk race 3D. That's disgusting. How do I download it? Install now. Who's winning the twerk off race? Look at this fucking guy shitting up here. The water bottles make her ass smaller and the and the, the, the weights make her ass <laughs> That's fucked up. <laughs> Bro, please anally vor her. It'll be hilarious. Fail. Holy shit. Holy shit. Why is there a guy shitting in the corner? I think that's representing you playing the game. Mike, this is gross. Send me the 4K HD remaster. Mike, is that the kind of ass you like? All right, I'll I'll I'll, I'll show you where it's it starts getting ridiculous. All right, this is still this is awesome. That's that's perfect. That's better. That, okay, th this is starting to get, now it's starting to get a little ridiculous, right? Now it's starting, it's starting to get a little silly here. It's just starting to get a little silly here. All right.
Mike has an ass kink. It's not an ass kink, you fucks. Which one is your ideal? Loading. Yeah, I, I, fucking loading is right. There's going to be a lot of loading after this stream and I, when I fucking download this game. My ideal. Okay, I'll sh let, me, let me put it to you, let me put it to you this way. Okay, let me put it to you this way. This is is the minimum. This is the this is where this is the don't this is the minimum. Mike, open Google. Type in butts. You're welcome. Hyper S. Loading. Drag to move. Fuck. <laughs> My streamer is an ass freak. Holy shit. Who's your daddy? Fairy Rush Genetic Fusion. Uh-oh. Why is she walking like that? Oh, they procreated. Oh my goodness. Adults, da dating adults only. So that baby furry just became an adult in a couple of seconds? Oh, Nubsty with the gift subs. <laughs> Guys, thank you so fucking much, guys, for all the support tonight. I, I really appreciate it. Um, ma amazing. It really um, it helps out a lot, guys. Thank you. What if Jabroni Mike was named Jabroni Freak, and he liked big ass and didn't suck toes? That's Shrek? Guys, that was fucking deranged. Genetic fusion. Yeah, that's called fucking procreating. Why are they always so horny? Too hot. You can erase her clothes? Cool concept. Fun concept. Pop the balloons. What's he hiding? Guys, you think it's a boner? What is she hiding? Scare the girl. What is she hiding, guys? Is it, that's where it ends? What's going on here? It says, okay, the name of the video is, Yep, it's a mic stream. Perfect cream. Jeez, hope this is chocolate. All right, I'm starting this over. Yep, it's a mic stream. That's what it says. Guys, I think they were implying that it was not chocolate and that it might have been shit. I think they were implying that maybe it was poop. Could be poop. Oh, that is so fucked. That's how they get you to download it. Because they know that you're craving watching the unicorn spray liquid fucking shit out of rainbow shit out of his asshole. They know you're craving that, and and you, it's fucked that they don't fuck. That's so, this is the actually in 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 a lot of ways this is the most fucked up ad we watched tonight. Okay, not foot licking, not the armpit licking, not the fucking, you know, the vomiting or the or the fuck, not even the dead baby in the fucking washing machine, dude. This right here, 
for like blue balling you from seeing the unicorn poop. You know what I'm saying? Like perfect cream. Is perfect topping an easy task for you? Try and see. It's so soothingly cool. Master the controls and try to prove to everyone who is the chef. I, I believe this is the gameplay, right? Yep, it's a mic stream. Yep, it's solitaire. Bro, did it open with a fart? For no reason? A frosty fart. In the, uh, the cold winter air. Bro, Walter and Jesse cooked in the toilet. Dude, is that her frozen poop, though? That, someone cooked here. Dude, that was her frozen turds. <laughs> She's dead. <laughs> Bro, she also didn't pull her fucking skirt up. Right? She also did. She's again, she's just shitting in her skirt. <laughs> the banana hammock, right? What, we, what was it called, Herg? The poop, ha the poop hammock. You can save girl's life, it says. He is my crush. It's this bitch again. What am I to you? BFF? You never loved me. The fucking insanely long hair, dude. What is, what is, what is that? What is with the, their fucking hair all the time? <laughs> That commercial was me made no sense. It was meaningless. Guys, this was like a roll call of all the shitty characters from all these commercials. What? Guys, what's wrong with his body? Like, what? Like, what's that? Like, is he okay? What is that? Motherfucker's built like the Michelin tire guy. Dude, be bend him in bed. He's got Zoidberg's body. That's what Zoidberg looks like with the shirt off, yeah. Is that the head of his penis peeking out? The motherfucker's got a carapace. He's got a fucking carapace, dude. That that's the woman who was enjoying, who was like getting horny from getting her armpit licked before. <laughs> the deepest lore. Yummy bugs face mask. Okay, you get what you get. Oh, she ain't gonna be living in the pod anytime soon.
She made a face mask with dead bugs and put it on her face, and it gave her like acne. Zip her pants. Yeah, that's the set. That's the onomatopoeia for knocking on a door, right? Dong, 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 dong. Do no, you, that's when you ring the doorbell, dickhead. Dong, 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 when he knocked on the door. Fucking... Prank. So is this the thing like soaping up the zipper helps you close it? How did that make her makeup? Her makeup ran because she tripped? Dude, it's almost like this is the game they want to fucking make. Why don't they just make this fucking game instead of fucking making a Candy Crush clone that nobody wants to fucking play? Like, make this game. Obviously, people are interested in this. Make this game. Make this fucking game. Like, stop pretending that the, that the, the game you are making is this one and just make this game. Because that would take be take effort. More effort than a fucking Candy Crush clone? Actually, yes. Game development's hard. Yes, more effort than a Candy Crush clone. Like, what happened with all the Candy Crush clones? Did the Candy Crush, like, leak their fucking source code or something and just didn't care? Does, ca does Candy Crush sell their, their, their source code? Like, what's... A Candy Crush co clone can be made in a day. Easy to code. It's a simple game to recreate. Candy Crush was already great value, Bejeweled. Right, Bejeweled. That's crazy. I forgot the existence of Bejeweled. And just, like, replaced it with Candy Crush in my mind. That's fucked. And that's exactly what they wanted. Isn't it? I, I I actually used to play Bejeweled quite a bit when I was younger, yeah. Memory hold. Bejeweled just got like memory hold, dude. The nonstop ads are working. What's up, S'more? Thanks for coming to check out the channel, man. Yes, no, they they are. They There's a reason these people have advertising budgets of millions and millions of dollars. It's because it works, right? A bejeweled stream? Guys. We're gonna play Project Make. I'm gonna I'm gonna install Project Makeover right now. We're 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 gonna see what this game actually fucking actually fu actually is. Project Makeover. It's got four point three stars, millions of installs. Wait for a sponsorship? No, they're not. They're, they're, they, they, this, this, this. No. I'm not going to get a sponsorship for Project Makeover, dude. They, would, they wouldn't offer me one. Not for this game. They might not even do sponsorships, though. To use this game, you must agree to the terms of service and the privacy policy. Press continue to agree and start using this game. You know, the game where you played as a weird sperm that, like, kidnapped children didn't have a privacy policy agreement. Why don't you agree to the tip of my cuck? Read the terms of service. You think it's what do you what do you think is in there? It's, it's fucking. It's it's taking me off the. Uh, it's taking me to a website and I gotta like log into something. I think I gotta log into like my Google Plus account and all this fucking shit. I don't wanna. We can use all your data for everything forever. It might not be worth signing away my fucking, my, 
mortal soul to look at a Candy Crush clone for like four minutes, right? 99% gibberish. One actual agreeing to crypto miner install. But it's a meme, do it. Okay. That checks out. We're the crew of inner beauty. But our director Greta makes people feel bad about themselves. Oh. We need your help. Please join Project Makeover as our new director. Hi Fi Rush. <laughs> <laughs> Project Makeover Spring Fashion Greta Van Dieter Another homely nobody in desperate need of a makeover I'm sorry girl Even I Greta Van Dieter International makeover expert Cannot fix your disaster You're ugly for life Alright well the characters look like the characters that's enough, Greta. This show is about helping people. We found a new director. Yeah, that was the stink girl. Who's the nameless, fameless fool who thinks they can replace the likes of me? Oh, you know, you oh, you know what his name is, baby. Oh, you know it, baby. Come chugger. What kind of name is that? That's not avant-garde. I'm leaving. You've not heard the last of Greta Von Detta. Don't worry, sweetie. Cum chugger is the best in the industry, regardless of what Greta thinks. Please help me, cum chugger. I just graduated and I'm about to start my first job. I'm not ready to be a real grown-up. Don't worry. Cum chugger has a plan. Okay. Here is a plan, a three-part makeover to help her achieve her dreams. This button will show you what we need to do. Let's start with hair and makeup. Wait a minute. Some makeovers cost coins. Let's spend some coins and remove the giant glasses. I'm, I'm worried this is going to show you guys my credit card number. Welcome to my salon where dreams come true. First things first, let's lose the reading glasses so we can see those beautiful baby blues. Because everybody knows you can't be hot while wearing glasses. Because everybody fucking knows. Every fucking 90s teen movie will, will teach you. That people only start to look hot when their glasses come off. Where is the poop? Where is the feet? Where is the guy deep tonguing an armpit? Where is everything I was promised by the advertisements? We need coins to do makeovers. Let's play a level and earn more coins. And this is where it becomes shitty Candy Crush. Swap colors to match three of the same color in a row. Wow, it's really just Candy Crush. Fabulous. Fabulous. Oh, is that gonna like blow up? Like what? Oh, and then it just it the game plays itself for you. Chic. Chic. The Iron Chic. Break his back and fuck his ass and make him humble. Wow, I did a thing. I think, look at that. Man, how, how rewarding. Please, please don't show them my credit card number. And fucking social security number. You earn some coins, let's use them to tame the hair. Use a look that fits her cum chugger. Romantic bun. Guys, why does this fucking feel like a Wii game? Is it the music? Also, do they kind of look she do they kind of look like me's? Not, uh, not me's. Wii sports characters. 
Mute the music and graphics. Yeah, yeah. Is that me in the mirror? Don't act so surprised. Next, a little wake up. It's fucking holy shit. All right. Fuck off. We get it. Guys, I'm going to say it again. Thank you for being here tonight. Thank you for watching. Um we're going to there's no there's no there's no more advertisements. Let's say thank you to Gummy Worms for putting together the 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 fucking awesome pack for us to watch. Gummy Worms, that was awesome if you're still here. Really appreciate it. I had a really fun time with this. I hope we could do this again, maybe? God knows we're not we're never going to run out of fucking mobile ads. Uh, and guys, thank you again for watching and uh, and being here. Revoltingly entertaining. It was not good. Um, but we had fun. You could put together another pack. Gummy Worms, you fucking rule. Lily's Garden is next. I'm going to see if me and Rev can watch that on uh, next Monday. Um... But yeah, guys, thank you so much for being here. And thank you so much for supporting. Like, holy shit, all the gift subs tonight. Um, you guys are just, you guys are so good. Thank you, everybody. Uh, I, I really appreciate all the support. And um, again, one more time, just if you're new to the channel, um, please check out the links that I posted in the chat. Just my social media stuff, my YouTube channels, which are... Um, you know, uh, subscribe, like, and subscribe for, for more uh, of your favorite, uh, for more such beautiful sing-song rhymes. Um, also, there's a link to my Patreon, Ko-Fi, if you want to support me that way. If you don't like Twitch for some reason, a lot of people don't like to, uh, you know, give money to Amazon, whatever, whatever, whatever it is. Also, Discord. Guys, use the Discord link. You will never miss a stream again, and you will be welcomed into a beautiful community. With open, open asses. Nope, that, not that. Um, open arms. Layla. Thank you for three months. Appreciate that. Um, me scared of dick cord. Don't be scared of dick cord. Be scared of missing jabroni mic streams by not being in the dick cord and not getting daily stream notifications. What am I going to do? Don't leave yet because we're going to look at art, guys. What am I going to do tomorrow? I may not stream tomorrow. But if I do stream tomorrow, it's going to be a little bit later than usual. And I think it's going to be Jurassic Park. Guys, tomorrow night we're going to finish our park. We're going to get a couple more dinosaurs. We're going to clone some more dinosaurs. One more round of cloning all the dinosaurs. And then I am going to demolish 50% of the walls in the park. I'm going to make a save file. I'll make a save file. And then I'm going to start demolishing the fucking walls. And whatever happens, happens. Chaos theory. Fucking, uh... What's his fucking name? Je Jeff Goldblum will be so proud. Start with the herbivores? Oh, no, no, no. Everybody's gonna be an equal opportunity employer. It, we're gonna... Everybody's gonna get a chance for carnage. And you know what else is gonna be interesting about that? There's going to be more chat fights because you're going to have like, like fucking like Triceratops like versus T-Rex and shit like that. So there's going to be a lot more co fucking carnage and fucking dinosaur fights. As the different species fucking start beefing with each other. Will there be predictions on who wins? You betcha. You betcha. We're going to do tons of predictions. A lot of people are going to get eaten. Um, and then, guys, I should have said this earlier. But I think Wednesday, 
we're going to do a finger family. Why are we going to do a finger family on Wednesday, chat, and not Friday? You tell me. Because I want to play fucking Zelda Friday. That's why. So it'll be a finger family Wednesday. All right. Um, we gonna be playing that damn dare new Zelda. We're gonna be playing that damn dare new Zelda. That's right. That new, the new, that new fangled Zelda game. <laughs> That new Zelda there. Not to be rude, but nobody's going to watch you play Zelda because we'll all be busy playing Zelda. Okay, so then I won't stream it. I love how Chad thinks like like that their opinion or like what they're going to do is what everybody's going to do. Like I'm this, so I think this is true for everybody. Highlight and area. I, I think a lot of people are going to be skipping the streams because they're playing it themselves. But I also think a lot of people will, will not be doing that. And I'll be streaming the game for those people. Right? Of course. Um... I'll be, there, there will be people who will be watching it regardless of the fact that they're playing it. And there will be people who will not be playing the game themselves who may be interested in seeing me stream it. And there will be potentially new people who are interested in the game and find my channel through the Tears of the Kingdom Twitch category. And I'll be um, streaming it for those people. Um, I'm taking a look at the art right now and i'm seeing some real deranged shit um let's start with this one from pan lemon uh this is not a bit of course it is the demon mic that we saw in the webcam before fucking awesome as he bleeds from his eyes and mouth profuse this is fucking amazing horrifying absolutely horrifying i'm telling you that that image is so fucked like literally like why did it look like the, it was this, a jabroni mike sleep paralysis demon seriously oh we also got this from seventh sevens in, invaded by dark spirit jabroni mike little dark souls take on it i love the art this this shit inspired right Holy shit. All right. Um, thank you, Sevens. Uh, we also got... <laughs> Who remembers this video from You Laugh, You Lose last time? Hey, man, I got you a sack of shit there, dude. You enjoy that, bro. It's good shit. Tight. Tight. I like shit. Damn, man, this isn't shit. Huh, man, it's chocolate. <laughs> yeah, guinea fowl, this fucking rules. Thank you so much. Oh, that's great. Wait a minute, this isn't shit. <laughs> we also got this from Primal Screen Guy. It is, uh, again, that... Um, that demon mic. Look at that. Fuck. He is spooky as hell. The demon, the ghost in the machine here. Yeah, that uh that demon mic, man. That could be that, that that's gonna be like a fun new character, huh? Don't watch Jabroni Mike at 3 a.m. Uh, we also got thank you, screen guy. From Lizzie. We got the um Either Shorts or Hork. Literally just like some fucking 
deranged taxidermy type shit here. Okay. Uh, we got the, sh the shark in the front, the horse in the back. Demon Lord Michael of the Voreth Circle. Indeed, and this is his mighty steed, the Hork. What's funnier, Shorts or Hork? I can't, I, they're, they're both very funny words. Man, just like... You'd have to try pretty hard to think of a worse idea for an animal than this. Like, nothing about this thing works, man. Like, absolutely, like, no part of this is fuck, fucking works. How would it live? I, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's, it's very, very, very bad. Like, like, how, again, how are you... Cat giraffe. No, cat giraffe is better than this. Mike, be nice. What if the shorts said that about you? That's fair. He's right behind me, isn't he? Just a fucking horrible idea for a... Even a even as a mythical creature, this just fucking sucks. Like, it's not even cool. <laughs> it's just... One of the worst combos you could fucking imagine. It's it's like it's like peanut butter and caviar. Like fucking Christ. Um How about this one? From Rollaby. Mike, that Joel Joel regularly eats that. <laughs> Mike, that's school lunch in Sweden. Fez, thanks for 11 months. Uh, we got this from Rollaby. Uh, it will be fine. It'll be fine, guys. Everybody's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be okay, chat. As long as we got each other. It's all gonna be okay, guys. We're gonna get through this together. Love each other. This art is adorable, Roller B. Thank you so much. Each other, each other deserves love and affection. Um, we also got a couple of videos here. Uh, let's start with this one from Sazabi. Find out what's going on here. Says, Jabroni Mike sensing a negative comment from across the galaxy. Out of duty, she turned her back on her own comrades. A lesser woman would have been crushed by such a birth. What planet is that? She intentionally threw the final fight, and it still took Mike three tries. Future generations will revile her. It's two, asshole. <laughs> it was two. Oh my god. Very nice though, Sazabi. Uh very fun little trip down uh memory lane there. Um which was that that happened what, what was that stream Saturday? Um we also got this from oh boy, from Kev Bomb. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, here we fucking go. Cleveland Brown, and I am proud to be right back in my hometown with my new family. There's old friends and new friends keep it the bear. Good times and bad times, mustache and sweet limb. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? 
What happened at the end? <laughs> what the fuck happened? <laughs> what happened? Kev, this is, uh, actually... <laughs> Uh, you did a really good job. Uh, if, if, I mean, a good job, you know. Holy fuck. He says mustache and Cleveland. Right, cause, cause it was too long, so you cut, you like shortened it. Oh wow! <laughs> also, Cleveland rhymes with Stephen. <laughs> Look at this fucking art. That you, you made th this. This person made that. This person spent fucking like time to make this. Guys, fuck that sucks. <laughs> Dude, I think this gave me cancer. Like, that's why I started coughing. Like, I got cancer from this. Holy fucking shit. Dude, the logo! The logo! The logo! <laughs> fuck! Michael after not surviving. Holy shit. <laughs> Fucking Christ. My name is Cleveland Brown. And I am <laughs> He's so fucking bad. Oh my god. Oh, you coughing up them tumors? Laughter really is the best medicine. Chat wants a link to this. All right. It's right here. Enjoy. All right, guys. I'm going to see you tomorrow night, like I said, for I think some Jurassic Park. So, again, thank you so much for being here, guys. And uh, sharing this lovely evening with me. And thanks for welcoming, welcoming me into your homes and living rooms and bedrooms and your computer room. Computer rooms! And uh, choosing to uh, share your, your Monday night with me here. Uh, really means a lot, guys. Thank you so much. And thanks again for all the support. You guys are fucking cool as hell with all those all those gift subs. That was crazy. Engagement question. Um, I fucking god, I can't think of one. Um, have, do you have an armpit licking fetish? Let us know in the comments below. Actually, don't. You're welcome in my web zone anytime, guys. Thank you for coming to my web zone. And guys, again, thanks for uh, yeah, uh, 50k follows on Twitch. Really cool. What I what is your ideal hyper ass size? Let us know in the comments below. <laughs> Hi, friends. Did you have a lot of fun with the videos? Do you want more? Subscribe to our channel to have more fun with me. Click here to continue watching more such beautiful sing-song rhymes. <laughs> oh.